incredibly hard to inspire you and bring you lots of exciting ideas and projects. So whatever your creative needs, you know that our crafting family will be there for you. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Owning a strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates for items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from Jewelry Maker. Our brand new Get Started with Jewelry Maker page has been created to provide help and guidance for jewelry making newbies. If you need design suggestions, hints and tips, or help with perfecting your jewelry designs, we're here to help. Head over to facebook.com slash get started with JM where our talented in-house designers are happy to answer your jewelry making questions, offer inspiration and get you started in your jewelry making journey. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Order from us today at www.jewelrymaker.com. Oh yeah, work it. Grapevine to the left. <laughs> Grapevine to the right. Yeah, that's enough. That's enough. Uh, thank you, Hannah. Oh, bless her. How lovely. I've not seen Hannah for ages and ages and ages. In fact, Hannah said, oh, how has it been married? Uh, it, it'll be a year tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow, <laughs> not tomorrow. A year next month. So that's how long it is since I've seen the gorgeous Hannah. Uh, thank you so much for joining us this evening. It is sports day here today at Jury Make. So any kind of sport you can think of, really. Um, I've been doing a bit of research into random sports. There are some amazing random sports sports out there. Cheese rolling does actually qualify as a, as a random sport, that one you've probably heard of. Uh, there's, there's quite a lot out there actually. There is quite a lot out there. We'll explore some of those a bit later on. I've got a wobbly chair going on. Could that be a sport? Oh. Wobbly chair? Who stays on the wobbly chair the longest? Possibly. Uh, my name's Ruth. I'm going to take you through the next for us. Look at me. I've got, I've got a glow on already. It's my headband. It's a bit... I don't know how long we give the headband, but it's okay because... In just three hours' time, the kit you're going to get, love it, love it, love it, features some fabulous headpieces, some beautiful tiaras and combs. So I think in the 9 o'clock hour, maybe even in the 8 o'clock hour, the, uh, the headband may have to disappear, and I think I might have to just wear a tiara. It's not every day a girl gets to wear a tiara, is it? So we might just do that. And we've got the glorious Karen with us, and it's the first time we've met, isn't it? It is. First it is. time we've worked yes, together. It is, and we've had a really good race around the car park. We have. We did about 15 laps, didn't we? No. <laughs> <laughs> Not a chance. <laughs> we, look, we, we did it with our eyes, though, didn't yeah, we? Yeah, we did. We thought about it, yeah. And we were really tired after we thought we could have exactly. done that and we didn't. We thought we might make it real, you see, and come on, having you know, a bit red, red A bit cheeks. really glowy, yes. And then we went, no. we looked at each other and went, no. no. <laughs> no, I'm going to like you. <laughs> we've got some lovely kits for you tonight. That, oh, some cool air as well. It's gorgeous. Uh, we've got some amazing, amazing kits for you today, though. Some really fabulous kits. Um, first place kit, obviously, because, you know, I, I don't do second. Uh, and we've got a Ladies' Day kit coming up for you as well. Both fabulous. And we've got lowest price ever show today. Very, very nice. Starting with pearls. So... Take a rest, have a chill, sit down, relax, and enjoy the show tonight, because it's going to be fab. So, are we ready? I was going to go, but that would be really loud if I blew on the whistle now, wouldn't it? Yeah. That's all I do. <laughs> don't, like, don't like that, Mike. Suddenly all the dogs come from miles around. <laughs> uh, right, I'll keep this on for as long as my microphone can take it, because I've got a feeling that might be a bit of a clatter. Uh, right, come on. 
Let's do it. So lowest ever oh, on pearls. What a way to start the show. What a way. Multicolour freshwater cultured potato pearls. They're a very good size. I might move my armbands up. A, my arm, they're not armbands, are they? That's be water wings. <laughs> <laughs> Wrist and we're not bands. swimming. We're not swimming. Can you imagine if we had to wear a swimming hat and goggles and nose peg? Uh, That's what I wear when I go swimming. I wouldn't swimming. be doing this show. <laughs> no, I wouldn't. I wouldn't. No. No. My sister wants photographic evidence of me when I go swimming. I'm like, no, not happening. Uh, lowest price ever coming up for you now. On your multicolour freshwater pearls, 9 by 10 and 10 by 12 millimetres. 40 centimetre strand, an entire 40 centimetre. And look at the colours, they're so pretty. You've got the peaches and the creams here, you've got the lilacs, the lavenders, lowest price ever coming in on these. Bre previously, hmm, previously, don't know what I was going to say there, previously in at 21.95. Not doing that today, not doing that. We've got some of the lowest prices ever coming for you. Uh, so we're going to take a bit of a nosedive on this for you, diving in. Uh, and actually belly flopping apparently is a random sport, the art of belly flopping. Sounds a bit painful. Natural pearls, £15.95, lowest ever price. And the colours are just gorgeous, aren't they? It's about the quality, it's about the calibre of the pearls that you're seeing here. Why not treat yourself today? Grab hold of these. They're so pretty. They're a lovely size. You've got the most amazing luster. And here you are charging in, charging in at £15.95, lowest price ever. We've been given carte blanche to do this. We've had the approval. We've had the tick from the man from above. And he said, do it, go for it. So $15.95. Well, he is, isn't he? 0806 655. Georgina, Sheila, Tina, well done. Greater London, phenomenal work. You are going to need to be speedy tonight. What a cracking price They're that is. They're beautiful as well. What lovely colours. And Aren't they? An absolutely brilliant size. Yeah, br really, br really useful nice. size, yeah. Yeah, they are, because they're not, they're not tiddlers by a long no, shot. They're no. really good size. And because you've got the potato shape as well, yeah. I think it just gives you that little, little sort of edge. More of an impact. Pretty. They're lovely. Yeah, yeah, I think so. I like Absolutely. It. And at fifteen ninety five, goodness me, it's a good saving. That is really, really good saving. And don't forget, they are natural pearls, which is phenomenal. I'll hold those up to my neckline very, very quickly. There we go. So you can see those. They work well with a whistle, don't they? Fifteen ninety five. <laughs> So pretty, very demure. If you're thinking perhaps about going to a garden party, going to uh, your friend's uh, perhaps birthday party, they're really, really special. Colour on those is just fabulous. Um, Ruth, you look stunning. Not for get away. <laughs> get away with you. I wish, I wish. No, let's be honest. I feel, I feel like I should be in an 80s throwback type film right now with my flash dance uh, flash dance. <laughs> yeah not with my spine <laughs> <laughs> okay you're very sweet thank you uh 15 and 95 on those 0800 644 655 well what a feeling just thought i'd work that one in oh, nice one yeah, they are lovely, but they do feel beautiful. Gorgeous, gorgeous colour. Jilly Susie Watsit. I was just rereading that. That's a great name. I like that. Jilly Susie Watsit. Uh, $15.95. Beautiful. Keep adding names to your basket. And if you are just joining us this evening, great job because we're going to go, we're going to see some of the lowest prices tonight. So very exciting. Very exciting. Uh, eight left. That's all we've got now. These are flying out. Very, very pretty. <laughs> go on. Go on. I love it. I love it. Here we go. Ruth, <laughs> Ruth looks like a lollipop lady who's gone to the gym with those neons. <laughs> Do you know what? I think I'd make a cracking lollipop lady because they'd see me, wouldn't they? Six they wouldn't really miss standing you, yeah. by the. I think yeah. that'd be great. Yeah. I, wouldn't, I almost wouldn't need the lollipop. I think this should, yeah, I might do that. I think they must get tired holding the lollipop at some stage. Although they don't, it's not like they've got to hold it in the air, Mike, is it? It is actually grounded. That'd be a bit different if they had to wave it. <laughs> I love that comment. That's made me giggle. Uh, <laughs> 6 We did think about the leotards and thought, Do you know, it's too much, no. those. Too much. Uh, Jewelrymaker.com, very well done on the web. Congratulations to you on the phone lines. Brilliant. Congratulations. They're going to sell out, of course they are. Nice start, nice start on those. Oh, now let's go for something very beautiful. Yeah, I think you should, Phil. I think you should. We said lowest price ever uh, on loads of these pieces in this hour. We're still doing it. Uh, I think we are going to be unstoppable tonight. Why not? 360 carats, lapis lazuli, always a fantastic gemstone. 
no need to, to, to move on price at all whenever you see lapis. Uh, huge carat weight, 360 carats, but extremely rare gemstone. Very, very rare gemstone indeed. Um, and that is a hefty carat weight. You've got a lot of gems on there. It's 38 centimetre strand. I would count them all, but I don't know if, uh, if my counting's that quick, but there's a heck of a lot on there. And you've got also, of course, the, the gold flashes, obviously, that you always see within your lapis lazuli are very, very strong indeed. Love the rondelles. And again, a nice big size, aren't they? Oh, I do. There's something very safe about it, something that you yeah. really know, but it's, it's very such a, such a lovely, rich colour. It is, isn't it? Always what makes you, me smile. And what do you think about that price, then? Because I know you've not looked at the screen. Oh, whoa. <laughs> Four ninety-five. That's incredible, isn't it? Mm. That is it. I'm going to give them a quick count. Two, four, six, eight, ten... 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30. I won't give them all a count, but if I double that around, 30, 60, 2, 4, 6, 8. You've got way over 74, 76 gemstones on there. That's immense. That is immense. That would be about six and a half pence each in that case. Great maths there, Phil. Well done. Uh, Georgina Sylvie, Shona Rosemary. It is an ancient gem. It's a gem we've had for many, many years. A gemstone that we used, to, used in paintings for many years as well. They used to grind it down and, and paint with the gem as an oil. But uh, and if you've been to Rome, you see it, don't you, in the Hall of, uh, Hall of Maps. I love it. And it does glitter. You've got that glorious gold flash, the sort of the pyrite inclusions within there. At the pyrite price, it seems, at £4.95. Bottom. Uh, and first place, definitely for a strand like that, I would say. Karen, nice to see you there as well. Congratulations. I mean, even just as a stretchy, if we go dead simple, I always go back to the stretches. It's a safe place to be, but it's a great place to be. Just a couple of sort of gold spaces in there as well, and that's going to look absolutely fantastic. You know, I'm just looking at these. I want to adorn these. I'm looking at them thinking, we should have... Oh, seed... I'd have gone seed, seed beads. Seed beads. Right, there, do you want you? some? Yeah. <laughs> you sit there saying Shall I fling you one? That would be your challenge tonight, <laughs> just to see how you can uh, bling up my coughs. <laughs> 4 95 very very well done hi pip nice to see you there sandra stella julie lovely price on those i mean that is a bargain and a half isn't it we're going to give you some of the lowest prices tonight so stick with me uh, and we're going to absolutely run the gauntlet on these deals today they're fab they're flying out obviously at a price like that they're all going to sell so very very well done indeed on those and don't forget Add on your certificate of authenticity, 25 pence for a strand like that, why, why not? Uh, especially if you are thinking, obviously, of selling your jewellery on, then you've got that certificate there with you. You can get a couple, actually, if you want to. If you are thinking of sending out your designs as commissions, then why not? Fabulous. Very well done indeed on those. We say bye-bye, because they're going to fly out. Um, right, next up, let's do... Uh, where? Oh, these are glorious as well. I do love my pearls. I love pearls. They just, and I think regardless of whatever colour, whether you go yes. for the classic white, the creams, or the darker sort of tones, the black pearls, or the Titian colours, amazing. 11 left, that's it. Lowest price. We need a little jingle for that, don't we, really? Lowest price, lowest price. They're a lovely colour. Sorry, Mike was just singing to me then. They <laughs> what, are a lovely really? colour. What was that little ditty again, Mike? Go on. You can't remember it, can you? That's all right. Lowest, go on, go on. Lowest price, lowest price. Guaranteed on these pearls every day you'll see. That's rubbish. Is it just made that up? Yeah, he did okay. make that up. It was better the first time round, I think. I think it rhymed the first time round. <laughs> yeah, note to self, never ask Mike twice. Um, black freshwater cultured pearls but the colors you can't call them black really you've got this metallic blue this petrol hue this wonderful mm. sort of peacock hue in there as well yeah the... and again a lovely nice really workable size on these they'd work really nice with your pink pearls actually just looking at mm, those the shell pearls from the kit yeah. yeah the shell pearls in the kit these would look absolutely beautiful i'm just gonna grab those if i can sorry there we go look at those oh that works it's but... a great contrast actually yes. isn't it neither of them overpowers the other because they're no. quite strong colors yeah, they look really nice together. So get ready for those because those shell pearls are coming up in the kit. I'll put those back over there. Uh, so seven pounds oh. ninety-five on those pearls. We're going to count these out because people are multi-buying as well. Uh, so we're going to have to keep up with you on that one. But the colours are wonderful, and you can see that incredible shimmer, that metallic luster that you're getting on the pearls, which is so fabulous. Lots and lots and lots of lowest priced ever's uh, coming up for you. That's not easy to say. Lowest price ever's. Lowest prices. Ever. That's probably because it was wrong English. <laughs> Five last chance. It's sports day, not grammar day. Hey, hey, do you know what, Karen? I love you. Exactly. <laughs> Have that one, Mike. It's not grammar day, it's sports day. 
Five last chances at £7.95. Phenomenal, phenomenal deal on that one. Very, very best of luck indeed. Gorgeous, because they're going to be gone. Gone. What was your favourite sport? Did you have a favourite? Were you very, you weren't, you didn't like, like I said, that face just <laughs> told me everything then. <laughs> no. Not your thing. No. I was good at hitting things and throwing things. Did you tell your husband that before you married him? <laughs> no, no, no. He's found out since. But running, not a chance. No. Jumping, not a chance. Oh, that's all Sports right. was my least favourite subject. I hated it. And when I got this theme for today, my husband just cracked up laughing. Oh, bless. You? Sports? That's a joke. Not yeah. your thing? No. Oh, bless. No. What about you, Toby? I bet you were sporty, weren't you? I always did long jump or high jump. Long jump or high jump? I never yeah, did I long jump still, or high jump, yeah. funnily enough. Always won. Yeah, oh. I never lost a, a hundred meter sprint or an obstacle race. Never. Did you mean? Did you run the marathon? Not London, Manchester. Which one? Manchester marathon. How long's that? Normal. Ah, that was a joke. It's a marathon. I know. No. <laughs> 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 Give me a second with it. Might be a blonde buff. <laughs> Do you know what <laughs> Doesn't I mean? mean? Do you know what I mean? <laughs> right. Oh goodness me. How long's a hundred meter sprint? No, is it right? Next up, <laughs> number eight. <laughs> Deary me. Deary me. Yeah, Mar I wasn't good at long distance running. I think nah. I lost interest. But a good a good 100 metre sprint. I lost interest at the start. No. Did you? <laughs> no, I'm not I won't doing that. Nah. 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 Uh, 30 carats of fancy jasper. Lovely size on these four millimetre rounds. Really workable and really useful. <gasps> um, I think this might be one of the lowest prices I've ever seen on the strand, personally, that I've ever brought to you um, at a price like that. So it's not going to be 4 95 because we've had that. Well, Oops. How cool is that? 195. Go for it. Go for it. You're out of the starting gates. Run. Go <laughs> to the phone lines. Get to the web and pop them in your basket. At 195, you, that's kind of just add to your stash time. I was just going to say, you just get multi buy and yeah. you've got a really good selection because the colours are beautiful. They're lovely, so aren't many they? different colours that you can use with other different coloured stones. Yeah, and quite earthy, quite organic, mm. very natural sort of feel on those. Uh, Somerset Cheshire, people are buying for reason too, so very, very well done indeed. Uh, 195 on that, and it's a standard strand, you know, we've not just, we've not skimped on that. It's still 38 centimetre strand. So with four millimetre rounds, you've got quite a lot of gemstones packed onto there. Uh, whether you pick out the emerald greens, the apricots, the golds, the browns, whichever tone you wish to go for it's 195 it's real genuine jasper uh, i think that's an absolute bargain somewhere lovely maybe to start off uh, with your jewelry with, with with your gemstones if you want to start working with the four mills very very beautiful loads of you welcome this evening lovely to have you there uh, monica rachel wendy stephanie winifred jackie 10 left that's it who's going to grab them uh, loads of you multi-buying well done tanya candy congratulations to you on this one 195 we are going to need an energy drink soon aren't we do you know i've just remembered i, I bought an energy drink and I left it at home in the fridge. Well, that's not much use. <laughs> no, it's not really. No, I don't right. normally drink them to be fair. I just thought, you know, well, sports day, we might need a bit of extra. Uh, so, one and 95 on those, 800, 644, 655. Very, very, very beautiful. Very well done. Congratulations. Lovely job. Really nice. <gasps> It is busy tonight. Right, let's do. Where are you? Oh, rose gold. Are you a roll? A I roll like rolls? I like rose gold. I love rose gold. It's so pretty, isn't it? Yeah. I think for me, oh gosh, this is very nice actually. There's something really warm, really homely about rose gold. It kind of, I don't know why. It, well, I guess the first piece of jewelry I ever had was from my nan, and it was a cameo, and it was in rose gold. So I think for me, there's something really personal, really lovely about rose gold. My um, my mum's mum, who died when my mum was only 14, had a rose gold wedding ring. Oh. But it was called Welsh gold because it was the, the gold was yeah. from. Um, and my mum gave it to me, and then when I made my wedding ring, I did it in sections of red, white. And yellow gold, so I've got oh. rose, uh, rose gold, rose, gold, rose yeah. yellow and white, so I've got little elements of it in there, beautiful. so but well, rose is gold is beautiful. Yeah, it is, it's, it's, it's so flattering on the skin tone, yeah. it yes. is soft. Yeah. Well, you've got the two-tone thing happening here actually, the two-tone rose gold plated and then you've got that over the sterling silver, so you've got the sterling silver and you can see the sterling silver sort of junctions coming through on the tubes, then you've got that beautiful rose coming through. Uh, again, some of the lowest prices you're seeing tonight, we've got 46 centimetres, so that's an eight inch chain at 7 95 that price dropped right down that is an absolute giveaway that is absolutely that make you 
jump then. Indeed, you didn't know what it was. <laughs> Bless you. Uh, oh, yeah, six triple four six double five. Lovely tone to this one, obviously, with that. And you've got this beautiful, the sterling silver little bugles that you're seeing that are dancing around that chain. Give it something really special. It almost looks like it's diamond cut, the way that that's twinkling. Fabulous price point. Bearing in mind it is silver. You've then got the rose gold uh, plating over there. I find it really hard to say rose gold sometimes because I always go rose, 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 <laughs> rose. Uh, but it's so, so glorious. And that's a chain you wear on its own, probably. You don't necessarily need to have a pendant dropping down on that at all. You can do. There's enough of it. Uh, you've got a good gram weight on that, so it'll certainly take it. And with 18 centimetres, you've got a very lovely length on there as well. But whether you wear your sterling silver, your white gold, whether you wear the rose gold, all of those combinations work so beautifully along that necklace. I'll hold it up, actually, because it really does. It really sparkles. You can see it there on Gates. It's fabulous price, 7 95 Double it. Fifteen pounds? Never. I would expect to pay twenty nine ninety nine at least for a necklace like this. At least, because that is a necklace. It's not just a chain. It is a necklace, and it's that sort of price. That's that's to put in your gift drawer as well, isn't it? That's for when you've forgotten one of the presents and mm. your friends knit round. You go, uh, just going to get your present from upstairs. Ah, uh, you go into the gift drawer and go, actually, I've got a really nice chain in there. Yeah. You're very happy with that, because mm. it does happen, doesn't it? It's lovely. <laughs> very nice. Right, popping her back. Um, Oh, just the, the huge big nuggets that I can't say yet. <laughs> These are fabulous emeralds. I know. Huge, yep, huge sizable gemstones. Let's grab hold of these. Oh, Phil. Do you fancy an entire strand of emeralds like this? 130 carats for a £10 note deal. Does that sound good? Because we should be at £12.95. That on its own is sensational, isn't it? These big, beautiful, polished, emerald graduated nuggets, they are one of those as a statement in a piece of jewellery would be fab. So with a £10 note, you're going to get change. £8.95, aren't they just tremendous to, have emeralds, <laughs> to work with emeralds? It's a good night so far, isn't it? It is. <laughs> it's like being a child in a sweet shop. It right is now. a little bit, yes. It's yeah, lovely. Yeah. I like it. Uh, but very big gemstones. 130. Who says 130 carats followed up by emerald followed up by 895? Not many people, that's for sure. Uh, but I have the pleasure of doing that for you tonight. They are phenomenal. Look at the different characters you're getting on those gemstones. Just pick one of those out. I mean, really unisex as well, if you're picking one of those gemstones out. Placing that perhaps on cord around the neckline, having one of those and macraming around that on the, uh, on the wrist. Either way, that is a heck of a lot of emerald. 130 carats, the real deal here. Lovely to have in your collection, lovely to be working with, but that is a genuine opportunity a genuine shop opportunity when you're seeing quality like that and I love the fact that you can see those glorious inclusions within the gemstone because we know we get that with emerald it's the inner shot down of the gem and that would actually if you were sort of doing a scientific investigation into the gemstone they would tell you where the gemstone originates from you'd be able to look at those inclusions and because of the uh, sort of whether you've got the vanadium the chromium looking at that it will lead you to to zambia or to, to siberia or to brazil and brazil really is the home of the beauty queen gemstones isn't it 8.95 on that strand it's a lovely gift actually for one of your friends if you know one of your friends makes jewelry as well grabbing hold of 130 carats of emerald i don't think anybody's gonna say no to quite frankly such a special price such a special uh, special strand and i like the tone of that you've all you've actually almost got this sort of lighter almost jadeite color coming through Some very soft pale colors in there yeah, they're beautiful. They're lovely. It doesn't have to be really deep and really saturated in colour at all. Sometimes that doesn't work for you. You've got one or two in there. Obviously, they'll all be different. One or two that has that really strong sort of emerald green. You've got some lovely lighter tones, which are going to be really beautiful in the summer. Just that sort of wire wrapped as a pendant on a chain, I think, would be fabulous. Mm, beautiful. Really lovely. Really nice. Especially if you, that's your birthstone as well. If made your birthstone, you just, yeah, you're winning. 8 95 Very well done. Uh, Trisha, uh, her true Tanya and Deb. Michelle Neris, well done to those of you who are multi-buying on this strand as well. But for a price like that, I mean, that's kind of unforgivable. But we have been given the, uh, the, 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 the what was it, the green light? To, what would it be in sports? Well, it could be a green light starting if you're in the gun. car. The starting gun, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Just the general go, really. Um, to get hold of these so very very well done on those keep adding them in uh, we're a bit limited on quantity on a lot of pieces so just grab them whilst they're there okay dokley next up we're going to go for thank you number six 
<gasps> dendrite opal yeah these are wondrous lovely colors in here dendrite lowest price ever again coming your way right now i'm liking this, this is a theme on its own there isn't the 50 carats beautiful last time they're on air 12 pounds 95 again not a problem with that but last nine chances that's all we've got look at the dendritic inclusions they're so cute they're lovely literally look like mother nature's painted the gemstones mm. but it's coming from within 8.95 they are so is it is it zena's favorite dendrite i can see why though they're all different aren't they they're all absolutely different absolutely beautiful yeah love don't, working with these you don't see them very often no not massively no no i mean you consider all those inclusions they kind of make the gemstone what it is mm. and you might want to sort of club together all the really bright whites you might want to get out some of the silvery grays uh but like little willow trees i always think that looks yes, like they're little growing. willow patterns yeah. chinese yeah yeah Right, again, reminds me of my, my nan going to see the sort of the Chinese willow uh, mm. uh, paintings on, on the plates, yeah. on that sort of lovely blue, but so intricate, so fabulous. And this is where you've got to embrace the inclusions in a gemstone, mm. because without them, they're going to be a very different gemstone. Without them, they're, they're going to be really, really quite simple. But then you've got that lovely detail in there. Aren't they cute? They're lovely, aren't they? Nice to, to use them randomly as well, not to, not to be yeah. too, um, I must, I must, I must. Just yeah. pick them up randomly, because that's, that's how they come. Yeah, I mean, you could have a, so you could have a strand like of black spinel and you could accent and just put one mm. or two dendrite opals within the spinel if you wanted to. That so you've just work. got a couple of features. Mm. Really lovely. We've got spinel coming up for you as well, so look out for that because it's got a very glamorous strand of spinel. Uh, but one for you, you're not going to get fire or opalescence, I should say, as you expect to get from maybe your Ethiopian or your Australian. It's not about that. It's about these dendritic growths within the gemstone, this exploration of the dendritic inclusions, which is so glorious within that. Totally unisex again on that one. I can definitely imagine that uh, sort of uh, going to, 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 you know, for jewelry for myself and for my husband, actually. Uh, so seven last spaces on those. Got quite a few in baskets just check them out because none of these are hanging around we're going to the lowest prices on these today uh, so just get involved as soon as you can 0800 644 655 and on the web jewellerymaker.com just to add them in and of course you're only paying one set of pmp throughout the entire day so use it use it use it use it and grab as much as you can <gasps> oh i've just seen a couple of the strands they are lovely a couple of the strands coming up on the t-bar later on are just so fab Oh my goodness, very exciting. Last two chances, well done. They are going to sell again. So if you want to jump on that deal, go for it now. Grab it, very well done. Beautiful. Right, let's do, oh, let's pop those back in the right box. That'll be a, that'll be a start. A cappuccino. Oh, cappuccino. I do like a cappuccino. A cappuccino or a latte or a mocha chocolate is pretty good. These are glorious. Have, I do find it funny sometimes when, when you ask for a coffee and it's just like, if you're having a coffee or a mocha, just have a coffee or a mocha. And it's, can I have a skinny, double, twice, flipped, whatever? You, know, you get the, it's like, you might as well just have water. You might as well, can I just have half, half the caffeine, skinny, what's it? Like, just have a coffee. Yeah. Just a if you're going to. Strong gonna, one. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Really strong one. Mm. Covered in chocolate on the top. Um, pardon, darling? Four hundred and eighty carats of cappuccino agate. Huge slices here. You've got these. It literally looks like you've got the the, the crackled sort of. Uh, um, uh, oh, creme brulee. I do like a creme brulee. Oh, yeah. Creme brulees. The lattes, the coffees, the toffees, all mixed within these gemstones. Probably one of the most um, uh, gloriously um, uh, delicious gemstones to see that you're going to salivate over uh, in terms of that decoration and adornment within the gem. 480 carats of cappuccino. I love an agate gem because it does take so many dif different directions, whether it's about sort of the patterning, whether it's just the, the dyeing process. So lovely on those. I mean, just pick one. Again, different sort of feel that you're getting from all of them. Just one of those. I would wire wrap that within an inch of its life and put that on a massive, massive pendant because they are epic. Even on a bracelet sort of across, uh, across the wrist like that as well would be tremendous. Lowest prices ever coming in for you so far this evening. And it's 7 95 How many we've got? We've got at least, we've got at least that. Three, six, seven, eight. P perfect. Perfect. That's less than a pound each. Cute. Don't even need a calculator for that. Pay more than that for a latte. 
came up. They, what are we talking? You're talking a good. You can say goodbye to three pounds, roughly, can't you, for a, for a, for a takeaway coffee? Mm -hmm. Job done. One of those, seven ninety five, and that's not going to be moments on the lips and lifetime on the hips. That's going to be there forever, isn't it? Looking glorious. Really soft, beautiful polish on those as well. They're going to sell out. You've got to sprint to the finish line on this one tonight. 480 carats of cappuccino agate. Imagine one of those on a pendant on the neckline. Whether it's across, whether it's sort of landscape, whether it's portrait, that's going to... And yellow gold or sterling silver, rose gold. Actually, let's just go the whole hog. Let's go for a fabulous necklace for the summertime. That needs to be coming on holiday with me. That is amazing. Monica, well done. Uh, congratulations to David and Susan. Jane, check out. Donna, check out. Isabel, I'm on the balcony on my holly bobs. I've got my little sort of uh, lace dress on, my little white broader on glaze dress. Gin and tonic in hats. I've gone to gin and tonic already, even on sports day. <laughs> and I've got a fabulous big necklace on my neckline like this. You can't feel more gorgeous, no, I don't think. No. That's a bargain. That is a bargain. Six in baskets. I've got the last two chances. That's less than a pound an agate. There's no way I'd look at one of those and think, oh, 98p, 90 get out of here 7.99 for one of those wire wrapped on a pendant what would you sell one of those for because i know what i'd pass one of those on for and quite rightly so quite rightly so very very well done they're going to go obviously glorious on those congratulations i love those they feel amazing as well a very tactile tactile right we have half an hour until we're going to bring to you uh, the first kit this evening and you are going to adore it. You're going to love it. Seed bead tastic. Oh, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Right, let's do something really fabulous right now. This is glorious. Now, you might choose to set this. You might choose to literally just put this into, into a cabinet at home. Uh, and maybe you've got various gemstones, various pieces. This is phenomenally fabulous. Fabulous, can't even say it. 120 carats of druzy quartz it literally looks like it's been sugar coated it's glorious but that is the crystal structure what we've done here is basically go into if i turn it around you've basically got if you think about the geodes where where, where amethyst is formed the, the rock of the gem and if you go into that inside that geode there is your druzy quartz it's so fabulous i just think they're so interesting you look at them and you can literally feel how the gemstone has crystallized you can literally get that feel of, of, of what's happened from mother nature from right down from from the very very start and it could be the the, the, the presence of silica it could be the presence of lots of different elements that have gradually seeped through into the earth into a cavern very often actually a lot of druzy or a lot of um um what's my word um geodes are created from perhaps trees trees that have fallen over and have gradually sort of dissipated into the land and you've got that cavern in the center and you've got just oh my word the most beautiful piece i wonder if you could play with that I wonder if that would take a die just thinking off the top of my head right now i mean it looks lovely on its own i'd be tempted to have a little play with that I'm tempted to get a couple can you see oh who said that claire she's Claire McDonald suggested that you could make a little angel to sit right in the centre of there. That'd be very cute. That'd be really a little oh a little or secret. A little or a little fairy. Little fairy. Yeah. Absolutely. Just in there, yeah. How cute would that be? Just sort of hiding in the corner. Can you see you've got a drill hole on there as well? So it is ready to go if you do want to add that and make that onto one of the most uh, that's a stunning price. That is a stunning price. You know when you go into those little shops, you go into the crystal mm. shops and have a look around, and you get sort of big pieces like this. Six 95 you know it's real you know what you're getting here is real you can get your certificate of authenticity with most of the pieces that is phenomenal and look how it glitters look how it glitters it looks so like ice it looks as like though it's going to melt it does, it's so yeah, lovely yeah. absolutely it does look like ice it's very very beautiful it's almost like sugar when you see the little crystals on the sugar it's very very sweet it's beautiful and they'll all be slightly different don't forget Every single one will be unique. Uh, so I'd definitely grab a couple of those. I do, and do you know what? It's, it's not heavy. It looks like it might be quite heavy. It's not actually. Obviously, it's got a weight to it because it's a big piece of 60 by 40. I wouldn't wear them in my ears, potentially. Might be what I call a lobe lugger. Uh, but I would definitely <laughs> have an amazing pendant on that one because I think they're fab. But I would like one to be... I, I would actually think that would make a fabulous gift... Um, with perhaps a little fairy or a little angel sort of just hiding in there and what a lovely gift to just box up and to give to one of your friends as a little keepsake to have it on a little you know the little mm. picture stands that you can get yeah uh, just to have it on one of that I've not seen any of those for years but just to have it that'd be so cute well done well done on those they are amazing the pearls that you had on first the <gasps> they oh, they'd look beautiful sit nicely just in the little um yeah they would they look tremendous in there Oh, look I at mean, the I'm not thinking oysters or anything, but 
um, yeah, it, it, they just would. Yeah, would work. really pretty, really, really pretty. They work incredibly well with those. Gorgeous, very, very well done indeed. Glorious. Well, it is Sports Day now. Sports Day. Things always happen on Sports Day, don't they? Have we got any stories on you? Have you got any stories to share with us about your sports day? It doesn't have to be sports as in school sports day. It might be you were doing a sporting event and something happened. It could have been something fabulous, something amazing. Did you win an award for something special or something <laughs> random? Or did you have a catastrophe? Did you go to leave and you got tangled up in the, in the, in the very starting line? Did you, drop, did you drop an egg? Oh, did Mike dropped an egg in the egg and spoon race. Bless you. <laughs> <laughs> Here's how you text him between, um, uh, between, no, I was saying between 8 and 10, you know that. Uh, send us a text to James Studio, 60777. Normal network charges apply. Uh, and let us know about your sporting incidents or your sporting accidents because we would love, love, love to hear from you on that. Um, I'm, I'm sure we've got a few we can tell you ourselves as well. Uh, my mum used to watch Sports Day like that because literally I was off. Literally, like, you know when you get the greyhounds and then they let the rabbit, the little mechanical... I was literally, like, I was, the li I was like the rabbit. No one ever caught me. No one ever got me. Anyway, let's bring to a star by, shall we? We've got some amazing pieces still to come. So let's bring you to, bring to you uh, a glorious strand of Peridot nuggets. Whoa. Peridot nuggets. So we are going low on Peridot. Oh, yes! Oh, I've been waiting to say that. You have some exceptional, exceptional quality on your Peridot. No oh, nuggets. Hold on. What am I going for? Oh, that's the... Gosh, some good colour on those as well. These are lovely. I know, they're beautiful as well. Have a little look. Got some gorgeous green gemstones coming up for you today, that's for sure. Peridot nuggets. Of course, August's birthstones are not very far away. Uh, real purity in terms of the colour here. Real purity in terms of the tone of the gemstones that you're seeing here, of course, as well. And a very, very highly appreciated gemstone the world over. If we're talking about Peridot, uh, it's, it's been enjoyed since practically the beginning of time, isn't it? If we think about uh, the Egyptians, we think about the Romans. The Romans used to call Peridot the evening emerald because it has such a phenomenal glow to the gemstone. And it's very, very easy to see why. I mean, when when you have colour, when you have calibre like this, what a sensational collection of gemstones you've got. These nuggets are perfect. Five by three by six by four on a 38 centimetre strand. And of course, each and every one of those gemstones just looks absolutely adorable. Now, it's a gemstone, what we call an hydrochromatic gem. It, it's it's coloured by its, its kind of natural impurities. You've got iron within there, but you've got to have it right. Too much iron in peridot and it will be too dark, too oversaturated, too little iron and it will be too light be very washed out you've got to have what we call the right tone on peridot it's got to be perfect if you really want the good stuff and i would say exactly that's what you're looking at here very clear very clean you may see i don't know if i can find any in here actually um it's going to be a bit of a hunt you may find one or two little tiny tiny teeny um black spots in your peridot gem if you do what is that essentially do you know if you find a little black spot in essence, it's, it's unformed diamond because peridot and diamonds grow up together. They grow up holding hands deep down and they come up through the kimberlite pipes, peridot and diamond. Same with diamond. You might find a little spot in diamond and very often that again can be either sort of the, the, the unformed carbon, a little black spot. Or you might see little sort of flashes of olivine green in there, which is the unformed peridot. So really close relationship. The only couple of gems really that come out of the kimberlite pipes. You do get a bit of, I'm not going to go into the xenolith there because that's a different technical story. Uh, but lovely classic colour. I think if you look at this gem, you know what it is as well, don't yes, you? Yes, you do, yeah. yeah. And it's, it's, it's a fabulous, fabulous colour. Bright green, makes you think about summertime. And it's going to be a very, very crazy price tag for you today. <gasps> oh, my... Right, I, I genuinely didn't expect this. No, this is a cracker of a star buy. Four ninety-five. I'd blow my whistle now. Get involved at 4 95 <laughs> absolutely. It's not even... Oh, I'm caught my microphone. Hold on. Hold on. I knew that would happen. There we go. Uh, it's not... I mean, this is literally just the game starting this evening at 4 95 0800 644 
double five very beautiful gem uh, every single one of these i mean your gem quality is just amazing gem upon gem right the way around there these are beautiful deborah carol winifred edith congratulations to you uh 4.95 looking glorious they are so pure aren't they and what a wonderful tone what gemstone would you you use with peridot what what sort of colors would you work with on this i would go with amethyst lilac the lilacs and nice. the greens lilacs and pinks are my favorite colors and okay always been the colors i've used with until i started working as a guest designer here yeah. and of course you get what you are sent mm. so and i've never worked with greens and yellows and right. i've had peridots and citrines but the peridots have been why haven't i worked with these before they are just so beautiful and they go with yeah. so much Don't they're like. a natural green it's a natural color it goes with everything yeah but with a green and purple work i like that yeah because i think obviously you yeah like you said natural color you think of peridot peridot green you've got the grass green you think of very much uh, the things that are natural in mother nature and then you think of the floral tones the trees the everything that i think works with peridot whether you're going with the yellows of citrine i do like the amethyst so i need to look at that works the beautiful bit yeah rose quartz Rose quartz, beautiful. Mm. Yeah, really. So I'm a pink girl as well. Yeah. And I've got some tourmaline. If I just bring that with the tourmaline, because you've got so many different colours in the tourmaline, mm. it works with everyone. Mm. From the pinks to the oranges to the blue tones in there as well. Absolutely fantastic. Who do you know that has a birthday in August? It starts to get busy, doesn't it? August, September time. If you're thinking about babies, it starts to get busy. If you work back nine months, you know. Uh, but <laughs> a lot of babies are born in end of August, September. I'm a September baby. Um, and it, 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 from sort of August, August for me, August to Christmas just gets so busy with birthdays. But that is such a classic treat. Very, very lovely on that one. Oh, first message. Fabulous. I once ran into the parents race at my son's school, tripped over and lost my shoe and dignity at the same time. <laughs> oh, bless you. I, I, it, parents race was always good fun, wasn't it? When you were, when you were small watching your parents do the, uh -huh. do, the, do the racing. And, and nobody takes it easy either, do they? No, They're it's really win. competitive. It's really yeah. more competitive. Than there's the elbows, there's the loss. Yeah, yeah. the children so kind of, you know, they go for it, all the rest of it. But the parents get on board. Whoa. That's it, that's it. They're straight down there. Straight. I don't remember my mum and dad ever doing sports day, though. Don't remember my mum doing the. I don't. Um, no. I think I know my daughter my, has. Ooh. Yeah. See, I think my dad was probably at work, and mum was like, "No, I'm going to leave this. <laughs> I'm going to sit this one out. I just, yeah. I just cheer on." My, to be fair, I was there. I, you know. I, as I said, I always won the, the 100 metre sprint of the obstacle course. So if mum had done the race and won as well, it would have been a bit. Mm. Yeah, would have been a bit bad, I think. Um, that is lovely. Right, let's stay with the greens, shall we? Because we've got some lovely emeralds to share with you as well. These are lush. These are really, really lush. There's always a shoe missing or something. At least your trousers didn't fall down or anything like that. Could have been worse, couldn't it? <laughs> split trousers, split shorts, no. Uh, 20 carats. I always remember that footage of Princess Diana at Sports Day. And everybody, and they didn't give it to her, did they? No. They really, I mean, she won, but they, they really gave her a good race. I'll never forget that. Uh, 20 carats of emerald graduated faceted rondelles, 16 centimetre strand. What a lovely colour. What a, when I say that, I can't really, can I? Because that would be green, and it's more than that. There is tone, there is saturation, there is hue, all of the elements that make up colour. Whether you've got the lighter, brighter tones, when you've got the more uh, rich, sort of substantial saturation of colour, every single one just sparkles. You've got these amazing rondelles in here, 20 carats of gemstones, just look looking fantastic on that 16 centimetre strand. I mean, as a classic, just a little friendship bracelet, that would be the most beautiful, beautiful gift, wouldn't it? Really lovely. You might choose to take a couple of those out, have that perhaps set onto a pendant, but again, what a really high-end gemstone strand to work with. 20 carats of emerald. It's got to be a bit of a gift. Yeah. I love faceted rondelles, and especially mm. the graduated one, because you take the end ones out, earrings, and a yeah. bracelet, and you've got a beautiful suite. Yeah. Sterling silver findings, really, really high end. Yeah, exactly. And you, you are, you're going to go for the higher end in terms of your findings, whether it's silver, whether you go with yellow gold, definitely to mix, mix and match that up. Obviously, get a certificate of authenticity with your strand as well. Definitely advise you do that. Um, I'm, I'm, not, I'm a bit nervous now, because I'm a bit <laughs> unsure as to what Phil's going to do. So I might be giving him a red card right now. We'll see. But 20 carats of emerald, a little bit of oiling on there, that's fine, we don't mind that at all with emeralds. Brazilian emerald, I don't want to look. Okay, it's gems of distinction, look. <gasps> oh my word. I've bought a strand of emerald like this really, really recently, and I didn't pay 6 95 for it. 
I didn't pay six nine. It's it Phil's last day. I might be if he carries on like this. <laughs> no, he's, he's been given permission to do this. So he says. He has. We just had Colin down. I didn't realise Colin oh, was right. in the gallery. Oh, didn't just realize. do what you like. It's sports We can do it. what we like now. Right. We, can, we need a trophy after this show. <laughs> six nine. Jem got one earlier, didn't she? They are absolutely superb. That colour, that quality, that's really magical, really magical. Because even if you restrand that, if you're just starting out, you restrand that, you put on a little silver lobster claw clasp or a gold bolt ring clasp, are you going to sell that bracelet at 6 dollars You don't even need to waste your breath answering me. I know the answer on that. Are you going to double the price, triple it, quadruple it? What would you pay for a 20 carat emerald bracelet? Unbelievable deal on that. Yorkshire uh, candidate, I'm not even going to start to say your names actually because there's so many people that are checking these out right now. I think sometimes when you get a price like that, I think sometimes initially people sit at home or, or you might be sitting there going, what's wrong? <laughs> Do you know what I mean? The cap? Yeah, exactly. Sometimes yeah. It, uh, deals like this take a second or two for, for, for people to actually register what you're getting because it's too good. And very often when it's too good, you go, what, right, what's the catch? Or what, what's the, it's too good. If it's too good to be true, it normally is, isn't it? Except when you're kind of watching on deals like this. This is one of those deals. And you've got a 30 day money back guarantee anyway. So you can try us out. You can test us out. See what people think. Even just keep the strand as it is ask your friends ask your family what they think to a strand of gemstones like that and then tell them how little maybe you don't want to tell them how little you paid because chances are they might say oh, i'd love a bracelet can i have a uh, 19.99 29.99 just as a family deal but yeah yeah, yeah. 6.95 that's done and actually even saying that just seems sounds wrong that does doesn't it, it does. 20 <laughs> carats i'm going actually okay i always underprice my stuff i'll be honest with you so yeah 49 world's your lobster absolutely beautiful though to be perfectly honest i would not be giving that away i'd i'd i'd, I'd, I'd need that for myself I was just saying that's a keeper, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. mine. <laughs> Mine's still on my on my uh, on my tra on my pink tray. It's all lined out still. Really? Yeah, yeah. and I've just, I've just not had time to restrand it. I lost a couple off the end the other day. <gasps> but I just bracelet, literally just a bracelet with a little clasp. Yeah, love it. I don't want to do anything else with it. Might put a little bit of a little bit of sparkle in there, but I, I do just like it on its own because mm. there are so many different tones in there, so many different shades. And as we said with the rondelles, even though you've not got too much transparency, they, they're quite opaque, which is wonderful. You get that lovely sparkle. They're the absolutely fabulous. I love them. It's lovely as well, isn't it? Yeah, gorgeous. So it's really, really it's sparkly. Fab. It's beautiful. They are fab. I've had, I did one stall a while ago and I loved it. I did lots of big wire wrap pendants and started to get into my bracelets. I do, I, I, I do love it. And I did sell quite a bit to my friends as well. I should do that again, shouldn't I? I should have a party before Christmas. Why not? Right. Yes. Um, let's do the amethyst, actually. These are really look just for you, Karen. Just for you. I love some amethyst. Pretty colour tones in here as well really pretty they're lovely how lush right, i'm gonna get the peridot look at those together don't they look fantastic those greens they said they do work really well mm. they kind of bring out each other's electricity somehow yes, yes. they complement 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 each other yeah. my, my, my mouth's not working it's no. all right so it's catching it's <laughs> sports, day. sports day <laughs> my mouth yeah. has run away um <laughs> really really pretty together they are lovely they're really and you can see with the amethyst i mean you could put a myriad of different sort of pink gemstones in there as well but they're so pretty and whether you go for the darker tones of the amethyst look at that see that looks lovely as a twist grab two of those and twist them like that they look really pretty i'm just going to do that you could look see look how cute that is as a little bracelet it's really nice how simple would that oh, be that as well so pretty lovely Really, really nice. You could actually just have a little section of that on a necklace. You could have a little piece of chain link either side if you wanted to. Just keep it very simple. You could have a lovely little lariat style drop. Maybe you've got a bigger um, amethyst nugget that you wanted to wire up and drop down on that. Lots of choice. Lowest price. Lowest price ever. 32. No way. 32. So you are going to wish you're at home right now, Karen, shopping. Natural Zambian amethyst. For five ninety five. <laughs> That's a deal to share. Really? That is a deal. Absolutely beautiful. Oh my goodness. We, we are loving the deals tonight. They're so pretty. White pearls as well. The lilac pearls would look gorgeous alongside there. But with with with, with, with whatever sort of uh, medium of gold, I'm just going to show you one of the rose gold, uh, uh, sort of the tube, the spaces that we've got coming up. Imagine just a couple of those 
set in between that strand. The rose gold would look so lovely, wouldn't it? Mm, that's, that works. And really then, well. How simple would that mm. be? Mm. Really, really simple. You could just have one in the centre, but I'd actually want to have sort of three or five of those around sort of interspersed on that necklace. That would look truly, truly fabulous. Again, with some of the pearls we've got coming up for you in the kits, I think they'll work together really, really nicely. I mean, oh, there's, there's loads you can work with this. Loads you can do. Uh, even if you try, I mean, two by one, four by two, you could you could seed bead with those, I think, as well, if I you want to make your seedy beads. Funnily enough, I was just looking at, when you twisted them then, I was thinking mm. of seed beading with them. Nice as a big sort of seed bead drop earring, mm, actually. Nice sort yeah. of drop. And we like a dingle dangle earring. I do like a dingle dangle. They'd look very nice as well. Yes, they would. Gorgeous. Well done, everyone. Collectors all over the place. Congratulations. £5.95. You need to be on the phone lines and ring all your friends tonight. Ring your friends, your jewelry-making friends, because you are going to need to be with us. We've had the absolute go-ahead. Colin's been with us in the gallery. Um, and he said, oh, was it, was it Colin that was starting to talk about coffee? Is that, ah, right, because I did hear, I, I didn't realise he was, I didn't realise he was there. Um, well, no, I just, I didn't know, I didn't know, I didn't know, I wasn't really listening to you all in there, to be perfectly honest, I was just having a lovely time with Karen and Toby. <laughs> <laughs> well done. Grab one, grab two, grab three. Kaz has grabbed three. Alison's got two. Beautiful work on those. Really, really high-end strand of amethyst and natural amethyst in there as well from Africa. They are so stunning. You're not going to want to take your eyes off them. They're lovely. Little rings as well. Just a simple strand as a ring would be incredibly cute. Just a little stretchy. Very, very sweet. And do think about your summer jewellery if you're going to weddings or to, to sort of garden parties or birthdays. Oh, I've got a 40th birthday to go to in two weeks. And I, 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 I need to, and she's very creative. No, I'm past that. Oh, my, that's, that's, that's a distant memory, that one. Um, and I want to make something for her because she's quite creative. She, she, she's, I'm like, mm. I was going to say she's quite crafty, but that always sounds wrong, doesn't it? <laughs> she's very crafty. Uh, so five ninety five. <laughs> well done on those. Congratulations. They'd be useful. Just give that a little twist again because they look fabulous like that. So beautiful. Well done. Congratulations. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Right, let's have a little bit of, well, I say a little bit, a large bit of pre-night. 300 carats. These are almost outglow my, 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 my what's it? My headband and my arm bits. These are so lovely. <laughs> Look at the glow on your pre-night. Great gemstone. I'd never heard of this gemstone until a few years ago. Um, originally coming from the Wave Hill district of Australia, um, uh, discovered or named after Colonel Hendrik von Prien, uh, hence the name. But it, what, it's, what it's renowned for is this glow, this inner glow, almost like somebody's got a torch shining out of the gem. I look at those. You want to dive into that. There's so much going on in there. And the little black inclusions are fab. They're part of the gem. It's like having a little birthmark or a mole or a, a little scar or a little, uh, just a, a beauty spot. It's all part and parcel of the gemstone. Different shades, different tones, different sizes, different depths of those gemstones in there. Love those fancy slice. A fancy slice. Sounds wonderful as well, doesn't it? Oh, I'll have a fancy slice, please. 300 caps. It sounds like it should be a bakewell or something, mm. doesn't it? A fancy slice. Mm. Something with icing on and almondy. And sugary. And dirty and lovely, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Naughty for us. Yeah. <laughs> On With cream in the set. On sports <laughs> yeah. day. Yeah. We've got to keep your energy up, haven't you, somehow? Yeah. Yeah. That's what it's all about. Carbs and cake. Uh, we should have, should, have thought, should have thought this through, really, shouldn't we? Yeah. I have bought you all the uh, little cornflake chocolate crispy cake things, actually, tonight. Just to uh, keep our energy up. Yeah, you know, to go with your donuts, Mike, that you've still not bought. <laughs> Three. Yeah, not the day I was in, though. You didn't bring them in on the day I was in. And you haven't actually bought them in, I'm hearing. Uh, £3.95 for 300 carats of gemstones. They look really cute. Look at those. Double strand bracelet. Pretty gorgeous. Uh, pearls, black spinel. Because you've got the black inclusions, I think I would want to add in a, a, a black gemstone alongside. Mm. So that really works, doesn't it? If I put that in the centre, actually, because we've got the spinel coming in. So there's a little bracelet. Straight on. We'll do that next for you, actually. Imagine sort of weaving all of those together instantly that's a really cute little bracelet if you wanted to sort of weave all of those together they're lovely pre night's just so have you worked with pre night before i haven't no it's a nice gemstone no, isn't it beautiful yeah and again probably with the amethyst with the purples that tone of green is mm -hmm. going to really kind of take flight again isn't it it's a, a really lovely soft yes it gentle, is. muted green yeah um, but it doesn't detract from the fact that it is really 
beautiful to look at yeah it's got so lovely so and pa these sort of pastel uh, sort of green tones that you see there doesn't stop that sort of ethereal inner glow of the gemstone it's so special it's 100 percent natural it's it's not enhanced at all uh but this is really really quite lovely three pounds 95 sh amazing uh so very very well done indeed gorgeous right i'll tell you what we'll do Got the break coming up, got a kit coming up imminently. I think we should squeeze in, shoehorn in another star buy for you. And it can only be that one, Gem. Spinel, spinel. Let's bring it to you now. Do you know what? You just can't get the staff. I was, I was just bursting into song then to give you a little bit of spinel, spinel. What did he do? What did Mike do? Cut me off. Cut me off. Well, I was about to go. I was about to go into the second verse, but no, it's fine, Mike. Nobody else, nobody else has a problem with that, but it's fine. No, it's too late now. Like you said earlier on, you can't repeat a song. 90 carats <laughs> of black spinel. I think this outsparkles my sparkly top. It's so, so beautiful. I've always loved spinel. Always. 7 by 4, 14 by 6 millimetres and a 10 centimetre strand. You've got some lovely, lovely little pear drops, some almost briolette drops that you're getting on the gems. Again, completely natural. Spinel, see look at that sparkling against my top. I need to keep holding something behind that. Um, Spinel isn't treated, it's a natural gem, just like, um, well, sharing the same cubic crystal system as a diamond and as a garnet, actually. Um, this is literally a jet black gemstone. It's tremendous, it's really picking up in its popularity. Um, it was obviously not identified for many, many years. For many years it would have gone on un undisclosed or, or undiscovered as, as a different gemstone. Red spinel, perhaps as a ruby. Uh, blue spinel, maybe as your sapphires. But we know what this gemstone is now, and it's very highly regarded. So much so, if you're a birthstone lover out there, you like collecting the birthstones, one of the newest birthstones was Tanzanite. I, I think it was, was that 2002? It was gone out of my head. Um, when it was added to, to the birthstone list. The newest gem now to be added in, Spinel. So it goes perfectly with your peridot because it's an August baby gemstone. So you've got spinel, all of the colours of spinel, whether it's black or red or purple, alongside peridot are both August. This is going to be a shocker. This is going to be an absolute delectable delivery. <gasps> this is so low. Lowest prices ever so far this hour. We've blitzed through these deals. This is so, so amazing. It's £6.95. Whoop, whoop to that glorious I and mean, 800 six triple four six double five whoopage they are del look at every single one those facets have to be so well done whether it's end on whether it's around the sort of the bulb of the drop they've got to be so specific so sharply sort of delivered and not in an out sharp way but as in really spot on to get that luster and it's, it is all about that dance isn't it all about that luster that you get from the gem i love black spinel gorgeous absolutely yeah it's just so gorgeous to look at yeah great evening yeah. gemstone but actually you can wear this in the daytime big time uh, whether you choose to take you could actually get one of those perhaps sort of wire wrapped as a ring as well perfect for earrings obviously when you've got the drops mm. amazing and gold or silver it's totally your call on that one but 6.95 well done to those of you that are buying twos or threes uh or fours of the strands tonight because when you've got prices going on like this why not treat yourself you've got a 30-day money-back guarantee tonight i would say you just go absolutely you you go for it you sprint in to these auctions tonight three fab hours of low 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 deals get them home and then sit and take a breath get everything out have a look and go okay keeper 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 that might be return that might be going to a friend i don't know there'll be many in the return pile but have a little look through on all of those at 6 95 they are glorious georgina allison kathleen barbara well done edith ann lynn spinel gemstones have you ever seen such a cracking opportunity for a price like that for a delivery of gemstones like that they are incredibly incredibly glamorous i mean that as a necklace a little bit of chain link either side you're going to make your money back really easily, aren't you, if you're selling your jewellery? <laughs> this is all no-brainer land, isn't it, really? Which we, we quite like as well. Uh, it's very sim simple maths. We like that. Um, last couple of strands there for you to grab hold of. Grab them, grab them, because they are absolutely awesome. Uh, we've got a lot to do tonight. We've got lowest prices ever coming in for you. Uh, so 
do stay with us. Oh, we're doing the jadeite. Oh, I, right, I need a strand of this, so I'm going to have to get somebody. If somebody's watching at home that knows me, do me a great deal on this because I need another strand of jade. It's always a popular, <laughs> popular gemstone, isn't it? And these are exactly what I need. We've got a good quantity of them as well. Yes. So get ready because we're going to grab hold of these in just a moment at the other side of this. Here at Jewellery Maker, we love seeing your jewellery creations, learning about your inspiration and reading your blogs. If you write your own craft or jewellery blog, then we'd love to hear from you. Simply tweet us at jewellery underscore maker UK with your blog link and we'll be in touch. Owning a strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates for items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from Jewellery Maker. It couldn't be easier to buy from Jewellery Maker with all the information you need right there on screen. From the item code and the product description right down to the price. And whether you're buying at the beginning or at the end of the offer, everyone pays the final on-screen price. So, what are you waiting for? Simply telephone our free phone number or join us at jewelrymaker.com and start your jewelry making journey today. Jewelry Maker, your one stop shop for all your jewelry making needs. The sun is shining. We've had the hottest day of the year so far. The paddling pools are out and everyone's topping up their towns. So, here at Jewelry Maker, we've decided to bring you Christmas in July. As jewellery makers, we know you love to be organised. So join us on July the 25th and start planning your Christmas craft fairs and get designing those festive creations. Christmas in July, Tuesday the 25th. Welcome back to the show. Welcome back to Jewelry Maker tonight. My name's Ruth and myself and the team taking you through tonight until 10. I've just said to everyone, I'm just having a lovely time. I just needed to share that with everybody. Even Mike, even Mike. I said, Mike, I'm loving your company tonight. Mike, we've got Phil the Phenomenal. We've got lovely Toby and everybody. We just love it. Sound, loving the deals. There's Toby. We're not seen. Where's your, um, where's your sweatbands gone, Toby? Oh, I've lost them. Lost them? Yeah. Mm. Do we believe him? No. I did. Do, <laughs> Toby's so cool he doesn't perspire. Uh, right. <laughs> Have a little look at this. Oh my gosh, I need this strand. 180 carats of Burmese jadeite. They are exactly, go for it. They are exactly what I need in my life right now. Um, I bought two strands of jadeite recently, but I, I couldn't get the rounds. We didn't have the rounds at the time. It's absolutely fine, because I got a couple of the puffy uh, sort of um, ovals. Fine, fabulous, they work brilliantly. I love this. And I got some rondelles. The rondelles is the one I was wearing today. I, this is this is perfection for me. This is exactly what I'm looking for. 180 carats, and I'm sure you are as well. Eight millimeter Burmese jade. Are they flying in, Phil? I, if if I don't get one of these, 
Can I just say something? Yes, please. Denise, please, could you buy me some of those? <gasps> Denise, Denise. Denise, Denise! If you're watching, Is please. that your lovely buyer? It's my your lovely, lovely friend buyer. My, yes, yes. Yes, my, please, Denise. Yes, please, uh, they just They're going to be amazing as well because we're doing lowest price deals. I don't know what we're doing with this on <laughs> Jadeite for. And, and remember, because it's always a confusing one, with Jadeite, people say, what's the difference? What's Jadeite and what's Jade? Think of Jade at the top of your umbrella. You've got Jade there at the top. And then coming down from that, you have Jadeite, which is from Burma, and coming down from the jade, you have what we call nephrite, which is Chinese. So that's the easiest way to differentiate, because people always go, what's, the, what's jade mm. and what's jadeite? What's the difference? So jade's the, your, your umbrella, if you like, at the top. Jadeite comes down, that's Burmese. Nephrite is Chinese. That's the easiest way of thinking about it. But culturally, it's a very important gemstone. Jadeite has been with us for hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of years. I don't know if I want to see this. You see, I, I will give you that right now 24.95 i will give that and that's what you've paid 24.95 because it is such a high-end gemstone it's a very appreciated gemstone it's a very important gemstone culturally over the centuries and this color is it this to me is bordering on the apple greens the apple greens you've got to look out for do you remember if, if i was to make a necklace with that I don't know whether you've ever seen, there's a very famous necklace called the Barbara Hutton necklace. Have a look at it, mm. have a, put it into your search engine, have a look. The Barbara Hutton necklace was all sort of rounds, big. It was a deep, deep green color. I'm not making a direct comparison, obviously. It was probably one of the most expensive necklaces ever in terms of price per carat on the gem. Just beautiful, but nothing fancy going on with it. It was all about the gemstones. I don't want to watch this because I don't know what you're doing, um, <laughs> but it's going to be lovely. It's going to be lovely. We know that. Lowest price by miles on Jadeite. <gasps> oh. oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. And we just, I, how many guest designers do you know do you what, that wear the Jadeite bracelets? I mean, literally, it is one of those. Fleur, uh, well, Claire, I was talking about Jadeite. Uh, Laura, it is literally, and so many of the presenters, for me, there is a pull to Jadeite at the moment. I don't know what it is, but it's a gemstone that's calling me at the moment, which is why I had to make another bracelet just a couple of days ago. I've got one with a little sort of um, butterfly tag hanging down. I've got one that's just covered in silver space. I've got one that's got bead caps all the way around, hence why I was saying I need some more bead caps and silver mm -hmm. spaces. But what about rose gold against there as well? That would be super gorgeous. We've got a massive, beautiful, big sterling silver filigree ball coming up for you a bit later on how about that right in the center for a necklace even dropping down in the center on a bracelet that's just going to set it off see how lovely is that it's very 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 perfect absolutely it's a beautiful gem um, you're doing really well on that one i know so many of you love your jadeite uh, lynn tina georgina michelle celia yes buy two absolutely <laughs> of course you can buy two buy three uh, fill your boots because it is it's one of the most i think in demand strands it's one of the strands we get asked for uh, the most if you've gone to the website because i'm always going onto the website and having a look for jadeite it's one of the least that you find i think jadeite mm -hmm. uh, you look and go oh brilliant because i've done that a few times on the rounds the 10 mil rounds gone oh, brilliant clicked on it sorry not not available or out of stock and oh, I'm like, oh yeah. man and it, <laughs> you have to look out for it we've got it at the lowest price tonight so wonderful i wouldn't surprise me if we see some of the guest designers names coming on board here as well people buying three strands right now 17 at 95 for so many gemstones let me just quickly two four six let me do a quick count eight ten two four six oops eight ten if i flip that round because that will count down my counting 20 40 two four six eight approximately 50 jadeites the nice thing with jadeite is as well it goes with every skin tone totally uh, yes it does it, it, it's just so soft and gentle yeah Lovely. It, you, you're very, whether you're blonde, brunette, redhead, whether you're slightly lighter or darker of skin tone, jadeite looks stunning. I made the mother-in-law a jadeite bracelet recently. She's very happy. Got to keep the mother-in-law happy. Uh, Judith, well done. Viv, collects in Hertfordshire, Hampshire. Uh, Hampshire, there's a new place. You made that one up. <laughs> made that one up. That's a cross between Hertfordshire and, oh, you've gone, and Hampshire. Uh, <laughs> uh, hello to Jill in oh, Cambridge. Jesh, it says there. That's not even spelt right. Cambridgeshire, I think that should be. Uh, beautiful choice on those. Just not enough. There's never enough jadeite to go around. And, and even if, what well, you know, if and as and when, when we've moved on from this auction, um, if there's one or two strands remaining, they'll go because inevitably throughout the night, whilst you're perusing the website, having a look, uh, maybe you're not coming in from work until sort of half past the hour, uh, you'll sit down, you'll have a look. So people always search for jadeite, always. And you've got approximately the eight mil here, which are really workable. Love that. Love that, love that. That, I have a feeling, might just be um, 
coming home in my pocket. Simple as that. That's that's what I call legal stealing because I'm announcing yeah. it. It's just going to wander <laughs> off with me in my pocket. Right. Let me sprint over, as it is sports day, obviously. Uh, sprinting on over. It's as fast as I go, that is. As fast I'm as I go. Much faster than I go. <laughs> <laughs> we don't want to break out into a sweat, do we? Yeah, yeah. No, we don't want no. to glow. Absolutely. Toby, just so you know, by the way, your sweat band and head, they're, they're all on the side there for oh, you. We've, right, we've got you a lovely shade of pink. They're on the side and I've there, got so. green here as well, yeah, so you so can... Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, don't worry, it'll happen. Double sided, it'll double happen. coloured. Right, kit time. We have a fantastic first kit coming up for you, and it literally is the first kit, because we are talking about coming in first on Sports Day. Oh, Simple as that. Very good. Uh, it's, you know, it's good. It's good to be second, it's good to get silver, it's good to, uh, to get bronze, but if we're going to go for gold, we might as well just do it, haven't we? Mm -hmm. You're going to love this. You're going to love this. Do you say it's the taking part that counts, Mike? It's because Mike never won a race, you see. That's why. <laughs> right. <laughs> he took part a lot but didn't win. Never mind. <laughs> Bless him. It's because it little legs when he was running. Right. We've got our first place kit, including... Look at all these seed beads. Two f I mean, all I need to say to you now, seed beads and Swarovski together. This is glorious. This is it's all you need in your life right now, isn't it? So glorious. You must have been so excited when oh, this popped through the door. Oh, that's wonderful. Very, very my bad. very first seed bead kit. I was just about yeah, to sorry, say that. No, sorry, no, 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 go yeah. for it. My very first seed bead kit that I've had um, sent so, to me. So it's it was challenge. A challenge. Um, I've been doing seed beading. I did a lot when I was a teenager, but very simple stuff. But really, yeah. only since Christmas. Very simple things, easy bracelets. Mm -hmm. um, so when I got this, it was just divine. Um, Quite a few mistakes I made, had to take things out and yeah. start again. But, but that's all part was, of the learning, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. It was just lovely to work with. I so enjoyed it. And Denise, please, if you're watching, yes, please. I'd love one of, one of these. Denise. I do need one. Everybody needs one in, the, in their lives. It yeah, is so And the gorgeous. colours are gorgeous, I have Absolutely to say. Absolutely stunning. Really, really pretty. And what you've created is amazing. You would never have known that this was kind of your first attempt with the kit at all. So if this is what Karen's created as well, you will be inspired. If you've always wanted to have a go with seed beads um, and you've been thinking, oh gosh, the, the guest designers are so amazing. They're so super talented. I'll never be able to do that. Um, have a go. Have a go. And of course, you've got your 30 day money back guarantee anyway. If, you get, if you're getting your first sort of purchase, having a go at the first kit, you can always, always, always return it if it doesn't work out for you. But it will. It, I promise you it will. But let's have a little look at the elements. Whilst you're having a little look at the kit, c wonderful colours. I love those earrings, I have to say. Um, let's have a little look at actually what you're getting in here uh, from your seed beads uh, through to your uh, Swarovski in there as well. So let's have a little look. We've got, uh, well, starting at, I always get these muddled up on the piece of paper. Hold on a second. Here we so you've got the Miyuki round transparent torp seed beads. They're the 15 O's. You've also got the um, pair Cylon seed beads in there. They're the eight O's. You've also got the Baroque Pearl blush pink seed beads, which are the six O's. Um, and you've got the eight O's of the Pearl Cylon seed beads in there as well. Plus the Super Duos. We love a bit of Super oh, Duo. Oh, they're action. beautiful. Lovely, lovely colours. They are beautiful. Really, really lovely be colours. Sort of metallic bronze mm, and khakis and, and golds. I've got a big finger in the way. There we go. There we go, so you can see them in there now. So they're your super duos. They're the violet rainbow crystal beads, which is so lovely. You've got the two holes. You've got, uh, they're about two and a half by five millimetres in there. So they're coming in really, and I love the different shapes you've got. So you've mm. got your eight O's sort of sitting alongside that. <coughs> There we go, those, those wonderful sort of pinks, the six O's, those peachy pinks that you're getting in there as well. And last but not least, of course, there's your little, your little 15 O's in there as well. So lovely. Plus, oh. I mean, look at all of those. They're gorgeous. Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> very, very exciting. I know this is one of these kits you want to dive into, quite it is. frankly. Yeah. It is beautiful. Uh, look at these. Oh my gosh, these are amazing. Look at these. These are your white opal Swarovski. They are fabulous and they're eight mil beads, faceted rounds. They are so delicious. There's a quality to these that I absolutely adore. You're getting 12 of these on the white opals and they're just, they're like a mystical glow. Very, very pretty. Almost like a blue billowy glow coming out There's of there. They're a bit, little bit like Moonstone, but again, it depends yeah. on your skin tone and or what you're wearing them against or what, what they're put next to as to which colour comes out. Yeah, they really They're are. stunning. So nice to have those. And a lovely size. They are really, really nice. 
Look oh, at these. Oh, my goodness me. Right, let me turn some of these. Well, actually, we'll, we'll do a bit of a mix. So we'll put some that are sort of face up and some so you can see, uh, see the back on here as well. Look at that colour. Deep, deep, rich reds. They are absolutely phenomenal. Now, um, you've got, if I turn, have you got the four little... You've got four holes. I was just going to mention those because the, you can use them in there different ways. I'll do. I'll show you later with the. Yeah, we'll have a little. We'll have a little peek. But again, on the Swarovski, I mean, these are so They're phenomenal. Beautiful. And how many of those are we getting? You're getting doesn't, four, eight, uh, twelve again. Mm. Twelve of those. They are so so beautiful. Um, they use Swarovski um, uh, Montes. I won't even start to say all of that. Uh, but they are fabulous because you can work with those. Obviously, by you can sort of stitch those on in lots of different ways. Mm. But you've got the four little sort of spaces, the kind of the drill holes, if you like, actually on the back. So they are very very nice to work with. But that colour is electric. It's a real. It's like a ruby colour. It's like a claret colour on those. They look so so glorious. I don't I don't know where you'd find better. They look incredibly incredibly beautiful uh, that that just phenomenal absolutely phenomenal so all and the, what a contrast against the the the, um, the white opal yes really delicious to see those together and they totally work so you've got all of those seed beads so you've got your two large tubes you've got the two smaller tubes your duos these colors together are amazing 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 a beautiful kit i don't know who put it together but it is absolutely inspired it's wonderful it's wonderful and that's what and we do forget that these don't just uh, sort of head our way ready-made as a kid <laughs> no. you go in you have a look at the world and the wealth of, of different colors from the Swarovski the different styles the different shapes then you go into the wealth of seed beads that are available from your super duos or the different sizes and colors and it's about picking and selecting the right ones that, that, that work in harmony and they totally do and you can see that uh, from the jewelry pieces these and, and I always think like if you're buying shoes and it comes to the summer you're buying your sandals bear with me and you think <laughs> right do I go for the silver or do I go for the gold Actually, the bronze, they go with everything, everything. don't they? Yeah. It's always that, and that's what I've bought this year. I've gone for the metallic bronze. And it's this kind of colour that works so well all the way through this kit with those glorious whites that you've got in there as well. Just perfect. You're going to have a fantastic, fantastic price here. There's so much in this kit, actually. Uh, loads in here. You've got six components. I did write all of this down somewhere, but obviously I can't find it. How do you fancy £3... 33 per component is that really you know seed beads fly always oh really this is amazing oh, please denise i hope you're watching denise <laughs> calling denise where does denise live denise in is she leicestershire um, is she no she's manchester. Sorry. Manchester. manchester manchester all the denise is in manchester you know who you are uh, she knows who she is. She knows. Uh, no, don't let our Karen come off air and give you a ring. Oh, I'm sorry. I did. 1995 for so much. And um, try the seed beading. I promise you, you'll love it. It will become an addiction. But it's a wonderfully relaxing medium it's, as well as a satisfying brilliant. one. Brilliant. It? I love it. I really do love it. I mean, wire work and wire weaving, intricate wire weaving, is my. Um, biggest passion yeah one of the things i like about the seed beading is that it's it's in numbers it's structured i love numbers i love yeah. maths and i love numbers so it's quite prescribed and it's quite structured but you've still got quite a lot of freedom mm. in the way that you do it not quite the same as with wire work no. i admit but it's just such a lovely complement to work in seed beads as well as wire work um and i, I just so so enjoyed this kit i, I mean that looks really incredible did. as well and with that 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 centerpiece with the swarovski in there yeah. as well it just finishes them off doesn't it and um, i've just i've just trying to take my whistle off because i wanted to put the next one and it's it's all it's all caught up in me oh, I'm, I'm never gonna get well, i'm never gonna get that now. off it's fine but i just wanted to see i just wanted to see this necklace on the neckline because it's so so glorious it's really fab mm. have a little look i'll just hold it up there we go look at that Glory, you should be really proud of this. Like, um, um, you've done I such was an amazing very job. Pleased. It was so, That's it just beautiful. went together so well. Yeah, it really does. And the, the sort of the pearly whites that you've got really accent that overall design. And it's although it's a, it's, it's a lovely statement necklace, it's not sort of ostentatious at all. And I think that's because of the color tones. Yes. Because you've yes. got these lovely organic colors, those soft sort of metallics in there, the bronze tones, those glorious metallic greens, the golds that are in there as well. And almost that sort of pinky red very very beautiful i think everybody is going to love these 
Uh, they're going very quickly, which is not a surprise, at £19.95. Goodness gracious me, doing lots of deals for you tonight. Uh, but that is, yeah, it's beautiful. And remember, as Karen said, this is the first time that she's had the seed beading. So if this is Karen's first time doing this, it kind of shows you that, and I mean this obviously the nicest possible way, when we've had some of the guest designers and it's there, if this is their, their sort of specialist. It's their forte, yeah. yeah their forte, yeah. and they're used to doing designs like this. You go, oh, okay, but if it's your first opportunity to have a go, you have the chance to do this and we're going to do a bit of a demo as well so you can start to have a little bit of a look the bracelet is adorable as well I that's a very very simple bracelet is it see, that, and really that's really it looks easy, so yeah. complex yeah. but once you know how to start and how to get going yeah. it's kind of just just letting you into the magic and obviously you can always have a look back on youtube you can have a little look uh, anytime at some of the facebook uh, pages uh, and, and see these demos so you can go back and you can sort of have this step-by-step -step guide but really really glorious opportunities uh, very well done by the oh goodness me well done paul <laughs> uh, i'm looking for denise i can't see her on there yet oh. uh, angela diane karen collects that's not you is it no. uh, <laughs> secret <laughs> secret tablet there um, very very well done everybody that's coming look at that bracelet now so We've got a good amount of kits here, which is fab. Uh, we're at 19.95, which is amazing. Um, and we want you to be winning. We want you to be in first place with this kit today on our sports day. So keep going on this. Keep adding it to your basket. A couple of people have got uh, have, have got two of these kits as well. So very well done to you on that. And um, which piece do you want to focus on, my lovely? I'm going to do one of the necklace that you had on, just yeah. one of the little motifs. Yes, one in of the there because. It's something that can either stand alone, you can make it into bracelets, make it into earrings. So I'm, and I'm, I probably did it all the wrong way around because I'm not a seed beader, but I did each one individually and then yeah. joined them together. And then th there will be secret ways of doing it, but I found the, this the easiest way. But it's just a motif, you can make it larger, mm. smaller. Uh, so it's quite a nice one to start with. And Good stuff. I've started with a threaded needle because that's the bit that i find the hardest to be honest <laughs> threading the needle mm, it's a new spot it gets it gets find hard, the eye in it? the needle <laughs> yeah that's a new spot so i work with not too long a length because you, you can get a little bit tangled up yeah. and i do put a stopper bead on the end which okay. um and i use one of these these little six o pink pearls they're pearly, lovely aren't they they're really really pretty they've got a lovely sheen to mm. them so just put, pop a little those. stopper bead on and I usually put it on twice so that it doesn't jump off. I have used white thread right the way through, so yeah. it's... And then what I did was I had took... And with the see, the Super Duos, I'll bring them down, I... Um, you can, if you wish... Whoa, 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 whoa. Um, be colour graduated, go... Yeah, we might scoot you onto a little black board as well because we're losing your little white oh of course yeah your little ones let me just let me just put those in there and we'll scoop you oh, wait, 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 oh wait. look you're all beautifully set up <laughs> and then what do i do i come along and i ruin your little this setup. is another um sports day hey it is <laughs> this is right okay they might just scoot along oh they work they on there there we go oh no, oh, no. they won't <laughs> well they'll all we're fold trying on to do that nicely but there we go i don't need just make many. it a little bit easier to see therefore <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this, is rest, phrase, yeah. <laughs> this is the phrase too many cooks isn't it yeah. when there's too many cooks getting involved let's pick all of these up then we can I've see the, the demo a bit there. easier that's all right well we'll get you going then i can bring over the little ones as well i'm sure we can i'm sure we can f afford to lose a few a few of these on the way <laughs> can't afford to lose a single one says mike okay it's very it's very demanding tonight shall i just put that on top of your board then you can leave those on the corner if that helps mm. I'll just there you go, my another one of... Does that help a little bit, Michael? That's Are you lovely. a happy boy now? Is a, is a happy bunny now? Oh, God, good. I have to keep Mike happy. It's the general thing. Right. General thing. Uh, so we've got the stopper <laughs> bead. And then what I did was... I wasn't precious about using the Super Duos because there are lots of the different colours, but I wanted them to be random because they're such lovely natural colours. Yeah. So I didn't look. So it was no. just basically pick up... And also, one of the things that you have to be a little bit wary of with the super duos, and I think most seed beaders will sell, tell you this, that sometimes only one of the hole works, the other one is blocked. So okay. just check, because what you don't want to do is do a whole piece, go to put something else, and you can't get, it, can't get your needle through. Right. So just a quick check um, to make sure that both holes are open. Yep. So it's six, it's uh, a super duo, one of the eight o's, 
Super Duo six times. Okay. So this is the only the only thing with demonstrating seed beads, isn't it? It's so rep repetitive, uh, repetitious. Re re repetitious. That's it. That's the one. That's the word. I would, oh. It is, but it's all good because this is, as I say, for anybody that's sort of learning, if you're watching for the first time, it's nice to gradually see the pieces take form. So I've got four. There we go. Did we get six there? One, two, three, four, five, six. Lovely. So then you have a, a row of those, bring them down to there, and then just take the needle back, move the little stopper out of the way, move the stopper out of the way, and just take your needle back. As I say, I'm not proficient, and so I found my own way of doing things. Which is nice to see. And as it's well quite, sometimes. yeah. And then so just, just going back straight through the same going hole. Going back straight through the same hole so that you can pull it round into a nice tight circle. We'll just pull the stopper bead back down a little bit. Pull it back round. And I usually go around again just to give it some tightness. The other thing that I did find as well, and looking in books and on the internet, that tension's a big thing mm -hmm. with the thread, and I hadn't thought about it at all. I thought, well, you know, you're just pulling. You have to be a little bit careful because it can buckle um, yeah. and go out of shape. So, so you wanted to keep the tension quite, quite strong as you're doing this? It, or you've bit? got to be a little bit careful not to do it too strong because you can pull it too tight and you, it, it does pull up in little part, in parts okay. and then buckle in others. Um, it did happen actually on that simple bracelet that you were looking at that I said that I'd right. made. If you took that off there, there is a little bit of buckling on one side okay. because I didn't get the tension right. But it's something that you learn mm. and it's a lovely learning curve and it's a error, really, it? really um, gentle way to learn. Yeah. So that's the start of it. Okay. And then I wanted to put something in the, the centre. These were just a little bit too... Well, you could actually put one of those in. That looks lovely, actually. It does. Um, I'll put one of those in because I'll show you how you can use the holes. Yeah. You've got the, you've got four holes on the back, so you can either stitch them, if which you are doing, it that way. Whoops. Side by side, which I did on the long necklace. I went. Yeah. But I had. Two needles, one one thread, but two needles, and I went at both sides. Okay. So you can do it that way to keep them nice and secure, or you can go crosswise. So they I may not do it with the needle in. It's not going to go through. No, but if you, but show, you, can if you see, show it just on that yeah. one, then you can see where the... You can see there's a, a oops, there you go. a crossway of doing it as well. Whoa. That's all right. It's not going to show, but maybe on that. On the overhead, yeah. So you can see so that you've got on there. Yeah. So that there are two ways that you can go about sti um, stitching that on. So it's kind of sort of at, at a cross section, yeah. if you like. Oh. So you're kind of going across section, or you're kind of going parallel, aren't you? Yeah. Side by side. Does that make sense? You've got your four holes like so. So your needles are high. Are uh, uh, going in sort of two holes like that. So the needle's going through, or on the two holes you're kind of going through at the cross section. Mm. Yeah. Fabulous. So I'll pop one of these in. Um, so I'll go, I'm, I'm going to do this on the cross section, so I'm, I'm doing the cross because that way it's not going to um, spin round. So bring that down there, bring it across into the centre. Mm -hmm. It will turn itself over in a minute, but yeah. it doesn't really matter at this point. I guess no, because it's just can, going over, yeah. isn't it? And then go back through the bottom hole of the seed beads and push needle through. And this is where you need to give it a good, a good tug. It's not quite yeah. filling the hole. Until you get parallel with the next, the vacant hole in the mm -hmm. Monte, which is quite a nice name, really. Mm. And then just go across, and then it stabilises it. Okay, so it's not going to spin around then. <laughs> and then it pulls out of your hand. Run away. <laughs> and then, again, 
pull it across. It maybe you maybe could do with putting some of the 50. This is where the, the seed beading in, in the, is the learning curve. You get little gaps, and you think, right, I'll take that out, and I can just pop some of the little 15 O's in. Right. And they just fill the, the little yep. ga gaps. They're useful for that. They are actually. They just add really a little nice bit size. of detail. And you get it's loads of them. Apps, it goes on forever. It's self perpetuating. Mm. You've used lots, and you open the thing, and you think, but I haven't used any. There's yeah, none sure. gone. Don't make a dent in those, really, do you, in the tube? So then you need to add the next row of beads. So we need to look and step up. Um, and this is a, a phrase that a lot of seed beaders use. Because you, you need to be up now to the next layer. Mm -hmm. So go through... You've come out through one of the um, eight O's, the white eight O's, yep. and you're going to go up the side of the super duo and come back out. So the hole that you've not gone through yeah. initially. And what we're doing is then adding two super duos and going through the next hole. Okay. Right so again, the way picking around. picking up the super duos at random, not... Um, yeah. Yeah, nice. Because they are just such, such beautiful colours anyway. They're lovely. And so it's right the way around going to... And give it a, a fair tug. Yep. So that you're getting a, a sort of a flower shape. Mm-hmm. And you can see it gradually starting to take form already, mm. can't you? So give that a good pull. I'll get rid of that stop bead now. Yep. And took that out of the way. So right the way around... I say the colours in these are just glorious. They really are. They're autumnal, but they've got that lovely sheen to them. Yeah. And they work so well with the um, the lovely little white ones. They really do. They're very, they're very seasonal. They're mm. very autumnal, but equally in the heat of summer. Very you summer still, those well, really yeah. rustic colours. Yeah. They're just amazing. So, so right the way around and just give it a pull. And this is the same technique that Karen's used on the necklace, the earrings, um, centre of the bracelet as well. So you can see that it really does work right the way through the kit. Mm. Really glorious. So we've come right the way around. So give it a little pull. It's not quite, I haven't given it enough of a pull. So just manipulate it until you're nice and yeah. happy with it. Why isn't that? Because I'm putting it. Do, 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 do. Something's gone wrong there. I know, I've gone through the wrong hole. Have I? Oh, not I've done. I guess the joy with seed beading is if you do make a little bit a mistake, if you like, a nobody's really necessarily going to know because you can kind of hide it with your designs. If you if you're thinking of putting that together in the in the centre with the the, the the floral design, you could always layer that up. You could put one of the other uh, flowers into there as well. If you do sort of miss one out, or as we said, you've got the you've got the smaller. Uh, seed beads in there as well. You've got the 15 O's, which slot nicely into those. <coughs> excuse me, into those little gaps. Something's gone wrong here, but hey ho, I've made a bit. Better. We'll edit that out later. <laughs> that would be nice. <laughs> mm. But it's part of the learning process, isn't it? It is. I can't remember what I did because it's not quite pulling together properly. But we'll, we'll overlook that little bit. Still looks beautiful. So it's not quite pulling together properly. Okay. I think it could be to do with putting that shut on in the middle, but I'm not sure. So we now have that sort of shape. Yep. So we've got two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. Yep. We've pulled together that. It's not quite. So then what did they do? <laughs> Had to work out. Step up. So then you step up again. We'll come back where we were coming out of there. Come through the bottom of the bottom of that super duo and you need to really <laughs> it's nice. not playing I'm going I'm go. in a bit of a nightmare here and this is much more fun when you're at home because because you can swear <laughs> but also, you're not you're, allowed. The here. thing with the guest designers is as well, you're doing everything kind of slightly mirror image as well, um, and obviously holding it down for the away, cameras is always yeah. going to be. It's always going to be. So that's we not... always forgive you. We always let you off. Don't you worry. Thank you. Um, you did a fab so job. Can I just? You do, can do, indeed. Do a... You can indeed. Because that's do, do, what we're creating at the end of the day. Obviously, with the necklace, 
we've got and we've got the center slightly different because you've used the larger of the the seed beads you've got the six o's a pretty little sort of peachy six o's in the center or you can obviously use the Swarovski that we've had in there and you see here's a lovely message from Nikki uh, saying hi Ruth Karen and crew your pieces are amazing Karen would never have thought that that was your first seed bead kit thank you very much so there indeed you go. there you go thank and you. Lena our crazy cat lady hi Lena and uh, Lisa Karen it's so good to see you again on our <laughs> JM screens after such a long time so are we away. feeling the love? We are, very good. much so. Thank you very much <laughs> good, indeed. Good, good, good. And Katie Parker. Ah, oh, good evening, uh, Karen. Katie, Katie, team. Great you. show. Beautiful jewellery, Karen. Can't wait for your demo. Well, there we go. Thank you. Lovely. Thank you, Lovely Katie. Messages. Katie's a really good seed beater. Well, there you go then. Couldn't be more, so, more praise. So a little bit lopsided is this. And I don't know right. where I've gone it's wrong. It's natural. It's organic, we call it's that. It's very organic. It's all good. It's all good. So we're now going... Um, we've... <laughs> Fine, we've put our lovely. two super duos side by side. Yeah. So we've got two super duos, a gap mm -hmm. over one super duo, yeah, and then two that. super duos. Yeah. So what we're going to do now is take two of these lovely... The little eight toes. Uh, eight toes. No, we won't. We'll, go, we'll step up at this side. Sorry. Sorry. This is a really good first demonstration after a long time. Hey-ho. No, it's good. So step up, and in between each of the two super duos side by side, add another one. Then. Oh, uh -huh, yeah, there we go. There we go. And then add two of the eight O's to bridge that little gap. And this is where it's a learning curve, because you've got to really work out how many of the beads will fit in, in the gap mm -hmm. sometimes you can maybe only get one 8 in or you might need an 11 or you might need to add the 15 o's which why they're useful because yeah. they act as really good little filler inners yeah they are so and then so it's then a super duo between the two two of the eight o's again two Right the way around. Whoa! And they're alive. The other thing is that with the super duos having the two holes mm -hmm. and only having um, threaded one of them, yeah. sometimes they, they spin out of place and you think, of oh course. no, I'm going to have to take it all apart again, it's not right. Then you're like, ah oh, no. It is. Just, <laughs> it's a bit frightening at times. And of course, when you're at home, obviously, you've not got the pressures of, of time as we have now, so you can no. just sit and take your time and relax. And, it's and it is really, really relaxing. It's <laughs> absolutely it's wonderful. It, it is, yeah. So just okay, carrying on that with that all the way. I think this could be a case in point where the... No, it isn't. It has got both holes through. Yeah. So it's just all the way around... As I say, it's numbers. I was keeping a tally. It's just keeping. Um, I love numbers and patterns, which is why I like wire weaving as well because of the um, the numbers in the white in the the wraps in the weaving. Yeah. And it's the same thing for the obviously if we're looking at the necklace now, but even on the earrings, you've got slightly larger of the of the floral pieces, but with the earrings, you've obviously got the little red. Swarovski right in the yes. centre and there as well, but you can see how that's gradually built up. And a slightly different slightly pattern. Different pattern. Yeah. yeah, but so beautiful, really, really successful. And those colours. Yeah, that's where I went wrong. Gorgeous. On that one. And all this cost 19.95. Uh, we've got a couple of kits remaining. They've flown. Uh, not surprising at that price. I'm not surprised. Um, they are fabulous. Who was that? Sorry. Oh, it's Katie. Katie Park has just got hers. There we go. She well said done, she Katie. might. Well done, Katie. You can't not. You can't, literally can't not do. I'm just having a quick look for a, for a Denise. I can't see her on there yet. Denise, if you're watching, send us a message. Karen needs to know. She needs. She needs to get hers. Janita, Brenda, Catherine, uh, Isabel, make sure you're checking out on yours as well. I can't see Denise yet. <clears throat> not yet. It's all good. Don't worry. It's so all I've good. missed. I've made a mistake there, and I've put two in there. Okay. So that's the joys of live television. And yeah. I th then I can, I, can I just, yeah. You can indeed. And so that was, that's basically the, that's it, that's the motif. Yep. And 
where the when you're doing the next one would it yeah when you're doing the next um part no, it was two in there no really um i can't remember myself when you're doing the next one to add on yeah. when you get to the very last one that you're going to put one single super duo in mm -hmm. use one from the previous um piece that you've made okay so you kind of look so that the bronze one in the center there yeah. let's say would be a part of that yeah and the same design. with that one and that one yeah so you're not adding any just you're linking up. linking just make yeah, sure that, that you sense. lay them together and you can link them together yeah, you can link can them together that. in completely different ways so that you've got a complete piece that goes all the way around nice a long drop you yeah. can make them slightly bigger and you can see even at the top you've got the two spaces at the top they just they if you put your piece in the center there that's like begging you can see mm. how that kind of would another one that would kind of work. link up in there as yeah. well loads of different make it, it bigger as earrings reminds me of crocheting when you see that you yes. see all the difference not that i've ever crocheted oh oh denise she's in brilliant yes please yes please and did you see the jadeite or maybe you didn't oh hold on katie parker said i've got oh. you the kit karen <laughs> no. how many do you want one or two <laughs> just one please thank you <laughs> thank you denise but katie's katie's there already thank bless you. you thank you bless you that's nice though isn't it it is katie if you could get the jadeite as well that would be wonderful if it's still available please please good mm -hmm. girl Thank Good girl. You. Thank, you. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. But no, it's, it's a, a, a really useful. I mean, you can do you could do a, a bigger one mm. and have smaller ones at the top. Use it as a I bracelet. Mean, can you imagine a huge sort of big collar neck. Yes, so you could go as small yeah. or as as large as you want. It's to a do, fabulous like that. little motif to use. And a ring. Just imagine one of yeah. those as a ring as well would look amazing. But it's slightly different to the beautiful. earrings one, but yeah. it's a, just a way that you can build on them. Same but different, really. Same isn't but it? different, yeah. But same, same technique, same exactly premise. Exactly the same technique. If I just put one of those alongside, I you just filled in with some extra. Um, yeah, I didn't yeah, use. So you got more the, of a circular yeah. edge on that rather than kind I of. I didn't a, use a the eight toes in the middle. Sorry. I did just use them on the outside because I go. wanted to show off those little montes. They, they, they are lovely. Just such a fabulous, fabulous kit. Great colours. Really, really beautiful. Yeah. Very, very beautifully well Beautifully put together. And Thank beautifully you. done. I think we'll all Thank agree you. first time. Thank My you. goodness me. Um, well done, you. And a rubbish demo. <laughs> Not at all. It was fabulous. It was fabulous. It went put wrong. It, put it this way. I'd, 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 be able to do, I'd, I'd be able to give that a really good shot from that. So, yeah, absolutely. Thank you. Don't give yourself Thank a you. hard time. You did a fab job. Thank you very much. Uh, so, very, very well done to those of you that have checked out. If you've got one in your basket, go for it now. We've got a fantastic... Are we doing a star buy? Or a show... A showstoppery star, oh. but let's do a star by for you right now. I shall, um, I shall lunge my way over. We'll see you in a, in a moment. <laughs> sprint. Or two. Oh, I can't do sprinting. I'll lunge. Star by coming up. <laughs> <laughs>that lunging all that lunging looked a bit john cleese-esque that didn't it <laughs> but rather than with the leg right okay let's do let's carry on with the lowest price ever shall we lowest price ever on these show do you know what phil get them in get them in get them on phil nominal deal coming up here with the rose gold these beautiful twist tubes i can't say a lot to that 10 pieces Whoop, whoop, whoop. Uh, rose gold plating over 95 sterling silver. The twist tubes that you're seeing come back you. Lovely with the jadeite. We did have a little, well, lovely with, it, with most gemstones, to be perfectly honest. Uh, but they are glorious, aren't they? Really, really pretty. Those twisted tubes look A for amazing. Right the way across there. Very, very beautiful. Um, if I pick one of those up, you can see, I don't like those tweezers, I'll pick these ones up instead. You've got a nice space actually through the the, 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 uh, the, the twisted tube. It's, it's not a tiny space. How does it say? Yeah, three by seven. So you've got a three millimeter tube. So you're actually going to get quite a lot through there. You, I would say you'd be able to put that on cord. I would have thought. Yeah, three mil. Mm -hmm. That should go yeah. on really easily, shouldn't it? Um, uh, most cords on that, most mediums, if you want to put a few strands uh, of your, um, your wire through there. But they are lovely size. And actually, you can see that twist. You can see the definition in those they are beautiful aren't they 
three ninety five. Rose gold plating over your 95 sterling silver. Just imagine popping one of those in between your gemstones. They really do add that little bit of something special. They also make your gemstones go a lot further as well, don't they? Uh, but you can see that rose gold. We love a bit of rose gold. They are glorious. So, yeah, very well done on those. Lowest price ever. They are amazing. Just beautiful. Look at those. In fact, let's try those with the lapis. Because obviously with the lapis, you've got the gold... There we go, and they're really mimicking that shape as well. Mike, I love you. I love I know you were trying to help, and I love you dearly for it. And you were helping. He was just saying it just, you know, it does it makes your gemstones go further in terms of your monetary value as well. It makes your money go further because you won't be using as much as many gemstones. Mm. He's a good lad, isn't he? He knows his stuff, does Michael? Knows his stuff. Uh, three three ninety-five. Very well done. Barbara, June, Elizabeth, Rachel, Angela, congratulations on those. Really, really fantastic. Uh, don't have long remaining in this hour either, so get involved on those. And they will work really nicely. We've got the gold copper wire, well, the champagne actually coming up for you. Is the champagne? Yes. Uh, coming up for you in the second kit, but still rose gold and the champagne gold still looks so, so lovely together. Really pretty. Well done on those. They're gorgeous. We like those. We like those a lot. Right. Oops. Let's grab the pearl chain. Wow. This is very pretty. I'm very pleased to say that Toby has stepped up and is now sporting <laughs> his bright pink headband. Oh, there he is. Get involved. With all the oh, colours yeah. now. Limbering up as well. Look at that. Should have had shorts on, really, Toby. A little vest, shorts. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? He will... He will, by the end of this hour, I've just been told, Toby said what he will do by the end of this hour is go full out, headband, armbands and the sunglasses. Just to get ready for that, at the end of this hour, he is going for the whole decorative thing. Uh, so you do, you look like one, of, I can't say the, uh, the telephone type brand, but you look like one of those men warming up on the, you know what I mean. Uh, right, have a little look at this. This is glorious. Now, how long is this, is this a, is this a metre? Ooh, very oh, very nice. That's pretty. Like that's it. going to be glorious to work with. Look at this. Very, very cute. Those pearls are beautiful. Sterling silver freshwater pearls on all of that chain. A metre length of chain. Now, you could quite simply just pop a clasp on that. You could do, sort of double that up on the neckline if you wanted to, or you could take a little section of that out, but it looks glorious. <laughs> Michelle, calm down, Michelle. Calm down. Four sports god in sight. It's a difficult job we have to do here, Michelle. Working in the studio with yeah. Toby. It's hard work. Really hard work. Yeah. You wait till a minute, Michelle, when he's got the whole kit on the, the, the armbands, the sunglasses, the whole thing. Uh, <laughs> looks good in pink, doesn't he, our Toby? Looks good in pink. Same as you. Um, he, although Toby doesn't need the sweatband, Michelle, because he doesn't, he doesn't perspire. He doesn't perspire. Uh, some lovely sized pearls in here. Some really, really pretty sized pearls. And of course you can, if you want to just chip in, just clip into the pearl. You can take off the little pearls you've got. You clip into the wire at the other side of the, the sort of the, the loop. You can just keep those really, really beautifully sort of set. They look amazing. <laughs> I, d I didn't know what I was hearing in my ear there. I'm not quite sure I can, I can repeat that, really. But uh, I I'll, I'll just wrap it around my hand for now. Let's have a little look at those. Because that would look lovely all together as a very, very beautiful, big sort of chunky bracelet. That's glorious. Aren't they lovely? We're going to do you a great price on these. And they are real, genuine pearls. I'm presuming these are natural. You've got your freshwater pearls, or are they dyed? Okay, well, do you know what? It doesn't matter because you've got such perfection. As long as we tell you it's all good, whether gemstones are dyed or heat treated or irradiated, it really doesn't matter as long as it's disclosed. So they really, really, really hold up. And of course, that colour is amazing. Normally, coming in at £35 or £34.95. Uh, not surprising because you've got an entire metre, an entire metre of pearls. I'll just loop those around twice and hold those up because look at this price. Would you pay that for the sterling silver normally? That's a big chunk. Mm. <laughs> That's a massive, massive saving. They are incredibly beautiful. You're going to do a lot with these, I know you are. I mean, what a glorious, just a very, very simple, gorgeous necklace on its own. Uh, that is so lovely. For the summer as well, to have this size of pearl, I think, is perfect. You sometimes don't want to go big. No. You want the opportunity. And with that chain link, it makes it really refined, doesn't it? Yes. Yeah. They look gorgeous. 
really dainty. Still an impact. Yeah, totally. And a necklace you'd wear, well, you could wear that to work. That would go from desk to dance floor, wouldn't it? Very, very easily. You could wear that in, in sort of in the daytime and then dress it up in the evening as well. I'm not going <coughs> to, excuse me, I'm not going to have enough of these, that's for sure. Uh, massive saving. We should be looking at £35, basically, on that one. But a lovely, lovely piece of jewellery. They are glorious. Hello, Sue. Sue said, Ruth, you're such a nutter. I know. <laughs> That's why we love you. And lunge, lunge. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Uh, so, I hope you're doing those lunges at home, Sue. Don't, don't. Uh, 1795. Very, very well done. 0806 Don't forget, that's an entire metre. A metre of pearls. So, so pretty. What did you do, Mike? You broke your foot trying to do a lunge. See, we did ask for those stories, we did, didn't we? Yeah. The disaster stories. <laughs> Who wanted that's that not a good one? Move. No, that's not a good move, is it, at all? Uh, Sakina, well done. Toy and Victor. Uh, Maria, congratulations. Susan, Tina's, Tina's got two. Well done, Tina. Al, congratulations. Nice to see you there as well today. Remember, it's the, it's the amount you've got a metre's worth. You've got four by five pearls on there. I'd, I, I don't know if I've got time to count all those, to be fair, but I just wanted to give you a bit of an idea. I probably can do that quite quickly. Is it valuable when we count them? Sometimes it's nice to know, mm. isn't it? Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-four, twenty-six, twenty-eight, thirty, thirty-two, about thirty-two, thirty-four pearls. So a lot of pearls for seventeen ninety-five, and all of the chain. What is that per pearl? Wow. Okay, that's 53 pence per pearl, and that excludes the chain. Really, really lovely. Really lovely. These pearls are causing a storm. Toby in his pink headband is causing a storm right now. It's a good job we didn't get Toby in his shorts as well, isn't it? Can you imagine? Can you imagine? Uh, that's next Thursday. Uh, well done. <laughs> Congratulations to you on that one. Oh, 0800 655. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful strand there for you of the pearls. They are absolutely lush. Glor Look at the colours. Metallic blues. You can see some pinks. You can see some greens. The peacock tones in there. Very, very fabulous indeed. They are glorious. Run in and grab hold of those. Winifred, well done. Madeline, uh, nice to see you there as well. People are multi-buying quite happily on those. Well, I guess... You're not far off, sort of, uh, the, the pr two for the price of one nearly, though. If you're thinking £35 ordinarily, my maths isn't that bad. You're not far off, are you? Yeah. To be perfectly honest. So it's like a buy one, get one free, really, isn't it? It is free. We won't tell, we won't, you know, it's like a, what do they call it? A bog off. Mm -hmm. A buy one, get one free. These are cute. These are cute. Right. <gasps> Let's do some more. Let's squeeze one more in before the star buy. How about... <gasps> like the look. i tell you what you might need... Who fancies ch uh, chain? 10 metres of chain. I've still got, I've still got some of this and I've had it a year or two. I remember when we first started to do these and you couldn't get your hand, they were like hen's teeth. They were, so, hens don't have teeth, that's why they're rare. Um, 10 metres of silver plated copper extender chain. It, it's brilliant, it goes on forever and ever. I wonder how many times around Toby it would go. 10, we won't try it now, but 10 metres. 10 metres. And of course, we, we've spoken so many times earlier on today as well about having maybe a little section of gemstones on the neckline and then your chain link coming up as well. Here's your chain link. Add on a connector, add on a clasp really, really easily. Perfect to, well, obviously, if you're adding your jump rings mm -hmm. onto that, it's a nice space, isn't it? Three by two. Your links are actually quite large, so you're not going to struggle to get your jump rings into that if you wanted to perhaps wrap a head pin on there. There's lots you can do with that. I mean, how many bracelets, how many pairs of earrings? Because great for drop earrings. Lovely bracelets, for drop earrings, yeah. Everything, in fact, Brilliant, everything yeah. really. Yeah. And 10 metres is going to take quite a while to get through, isn't it? That's, I'm guessing that's going to last you quite It quite will a while. do, yeah. yeah. Well, I've still and got mine, Mike. Great to have. Mm. Yeah, my initial buy, I still have some. Still have some. And it was, they were just so, literally, I remember when they first came into, into jewellery making, everyone was just like, oh, my goodness. I'm, perfect. And we still use it. We still love it. Mm -hmm. Just great to have. Why not? <gasps> yeah. And 11.95. Our prices are just getting better and better and better, aren't they? As well. This is so lovely to have on that spool. They're fabulous. 10 meters. And remember, that is silver-plated copper extender chain. And be really confident when you're buying that. Don't buy it and think, oh, that's going to rub off in half a second. It won't. It really, really won't. You can really use that and, and, and work with it very, very nicely. And of course, mixing and matching with your gemstones. A great way, perhaps, to start a really basic um, charm bracelet as well, if you wanted to, with mm. that, because they're a yeah. nice size link. Yeah. 
really, really substantial. And obviously little drops of, of gemstones just falling down. You can have a, a, you know when we see the big sort of, um, I want to say the waterfall necklaces. Yes. You know what I mean, don't Dripped. you? Sort of yes. Be yes. lovely, because you've got so much chain link to do that with. You can absolutely go all out, create a, imagine that with covered in maybe about five or six layers of chain link with pearls dropping down. Mm. There, I can imagine just sort of Charlize Theron wearing something like, she's a glorious lady, isn't she? Oh, my goodness me. She was discovered in a bank, you know, Charlize Theron. She was in a bank, I think... She, I think she was in, because she's South African, isn't she? She was, she was apparently paying it. She was paying something in, uh, allegedly. She was in a bank, I think, paying something in. Something wasn't going right. She was screaming, shouting, or having a bit of a deal. And so a casting director walked up to her and went, right, get in touch with me. And that, and that, that was how it started. So clearly, I need to kick off in a shop, don't I? You, <laughs> or a bank. You know, You'd get bank. arrested. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe not. Uh, 11.95. <laughs> very, very well done. These prices as well. Phil might be getting arrested. Uh, the jewellery police will be after him. Uh, very well done on that. Loads and loads and loads there for you. So huge congratulations on those tonight. You're doing brilliantly. And of course, so many different ways you're going to be able to use that. That's just genius. Ten whole metres. You could skip with that on Sports Day, couldn't you? Uh, Michelle said, Ruth, do not get us started. We need to focus on the super deals. Michelle, I, you started it. I, I'm just reading out the messages. I'm just behaving myself. Because I always behave myself, don't I? Right, shall we do the filigree silver ball? It's so fabulous. You're going to use this big time. And definitely you'll need more than one, simple as that. Uh, let's do it as a star vi right now on our sports day themed collection of gloriousness. Let's do it. How cute. You're going to love this. You are going to... This is like an ornate sterling silver lantern. I could imagine this sort of with a little like glowing, just sort of... Oh, beautiful. Have a little look at this. It's, it's, it's a big, big, big sterling silver ball, but it's just magnificent. One of those on the centre of a bracelet looks tremendous. Well, with my jadeite, obviously. Absolutely. Of course. Glorious. Oh, well, I'm not surprised. It's a fabulous, fabulous piece. The filigree is amazing. These glorious tails of sterling silver that you can see look so fabulous. Those waves of sterling silver that meet in the middle. You've got a really nice size uh, hole running right the way through the centre there. So no problems whatsoever threading that onto, onto pretty much everything. You could actually pop one of those on a piece of organza as well and it would sit very prettily. You could perhaps fill that with little gemstones if you've got some of the sort of the some of the seed beads even if you wanted to or imagine sort of decorating and adorning the sterling silver you could weave through with some of the some of the sort of smaller of the seed beads in there as well but ultimately just fabulous I'm going to bring in that jadeite again because I am I am obsessed it, it's true but if I was going to get my hand on this sterling silver filigree I would put one of those right in the center and have that as the feature piece of my bracelet imagine that wrapping round on the back I mean, look at that. Look at that. Just imagine. In fact, if I hold that up, I really want to, I kind of want to, to slot that in while I'm there. If I hold it like that. There we go. Imagine that sort of in the centre of your bracelet. Then you've got a sterling silver clasp at the back. It's, it's almost all you need. I'd put in a couple of silver spaces, a couple of jump rings maybe uh, in there as well. But what a centrepiece. Really sets it off. And it's pure nine to five sterling. Nine to five, and it's big. It's 15 millimetres. Probably one of the bigger ones that we do, I would suggest. It's that a one. substantial size. It's beautiful. Yeah, it's really lovely. And the detail's gorgeous. And whether you're seeing the skin tone through that or whether, as I said, I mean, you could, you could really adorn that, couldn't you? I'm just thinking, if you were to pass a needle through, if you've got a seed bead on the end and you were to pass a needle through, you could actually end up with a little seed bead perhaps sitting or a little sort of... Mm. just sitting on the on the little sort of curl or, uh, it, all the way through on that one the, obviously you're very creative there's loads I'm sure that you're, you're thinking of right now uh, on the centre of a necklace as well absolutely fantastic you can have three of those perhaps spaced out on a, on, on a necklace and uh, even I mean I'm not shying away from those on earring drops as well I know they'd be quite big but it, you know I've seen bigger silver earrings to be fair but it's really up to you but that's 2.7 grams of silver it's a really good gram weight isn't mm. it really good gram weight and actually I know that's just against the I've got my whistle on obviously for sports day but it's, it's actually quite interesting just to see that thank you that whistling in my ear that was lovely <laughs> um, 
Uh, for me, uh, <laughs> yeah. Just seeing that against the cord, just even imagine that against a, sort of a, a row of black sort of microfasted spinel. Oh, ah, delicious. Well. Would run through actually mm. the microfasted gems, yes. wouldn't they? Mm. That would look really lovely. Seven ninety-five on that one. They're adorable. Just glorious. Don't know. I mean, I don't know how we've done that. Seven ninety-five. They are fantastic. Really beautifully done that one. Lovely against pearls. Some of the bigger pearls we had earlier on. Just absolutely glorious. Elevating your designs. Look at that. I mean, that's a chandelier of gloriousness, isn't it? 15 millimetres. I could sing a song about that. I mean, it's so lovely. Uh, very well done on those. Keep adding that into your basket. Keep adding those into your order. We've got lots coming up for you at the other side of this. And in fact, it's that time, isn't it? It's nearly eight o'clock. So it is our must have this evening, which you are going to adore. Uh, lots still to do, including another fantastic kit we're going to get dressed up for. See you in a minute. Our brand new Get Started with Jewellery Maker page has been created to provide help and guidance for jewellery making newbies. If you need design suggestions, hints and tips, or help with perfecting your jewellery designs, we're here to help. Head over to facebook.com slash getstartedwithjm where our talented in-house designers are happy to answer your jewellery making questions, offer inspiration and get you started in your jewellery making journey. Jewellery Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Tune in on Tuesday, July the 25th for the launch of Alison Tarry's Seed Bead Figurines. Alison will guide you from start to finish on how to create a seed bead witch, fairy and an angel. Take your seed bead work to the next level and get this DVD well in advance for Christmas so you can start to design your incredible decorations. So make sure you're watching on Tuesday at 10am. When you place your first order with Jewellery Maker, we'll send you a free DVD and booklet to help you get started. The booklet is jam-packed full of information on gemstones, tools, threading, materials and findings. There are step-by-step -step instructions on how to make bracelets, earrings and necklaces. And the DVD includes easy-to-follow video tutorials. So what are you waiting for? Start your jewellery making journey today. Maker phone is free from a UK landline, so call us today to place your order. Jewelry Maker course gift vouchers are now available. You can choose from a bronze, silver, or gold voucher. Each voucher is worth a different amount that entitles you to put towards a course of your choice. For more information, contact our call centre on 0800 644 655. those glasses I don't, I don't understand those <laughs> they're like really cool apparently those glasses with the lines in. I don't get it no I don't I, yeah I don't, we'll, we can do we'll do that later Mike we'll do that later It'd be a little bit, Sorry. bit like a migraine waiting to happen I know. It, with a, it's yeah. like you're walking around with when you're stuck in the blinds mm. I don't I don't understand <laughs> I'm stuck in a Venetian blind <laughs> um right today's must-have is happening right now for you these are so so beautiful this color is on a different level in fact name the gemstone do you know what this gemstone is Karen have you heard? No. What would you go for if you give us a guess? 
Well, I'm I'm rubbish. I, sorry, I, I guess it, I would say chrome dioxide, but it's yeah, not. Yeah, it's, but it, but you know what? They, that would be a great great guess, chrome dioxide, because the colours the colours more intense than peridot. Mm, yeah. So you kind of look at you you, th you look at it. You might think peridot, and you kind of you, you strike that off because the colour is so intense. Chrome dioxide would be my guess. If I didn't know, I would I would try to go with the chrome. But you look at it, and there's something else happening. You've got some lighter, brighter shades in there as well. We don't normally expect to see this gemstone this colour. Ordinarily, it tends to be the blues because this is appetite, green appetite. Oh, it's wonderful though, isn't it? I wouldn't but we don't, we don't, it's not one that comes to mind straight away. It's not because we don't tend to see it. Um, 85 carats of green appetite. You tend to get appetite in the smaller gemstones, one, two, three millimetres more on average. Um, we're going to take every penny that we can off this for you tonight because that's what we've been doing. We had uh, the opportunity to do this. Colin came down and said, yep, yeah, have a fab night, go for it. And, and you can go to the lowest price on most of the pieces. So we went, OK, we'll <laughs> take that. Thank you very much. Um, but for a gemstone that's known for these swimming pool blues, these appetite hues, we're going straight down. More of the sort of asparagus tones here, actually. I was at eight, six pounds. On the nose, six pounds pounds for 85 carats of green appetite really an exciting gemstone the tone is fabulous you're gonna to have to be super 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 quick on this one uh, if you are hungry for your appetite gemstones grab them if you have an appetite for this glorious color give it a go lovely with the peridot it does work beautifully with other green gemstones look at that i love those two together can you see what it does it picks out the lighter mm. tones love those together and gold i'd want i would oh, in fact you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna grab giving it away a little bit. I'm going to grab one of the hair combs, one of the slides that are coming up. And you kid, this is exciting. Um, look at that with the green, the gold and the green. What a perfect combination. Absolutely beautiful to see those together. Six pound flat price on those today. Uh, wonderful. Again, with the champagne wire as well. See, I love my wire work as well. Love it. Look at that with the greens. Greens and golds work perfectly because obviously with the gemstone, you do get a lot of those. That'd be a nice kit as well, wouldn't it, actually? Kid builder. Right, there we go. Green appetite uh, being loved by loads of us out there. Michelle, well done. Hazel, Edith, Kath, and Marie Angela grabbing two. Sandra, nice to see you there as well today. Fellow Leicestershire lass like myself. Um, six pounds. I'm from Hinkley originally. Hinkley. Where are you from, Toby? Are you a Leicester boy? Near Hinkley. Near, you're near Hinkley. Have we had this conversation? Yes. Oh, I'm so sorry, I forgot. <laughs> I do apologise. <laughs> I do apologise. Uh, six pounds. Very, very, very well done indeed on those ones. Oh, eight hundred six triple four six. I like the way Toby got a bit coy then and went, yeah, I'm, yeah, round about. <laughs> Not telling you exactly. That's, that's fair play. Uh, <laughs> everyone will be there on the door. Hi, Toby. Uh, very well done. Keep adding and adding those in. The appetite quality in there is just glorious. Very, very pretty indeed on those on six pounds. I'm coming out to Inkley uh, on uh, uh, the weekend. That'd be nice. Say hello. Could say hello. Meet up. Cornish pasty. We're not known for Cornish pasties in Leicestershire. What are we known for? Hosiery, isn't it, in Leicestershire? Yeah. It's hosiery. Yeah, knitting, basically. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you can't eat that. So, what are we known for food wise in the Midlands? Well, in, in sort of Leicestershire. Cheese. Oh, I guess. And pork pies. Melton Mowbray, yieldy mm. pork pies. Yeah. Cheese, yeah, Leicester. You've got a bit. Of, I'm not keen on red Leicester. No. I have to say, sorry, everybody. Uh, yeah, I've, it's not red, red Leicester. Well, no, funny, very. I like the really crunchy stuff. You know, in the, the it's really got strength, really, strength, strength, bit of body, mm. bit of strength, bit more. Oh. Uh, brie, don't mind a bit of brie. Don't mind a bit of bit of brie. Uh, right, Tina, collectors uh, in Yorkshire. Well done, uh, London. Congratulations. Six pounds only on that strand. It's got the most glorious colour. Very, very pretty. Um, you've got those lovely yellows in there as well. Uh, this 9 to 5 sterling silver, but gorgeous. I mean, do mix that with the Peridot strand if you've got that. Let me give those a bit of a twist together. And with a, bit of, a little bit of gold in there as well, I think looks absolutely superb. Really glorious. If you love your green gemstones, you will adore green appetite. Um, it's really unusual to see that colour, unusual to see that kind of size, actually. But when we get them, we just, we've got to grab them. Simple as that. Pop mini stash. Even if, you've, if you're unsure of the gem, you've never seen it or you've never worked with it before, give it a go. Tonight's the night, trust me. Uh, literally, these are kind of miss it, miss out, lowest, lowest prices. They are fabulous. Very, very well done on those. Leaving those going for you. Well done if you get those. I, I love you. Mike, I love you tonight. We're getting some of the most lovely little songs from Mike tonight. <laughs> little ditties. They don't necessarily all make sense, but I love them. I love them and I embrace them. It's fabulous. Well, he's in his own little world. I like it.
just sitting there amusing himself and his little <laughs> little songs. Love him. Uh, right, let's dive into box number one, shall we? This cute National Hot Dog Day. Do you know what it also is? It's na I kid you not. If you have a look on the internet, today is National Get to Know Your Customers Day. We missed a trick with that. National Get to Know Your Customers Day. Well, I think we are getting to know you. You're certainly getting to know us tonight as well, aren't you? Have a look at this. It was National Mac and Cheese Day the other day. I love that when you when you go on the internet and you look and it comes up with the most random things of yeah, what National it, Day it is. Yes, yeah. Random, random. Right, have a, I think I googled my birthday. It was really disappointing in terms of the National Days. It was really rubbish. <gasps> look at this. Oh, hello, Labradorite. I've never, I'm guessing you love Labradorite. I do, yeah, I I've, do. I've never met a guest designer that doesn't. I, don't, I think that's probably impossible. I, don't, I can't imagine anybody would look at Labradorite and go, oh no, not for me. No, 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 not at all. No. Just doesn't happen. It's an impressive stone, isn't it? When you look at it, you just think, wow, it's magical. It's got this glorious, glorious Labrador essence. And actually, I'm just moving that, rocking that around. And it's highlighted because it's faceted. You've got the checkerboard faceting on there, which will look brilliant with that. I love the faceting on that, yeah, because mm. it really does catch the Labrador essence. And from my angle, it's not showing up. It's showing up there colours. on that one, but the greens are coming through. Yeah. But what, to the camera, it's the copper colours that are coming yeah. through and the golds. It's, yeah, I love, yeah, Labradorite every time. Yeah, totally. And actually, there's kind of a straw, there's kind of a pink flash. You do get yeah. pink flash Labradorite. Mm. I'm not saying that's what this is because it's, it's not on paper. However, I'm, I'm, I'm only saying what I kind of see there. And you've got those lovely pink tones. I'm just looking on the big screen. You can see these lovely pink flashes. And, of course, you might get the blues. Labradorite is renowned for having that metallic Labrador essence, those layers and layers within the gemstone. And the light comes in, it refracts, it bends, it slows down, and it reflects. And you get this incredible um, alchemy within the gem. Now, if you want to keep it really simple, as you see, they've just literally put it on a, on a strand. But... Um, <coughs> excuse me. If you want that to sit correctly, if you just put a, a little jump ring on there then obviously your jump ring will go that away. Does that make sense? So uh, if you, you've got it like that, twist it, that way so your jump ring just pops in. And then obviously it's going to sit on the chain like so. You could be very much more creative. You could actually turn it around. Look at the back. That's that pinky tone I'm talking about. See, it looks equally as fabulous from the back. Almost like sort of, if I turn it that way, sort of tall trees and the moonlight sort of flashing through. It's so, do excuse my fingernail, that fingernail is annoying, I chipped it just before I got on air and it's the, uh, I'm very funny with my fingernail, I'm a real Virgo, they've got to be perfect, so apologies for that. Um, you could wire wrap that on a ring as well and you've got the actual, you've got kind of the connector built in, if you wanted to start to secure that with the connector, I mean, these prices are genius tonight, aren't they? Mm. Loving them, 5 95 would you wire wrap that and make that into a ring? Could do all sorts, could you, you could, really? yeah, I would, I would wire wrap it quite elaborately around yeah. it and use it as a pendant. Yeah, I mean, you could really extend mm. that, couldn't you? And it would still work because Labradorite always does. It always just stands out on its own. Yeah. yeah. So no matter what you put around it, it doesn't overpower it ever. It's no, you always so see the Labrador yeah. essence. Yeah. yeah. They are glue. And two of those, actually, I'm just thinking earring-wise, they're not heavy. They're not, I know you've got 12 carats, which you can certainly feel, but they would still work... Uh, in fact, if you've got the chain link, you could drop those down on a little bit of chain link as well. But lovely big sort of statement mm. earrings, obviously. They don't really work with my headband. But um, they'd make... Look at the Labrador Essence from there. I think that's kind of what you're talking about. They kind yes. of really catch the light, don't they? They are fab. Oh, yes. We could... I could work with those. Could work with those very mm. easily. Pen, sweet. Earrings, pendant, ring, Brace. even sort of bracelet. Yeah. Job done. Job done. Uh, anklet if you wanted Michael absolutely why not we do we do neglect the ankles and I think in the summer we shouldn't we shouldn't we should we should in fact I need to make an anklet for Marley Bobs I want to wear an anklet because I, I, I love them uh, but uh, yeah not going to get my ankles out now uh, five pounds <laughs> 95 for 12 carats of sterling silver they are so so pretty very very well done don't you keep your ankles covered Toby <laughs> uh, 806 <laughs> triple four we're flashing those around six double five and on the web at jewelry maker dot com lovely front or back obviously faceted to sit like that but no reason and of course fully bezel set on that electroplated sort of the silver flash lovely on the back as well i mean that is see, that's like a sunset when you're on your holidays mm. and the sky lights up and you get that wonderful sort of orange and red really glorious very best of luck that's mag literally magnetic you could just look at that and see lots of different colors fabulous job done 
Wonderful. Now we have now. What a strand! My gosh. <gasps> Big carrot weight for this gem. Huge. Ninety-five carats of ruby. Wow. 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 Are we allowed to do it on this as well? Oh <gasps> my goodness me. These are scrumptious. Oh, beautiful. You've got natural African ruby. So intense. So, so these are like the colour of the most beautiful sort of juicy cranberries. Yeah. The colour, isn't it? I was it? just thinking that. Oh my yeah. word. I mean, they are so fabulous. One gemstone is going to make your piece of jewellery and, and really raise the stakes on that. They are glorious. Love the shape. They're kind of a, um, I know they're rice beads, but they're almost like little um, nevet shapes, like sort of marquee shapes mm, actually, aren't they? They are. But and so beautiful, delicious. beautiful sheen on them. Aren't they just... You've got this lovely sort of luster, that vitreous luster, that glow. And if you look into the gemstones, you will see all the way around. It, they almost look like they're, 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 they're having a dance in the gemstone. You've got almost this sort of glitter effect that's coming through on those gemstones. So, so stunning. Rich, velvety cranberry tones. You've got... The, I always go to the wine, but if you think about the Shiraz, the Cabernet Sauvignons, the different blends that you've got within there. Such a lovely blend of colour. Really, really striking. And to have this high adornment of gemstones, one of the big four gems... To say that you have 95 carats of ruby in your collection is something else. It's 17 centimetre strand. There's a, look, there's a really, really healthy amount on there. If I just hold that up, I'll give them a bit of a count in a second, but I'll just hold that up on my neckline. What an amazing necklace you could create with that. Imagine walking into a, into a, um, a big event. Maybe you, you, you're thinking, I don't want to talk, you know, it was Christmas in July soon, so we can, say the, we can say the Christmas word. But you're going to a Christmas party, you're the lady wearing the ruby necklace, the 95 carat. When somebody compliments on you, your necklace, say, oh, what's, what, what's, oh, it's rubies, 95 carat ruby necklace. How much would you think somebody had paid for the privilege? Because it would be a privilege to wear something like this. I mean, you could be talking hundreds and mm. hundreds of pounds, couldn't you? 95 carats? I mean, I'm starting low, really. If I think sort of, even if we're talking sort of... If that, if that was in a window, if that was with precious... Do you know what? If that was with precious metal in a boutique and that, was, that had a four-figure price tag or a, a 999... You wouldn't bat an eyelid. You'd, yeah. you'd walk by and look and you'd, you'd appreciate it. Probably have to walk on because you couldn't afford it. But you would look and, and if it had the little tag that said 95 carat natural African ruby, you, 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 I wouldn't bat an eyelid. I wouldn't bat an eyelid. Imagine that wrapped up with yellow gold, looking stunning with sterling silver. Deep, rich colour. That amazing, empowering gemstone. <sighs> and we do this. We do this today <laughs> at just £11.95. Happy, happy, happy days. Eleven ninety five for that strand. Definitely order your authenticity card. Get a couple because you might not just do one big necklace on that. You might just take a couple out. You might choose to make the most fabulous. I'd love just a couple of drop earrings. I think they'd be really mm. sweet, really sweet. Um, you might want five or six different authenticity cards because... Excuse me, I've got hiccups. I do apologise. I'm trying. I'm trying to get rid of these. It's because I've been laughing. It's because I've been having a giggle. Um, <laughs> you, 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 you could have several pieces of jewellery to create a suite there, and they would be amazing. I often get hiccups when the prices are really low as well. <laughs> <laughs> often have to see. Don't laugh. Don't laugh. I can't hold my breath. I haven't got long enough. I haven't got long enough. I'm not going to do the water trick either because that would be very messy. Do you know, biologically, I, I read this somewhere. It might be wrong. Biological fact, apparently, is you actually only see they're gone now. You only hiccup once, apparently, because you little, you little, apparently you do, uh, biologically, apparently you only hiccup once, because you talk, and because it's because I'm talking not so often get hiccups as well, and your little, your little thing, your little flappy bit that like makes, I don't know, gets, a, goes wrong, no, I don't know which, I don't know what it's called, get, goes a bit wrong and you go, oh, and you hiccup, and then you only carry on hiccuping because you're going, oh, I'm going to hiccup, so your breathing goes all out of sync. So that's kind of like psychological hiccuping. Is that yeah. making any sense yes. whatsoever? Yeah, because if somebody is hiccuping and you say, stand there and hiccup, they don't. No, yes. and they, that's why they go, yeah. they can just go like mm. that because you constantly, if you just breathe normally, they, yes, they're gone. So there. There you go. Every Sport day is a school day. day. Hiccuping. Absolutely. I always <laughs> have none. one random fact I've discovered recently on the show. That's my random fact of today. 
whether it's got have a look i think it's true uh, 11 <laughs> Ruth's random fact that might not be true. <laughs> I always give myself a caveat. I'm pretty certain, though. That's what it is. Anyway, um, <laughs> Ruth's fact of the day. 11.95 on your rubies. Followed up by maybe. Uh, <laughs> brilliant. If you're grabbing a couple of those, Vera, I don't blame you, my lovely. They are stunning. Yeah, text in facts that might not be true. Uh, Kelly, well done. Is that what you call an oxymoron? A fact that might not be true. Is it? I don't know. Uh, there's more water in the sea than there is in the lakes around the world. That's obvious, isn't it? <laughs> Oh, there we go. That's Mike's fact of the day. Oh, it's... Um, beautiful. Very, very well done indeed on those. 0800 644 Oh, we've started something now. In all seriousness, they are to treasure. They are super, super lovely. Very, very well done indeed. Oh, we started something with that, didn't we? My goodness me. Right, next up, let's do... Now, these are big. <whistles> My goodness. Whoa. I need two hands for these. <gasps> Wow. Wow. You've got over 900 carats here. I love hematite. End of story. Amazing. But golden coloured hematite. Golden coloured balls of hematite. Striking. Look at that. I mean, that's disco-tastic, isn't it? There's your, there's your Christmas party. Done. Absolutely job done. And um, if you want to go all out, that's the strand to do it with. That is the strand to do it with. If not, grab one or two of those and make a big feature on the neckline. They are, look at those. You can really see every single facet here, can't you? Every single facet all the way around on those golden balls. They are beautiful. 930 carats. A gemstone, very rich in iron, actually. The hematite underneath. Hematite's more of a um, kind of a silvery uh, sort of feel when you see it. Actually, almost like a metallic gunmetal sort of silvery colour in essence. But it takes a coating brilliantly. And it's still... I mean, they are alive, aren't they? Let's be fair. <laughs> My gosh, really quite fair. Imagine that with your little black dress. <laughs> serious jewellery going on there. Really serious. Might be too much as one. It might be too much for you. I like that. If you want to make a statement, imagine that as a big sort of choker necklace. I think that would look incredible. But you might just choose to take one of those as a feature because it, it holds its own, one of those alone, with black spinel maybe either side, one of those on a bracelet, one of those wire-wrapped into a ring could look amazing. Obviously, you have that lovely sort of 3D effect on there. But they are shouting out from the rooftops, aren't they? They glisten mm. like something else. Absolutely stunning. If you want high, high sort of end glamour, go for the golden coloured hematite. And have a look at them. Maybe this isn't your, your thing normally. Maybe you prefer a little bit more of the uh, subdued tones, the muted tones, the pales, the pastels. Go for something completely different. You've got your 30 day money back guarantee because they are, that's got to be the party gemstone. 100%. 38 centimetre strand. Wow. And for £11.95, you've got a massive carat weight massive carrot weight 930 carats do you know what there are so many little ditties so many little jingles we could do don't you think this is mike strand of the show mike strand of the show it leads a little something doesn't it really and then little mike's face mike a little thing down here mike's face comes up with his thumbs yeah something like that don't know 11 <laughs> oh dearie me they are super 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 Loads of different gemstones that they could work with, but I, I just, I, for me, gold, black gemstones and gold are just the ultimate combination, aren't they? Yeah. Really, well, really delicious. That stand is brilliant. It sort of, when you picked it up, it sort of, it was one of those that said, right, I'm here. Uh, just a <laughs> one bit. One of those. Da -da. Yeah. Doesn't need announcing, brilliant, doesn't it? No. It, it, it makes a, it makes its entrance all on its own very, very easily. But they are. Should we hold it up? Should we have a little look at that around the neckline? Can you imagine? <laughs> They are phenomenal. Look at those ready to disco. That's why I think they make a really nice sort of choker necklace. But actually, imagine just three of those on a piece of black cord. Mm. They'd look pretty funky as yeah. well, wouldn't they? Loads you can do on those. Loads. And at 11 you, you, I mean, stretchy bracelet. Done. Done, done, done. Wonderful. Uh, right, let's have a little look. We've got another. Oh, this is lovely as well. Black onyx. Do you know what? This could work really nicely dropping down from that. Here we go. I mean, honestly, wait till you see the price of this as well. 20 carats. 
of sterling silver electrophated black onyx that faceted pear drop it's almost like it's almost spear like isn't it in terms of that really lovely drop obviously if we turn it that away there's your teardrop uh, and you could still set it that way on a pendant if you wanted to obviously you've got your connector at the bottom but you could wrap that and set it that way likewise you could still do it across it doesn't have to fall the way that it wants to so so beautiful you've got that wonderful shield of a gemstone 30 by 17 millimeters with the four millimeter loop I've no idea, Mike. What, apparently, this looks like an animal's eye. How on earth? Not what, getting Mike, that one. I'm a, bit, a little bit worried about you tonight. What did you have for your tea, darling? <laughs> did you have any tea? Have you had? You've, have you had a few days? Oh, you, you've got a few days off. Oh, you've got a few. You've got two days off. I think you need to have some sleep, my lovely. You d he needs a little kip, does our Mike? Bless him. <laughs> Maybe a little bit like a shark's eye, apparently. We went from goat to sheep to shark. <laughs> Just thinking, I couldn't quite work out. Well, oh, it's like a goat's eye. I'm thinking, is it? Is it? Don't, I'm clearly not a vet. Uh, no. Um, 4 95 on your black onyx. That is glorious. Utterly phenomenal. <laughs> He needs these two days off, Mike does, clearly. Uh, 0800 Bs for recording, 800 655. Let me spin it round, because you've got the, the, the fasting on one side. Let's see the back on that as well, because you've got that really lovely, lovely luster on that one. Really cool. You can do either or, of course, but look at that. You will get that amazing sort of glassy, vitreous luster coming off the onyx, which seems a shame when you've got all that detail on the fasting on there as well. But a lovely shape. Dynamic pendant, obviously, just in a very beautiful sort of drop of, uh, on a chain link. But I'm sure there's lots you can do with that if you want to wire wrap that into a ring or just be very, very, very sort of creative, quite elaborate on that. Lynn, collector in the Outer Hebrides, nice to have you there. Uh, Veronica, well, very well done. Loads of you coming in. To take that home and I would I would like to see that still on a, on a strand of black spinel dropping down just always just if you've got the chance to go all out glitz and glamour <laughs> go for it. it's what I've done tonight with my headband and the thing glitz and glamour <laughs> for, for 95 <laughs> I tuned in this morning and saw Zina went oh we've got headbands <laughs> so Turn oh, off. <laughs> man how do we make this work uh, <laughs> Jacqueline very very well done indeed 20 carats though is quite a tremendous carat weight uh, very nice on a long lariat drop on a 30 inch chain I think would look just so so distinguished exceptionally beautiful oh I did say I've just I've just thought actually because we've obviously got the second kit coming up at nine o'clock I am going to lose the headband at some stage because I want to wear part of the kit because it's only occasionally a girl gets to feel like a princess and I can't not wear one or two of the pieces. Right now my headband, can't say the word princess came to mind. Can't quite go, but with the next kit, do you think it's a good look? Do you? Yeah, different. Yeah, it, that's one word, different. We can, we can. <laughs> I feel like I'm back diplomatic, in the 80s. Diplomatic, that one. Yeah, yeah, it was very diplomatic, mm, yeah. Different. Back in the 80s. Uh, right, well done on those. Congratulations. A lot of you multi-buying on that one as well. Uh, congratulations. <laughs> right, box number eight. Let's stay with this, actually. And let's bring to you, um, same but different, really. Same, same idea. Different gemstone, slightly different shape. But this is luscious. This is lovely. You've got this gorgeous sort of caramel, this soft latte tone. I do, oh, there we go. Isn't that fab? Glorious, really dynamic. You've got that elongated sort of triangle, the smooth triangle. Same both sides, so you've not got the fasting on this one. Uh, but looking so lovely, I give that a bit of a spinning around. You've got that lovely, lovely silver on there as well, the electroplated uh, uh, sort of fully bezel set. You've got the lovely loop at the top, so nice and ready to go if you want to put that again just on a simple jump ring. You could obviously make something more fabulous. You can create a fantastic bail uh, onto that, but that's why we, we, we kind of, we've kind of done the work for you. Obviously, if you've got your, your gemstones, if ever you've been on one of the courses, uh, one of the silver courses, maybe you've learnt to set your gemstones. Um, I, I did it years Years ago, actually, one of the silver courses, and I've still got the big pendant actually that that I that I made that that I still love. Um, I really enjoyed it. I had a great day. Yeah, a great day. Um, and try. I know I booked onto one of the workshops. I literally booked onto one of the workshops, and I, I want to do more of them. I loved it. Uh, but the, to get to get that, they're really interesting. I love them. But to get that finish is actually going to be quite, you know, quite quite. Um, 
time consuming yes. um, and obviously you've, you're always going to factor that into so to have half the work done it gives you kind of a starting block really yeah, doesn't it, it does but looks pretty, looks glorious, and it's a really gorgeous colour, that sort of very soft latte, that really smooth. And you can see the transparency of the gemstone on there as well, really, 7 95 you, you buy your pendants, you go into the shops, you look around, you, you look at the prices of your genuine gemstone set pendants, and you see some really high prices. You go and you look in your high street stores at some of the fake simulated big sort of costume jewellery pieces, 7 95 wouldn't seem out of place at all, this would, because it's a 22 carat gemstone. It's a little bit more readily available because it's quartz. Quartz, you're talking about 12% of the Earth's crust. But by no means is that all gemstone quality. And there's so many different varieties. And that transparency is really playing a part in that. Um, I remember the very first Smoky Quartz ring I had when I was a lot younger in yellow gold that my mum and dad bought me for a birthday. And I look back now, I think it was just awful. It was so pale. I didn't know any different then, but it was just, it was just really not good. And it was in gold and it was, it was pretty expensive. We get pieces like this and it's just glorious. And as Liz said, simply elegant, elegantly simple, just that. That's mm. lovely. Yeah, it absolutely is, absolutely is. Laura, um, Ruth, you're rocking that headband. Add some hot fixes and you'll feel like, what's on what? And you'll feel like a prince. Oh, the Swarovski. Oh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah, we can have a little bit of that going on, couldn't we? Oh, it's a bit late now. We need oh. some now. We need them now. I just need to, 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 we should have thought about that earlier on. We did say about adorning these, mm. didn't we? We could work on that. Can I write? I could write on it. That would, that would work. But, uh, yeah, a bit of bling. Can't go wrong with a bit of bling. Absolutely. Uh, thank you, Laura. Uh, 7 95 well done. Right, can we do number six? I love these. Oh, these are so, oh my gosh, these are so pretty. They're so, so, so lovely. Oh my gosh, we can do the lowest price again. Look at these little butterflies. They're a lovely colour. Really lovely. Aren't they cute? Oh, I'm sorry, they're adorable. Dyed light lavender seashell carved butterflies. So pretty. It's like a periwinkle blue almost, isn't it? The detail's lovely on those as well. The little body of the butterfly, the little wings that you can see. I mean, they are they are certainly in flight, mid-flight, aren't they? They're pretty. And they're really, cute. Really, really pretty, yeah. Lovely little charm. You could just drop that onto a head pin very simply and put that onto a chain. That would be a really lovely little uh, charm. And can you imagine a, a little flourish of those on the neckline? Now, what is it a flourish? What's, oh, what's a, is it a kaleidoscope of butterflies? I can't think what the term is for a group. I, think, I want to say that it's a kaleid. I love these. Or is it a flur? It's not. <laughs> it's a swarm of bees. I'm sure it's a kaleidoscope of butterflies. Could so be wrong on it. Is it it's a tower of giraffes. Is it a kaleidoscope? Get in. Oh, but you can call it a swarm or a rabble. A rabble of butterflies. What's a caterpillar? A group of caterpillars is called an <laughs> army. An army of caterpillars. I love all of these. I think they're, 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 they're brilliant. A murder of crows. Murder of crows yes, is always yeah. that, yeah. Very, yeah. But a tower of gi giraffes, I always remember because I'm tall. Uh, but there are some, there's some lovely ones out there. But yeah, that is really cute. Ah, oh, right. Let's not start that conversation because we'll save that for another day. I, I love it. It's, it's brilliant. I do it all the time. I love it. <laughs> um, five. No, that's how I learnt my, my uh, kaleidoscope of butterflies. Uh, and meant to be really lucky for butterfly lands on you as well, isn't it? But you can see it works really, really lovely. Uh, they've got really, and again, they've got really scratchy legs. I always say that story when butterfly lands. You've got little scratchy legs. Um, five ninety-five. They're so pretty. They're, They're lovely. great for buying now the beginning of the school summer holidays for jewellery making with kids because the oh, little mate. girls are going to love those. Yeah, exactly. They are, they and are so along cute. with some of the other stuff that we've had. Yeah, the really good peridot would be nice for those with the little greens or the little pearls, little white pearls. If you've got some of the seed beads left, they could work mm. really nicely with the seed beads. The little cream sort of, was it the little atos? Or the, they'd look beautiful. Really, really cute. A little pair of earrings would be so sweet. Just buy a couple of um, sort of um, shepherd hooks uh, off, our, off our webpage. I don't think we've got any shepherd hooks tonight. And, and just drop those down on a little head pin. If you were to sit and do that with your grandchildren over, over the summer, they would look so adorable. 
Really, really lovely. A little necklace with a couple of those on as well. Dead simple to do. Really, really nice. And 5 .95. Great price. 12 by 10 millimetres. Nice to have little pieces like this that are a little bit different as well, isn't it? When you've got that character. And so popular, whether it's the little bees, the little butterflies, little dragonflies. All of these kind of very uh, sort of nature-inspired looks are so gorgeous. Um, 5 .95. Brilliant. No brainer on those. They are cute. Cute, cute, cute. We like those. Gorgeous. Uh, right, I've showed this strand to you once or twice tonight, uh, but maybe it's time, maybe it's tourmaline time, I think it is, from the tourmaline queen. Tourmaline coming up right now for your star buy. <laughs> Oh my goodness me. Tourmaline, tourmaline, tourmaline. One of my all time favourite gemstones. Why? Well, for me, this encompasses the rainbow. It is a gemstone I'd never heard of until about 10, 11 years ago when I started to work in the industry. And as soon as I saw it, and I fell in love with the Paribas first of all, then I fell in love with the rubellites, the indicolites, then I fell in love with the oranges, that are, and the, the wealth of colour that you can experience from this strand is so exciting. And I look at that and instantly, and I'm not saying these are Pariba, uh, but you've got the Pariba-like colours, the greens, the blues that are within there, the rubellite and pink tourmaline colour tones, absolutely a wonderful display of this rainbow of gemstones tourmaline from uh, well tourmaline from the, the Sinhalese word meaning mixed precious stones and when they were first discovered when they were first found and these are totally natural by the way they were shipped across Europe uh, and simply marked as that mixed precious stones because nobody really knew what they were of course later techniques developed and they were identified as tourmalines but it's this myriad of colour that makes them so special. Some people say that when they were, they, the, the gemstone was born, they, they sort of skipped over a rainbow and that's how they collected all these amazing, amazing colours. But to get this quality and diversity, this celebration of colour, naturally, I think is incredible. Faceted rondelles all the way around on that strand. And it, it's what we call a pleochroic gem. In fact, it's one of the most pleochroic gemstones on the planet, which means you see different colours from different angles. If you take one of the pink gemstones, you may see the bright pinks one side, fuchsias the other, and cranberries the other side, but very, very highly pleochroic indeed. And just a gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous uh, strand that you've got here. From those darker shades right at the very top, going all the way around, you've got these pretty baby pinks in there as well. Some gold tones, some honey tones, some oranges. It, it's a gemstone that I absolutely adore, and it's a very rare gem. If you think about the likes of Pareba, the big jewellery stores that feature Pareba, my goodness me, the Indicolites, the Rubellites, these are all the very, very rare varieties of gemstones. And I'm just looking at the pinks, I'm looking at the reds, and they are what we call type 3 gemstones. There are type 1, type 2, type 3. There's not any bad or worse, it's just the, the clarification of the gem. But type 3 gemstones, there's three on the planet, three. That's it. One is emerald, and we expect and respect the inclusions. The other two are pink tourmaline and rubellite, both members of the tourmaline family. It means we expect and respect inclusions within, but these are super clean, super clear and super gorgeous. My one problem I have here, and this is where I kind of need to split my head down the centre, because half of me is still sort of business going, okay, this is amazing, you know, this is really going to, this should command a really high price. The other side of me is going, come on, as a jewellery maker, come on, take this down, let's make this amazing. So it's kind of one of those where my, my brain's having a little bit of a battle. I know which side will win, it'll, it'll be the yay price. So previously, on jewelry maker and that's still my jewelry maker head going yay at 1995 but we're going to beat this tonight we are going to take this price right down to an unbelievable deal we're talking lowest price deals tonight but for tourmaline i have to be with you on this because other side the other side of my head now is melting going what 14.95 it's just absolutely sensational that deal that you've got here i'm 800 644 655 what an array of colour, a beautiful ravishing rainbow of a very high grade tourmaline gemstone. So, so appreciated and adored uh, the jewellery world throughout. If you get the chance to own tourmaline, 
grab it, take it, enjoy it. 17 centimetre strand because it is very, very high end. But the colours are lovely, aren't they? Um, what a celebration. Again. Yeah, beautiful, beautiful colours. Uh, it's just happiness on a strand. It's lovely, it yeah. Yeah, absolutely. And, really, and, and really Karen nice. was just saying, Mom's so it's kind of like you've got all the colours of the bunting. And it uh, really is yeah, a celebration, yeah. isn't it? It is, yeah. They are wonderful. And of course, that fasting in there that we like on the rondelle. Uh -huh. So you've got an extra bit of spark. There's just jazz hands. Give me jazz hands. Uh, $14.95. Eileen Elizabeth, Michelle, Donna, Catherine, Ruth. Lovely name. Well done. In South Yorkshire. Congratulations. Hello, Alan. Well done, Eileen. Uh, $14.95 is such a smasher of a deal. I will just wrap that around on my wrist because, again, I, I would need that as a bracelet. Absolutely 100%. It totally outglows my neon uh, bracelet there, doesn't mm, it? And that takes yeah. some doing. Uh, <laughs> but uh, <laughs> that really is a set. It's quite hard to focus on when I've got that on there, isn't it, really? Uh, but fourteen ninety five. So, so these are probably the softest little sweatbands I've ever... Not that I'm used to wearing them, to be perfectly honest. They are, um, they are, they are soft, But they're lovely and soft, yeah. aren't they? Very nice. See, it's all about quality. All about quality. Uh, oh, on the telephone lines, 0800 Jewelrymaker.com on the web. Uh, you're item code RERU31 grab these nab these pop them in your basket check those straight out uh, because you'll kick yourself if you don't quite frankly and in the next kit we've got some of the most one of my favorite wires at the moment the champagne colored gold I love it it looks amazing with the tourmaline. You will probably have some left. Uh, so definitely, definitely, definitely do think about that. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if these sell out. That's 35 carats of such a highly uh, adored gemstone. Uh, I, I, as I say, Pariba is, is my favorite. I do love those colors. Uh, as I say, I'm just reiterating. I'm not saying they're Pariba because if they are, they'd be worth a fortune. Uh, but it's that color. It is that colour tone, that colour palette that you're playing with there on, on the Pareba. And I just, what a dream, what a dream to get an entire strand like that. I, I would want a suite, I would want a necklace, a, a bracelet and probably a little pair of drop earrings. You could colour match, of course, you could pull out the little blue tones. You could take out the, the sort of the deeper, almost ruber-like tones, the, the, the sort of pinky tones. They're a bit impressive as well. I'm loving those sort of golds. They're really wonderful to see little bit different little sort of baby pink tones and you've got the dark tones sort of like a deep in indicolite shade actually there as well so really wonderful journey around the, the, the color spectrum I think with tourmaline that's why we celebrate it and love it so welcome onto the uh, web Rosalind congratulations hopefully you're checking out on those my lovely great job on those so so precious 14.95 is just a well it's a no-brainer really isn't it absolute no-brainer so very very well done indeed on those so lovely quality of those is amazing Staggering, beautiful, 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 beautiful. Congratulations on those. They are lush. <gasps> oh, I like those a lot. Right, let's dive into. Ooh. Oh, these are a bit funky. These are good. Oh, they're very tactile as well. These are glorious. I don't think I've. I don't think I've, Well, I've never bought this strand to you. I've never bought this strand to you. These are lovely. Gosh, they're packed on there. You are getting an absolute multitude of gemstones. Aren't these glorious? They're lovely. There's a lot on there. There is a lot on <laughs> An there. An awful lot. My goodness me. Smoky quartz. Loving those drops. Really, I mean, you've got some smaller sort of... Start off with a little pear drop, so at one side, and you can see that's more of a, a traditional sort of pear drop. And then you've got those larger drops gradually coming through, starting with the little pear drops, gradually getting to the larger drops. That's Mike's tune for this. <laughs> That's what I'm having to put up with Karen right now. Starting with the little pear drops, moving to the big drops. I don't think Madonna's going to be contacting you to write her a song too soon. Yep, 240 carrots. He's happy in his work though, isn't he? Yeah. That's, that's the amazing thing. Okay. Um, these are lovely. These are really, really lovely. An alachromatic gemstone, this gemstone, comes in a variety of different colours. Uh, but my gosh, they're so beautiful. I mean, there are some really... Look at that one there. That's a super drop. That would need to be on a pendant, wouldn't it? That one on its own, would. you'd need to make a really, really, really sort of fabulous feature on that one. But my gosh, it's almost like a double strand because of the way that they fall, because they're kind of really sort of jam-packed on there, aren't they? Uh, and lovely tone. You've got the coffees, you've got the lattes, and, and they do kind of seem to move. You've got the stronger colours, just seeing that yeah, some of them do have a lighter tone, but actually even just moving them when they catch the light, they kind of get a little bit deeper when they're against the skin tone, then you move them away. I mean, really fa quite fantastic jewellery. Again, they lend themselves to earring drops, don't they? That, that mm. elongated fall yeah. is just gorgeous. 
I'd wrap those up with gold. And yes. I'm quite a silver yes. girl, but I, I smoky quartz and gold, really rich, really, really rich. They'd look at me. Actually, the little gold uh, spaces we had, the tube, twisted tubes we had earlier on, look amazing sort of dropping down. And should be at this price of 34.95. I think quite rightly so, you've got 240 carats on the 18 centimetre strand, but we will reveal a better deal. I'm going to the lowest of the low on all of these prices tonight for you. Uh, so best of luck. Um, and yeah, just don't forget, it's, it's, it's the qu quality and it's the quantity of gemstones you're getting on there. But look how the light's loving them. The light's bouncing off those gemstones. They're really glowing. They are lovely. Look at that big one there, I love that really really stunning they, they almost look like liquid don't they mm. the I'm luster on them is so that. fab yes. yeah. like liquid chocolate Ooh. oh oh mm. can't talk about chocolate <laughs> uh, <laughs> we're trying not to but we're no. failing miserably in absolutely that. Yeah. Uh, a little bit of what you fancy well that's a lot of what you fancy i would say that sort of liquid drop that you're seeing on the gemstones so so glorious they look amazing would you do a big feature necklace on that would you just take a few of those out I would take a few of those out, but use them within wire wrapping. In mm. um, so you've got sort of a drop of maybe three oh, yeah. wire wrapped down, and then do a woven wow. neck piece so that they're a feature at the bottom. Yeah, you could have a really long yeah. sort of gorgeous lariat mm. style drop, couldn't you, on mm. there? But yeah, nice. absolutely wrapped up in your wire and your, mm. your gold. Go really fun out and get that sort of buttery gold of the champagne tones in there as well. But so striking. You need to get your hands on these. They feel lovely. You've got more of the little sort of water droplets. You've got more of the teardrops, more of the sort of the little stubby onion sort of shape on that one as well. I like that term, stubby onion. Uh, but 27 99 classic strand. Smoky quartz, I think everybody knows what you're dealing with. You know what you're getting on there. But they are scrumptious, aren't they? Wonderful colours only if I even if I put a couple of those because obviously they're all kind of moving around but if you just do to, if you if you were just to take out a little section of, of maybe sort of five or seven I was working odds mm -hmm. just imagine perhaps if I can cover the can I cover those other bits so you just take out sort of those those centre few on a necklace I mean that would be a, a great sort of feature it is a bit like the way we see the abalone bars when they, when they yes. fall in yeah. that sort of configuration got the large one at the center then maybe two sort of either side really rich lovely 27.99 nice drop on that one as well beautiful wow gosh these sparkle these really sparkle we've got sunstone coming up oh my goodness me these are lovely Have a little look at these. Wow, big pieces. Gosh, they're gorgeous. They are big. They are lovely. Don't don't, we don't see sunstone very often no. either. No. And it's a beautiful, beautiful stone. Especially for summer. Oh, mm. Real heat. Mm. That lovely mm. sort of uh, russet red. Those glorious colours in there as well. Two hundred and forty carats of sunstone. Graduated, faceted drops. Big drops here. 10 by, uh, well, 10 millimetres to 22 to, uh, 22 tilliters, 22 <laughs> millimetres, <laughs> put my teeth in, uh, 15 centimetre strand, but my gosh, they just glitter, they absolutely glitter, you've got that kind of brick red tone, the oranges, the sunset colours in there, uh, but a pretty fab gem, and totally natural, completely, utterly natural gemstone, uh, pretty hard wearing as well, you're talking seven to eight on the most scale, so lovely to work with, um, and comes all the way from India, I mean that sparkle, you tend to sometimes see a bit of sparkle from uh, perhaps your ruby sometimes when you've got the chromium in there, but they are just, they, they look like marble actually, I'm trying to put my finger on what, what's going on here, mm. they actually look a bit, a bit like marble because there's so many sort of layers that are running through, but honestly, they literally look, I'm just going to try and show you this one, I mean I could pick any to be fair, they do look like they've been sprinkled with glitter. They're sprinkled with sort of fairy dust. Yes. Aren't they just gorgeous? Yes, you can see it from here. Yeah. Really, They're really very mesmerizing. Pretty. Yeah. They just they are. And yet you've got quite big sizes. You've got I mean if we look at the that's probably the biggest one on this strand. I mean that on its own is pretty fab. Just it is you don't you see the really sparkly glittery nail polish with mm. all the little bits in. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's fabulous. They are glorious. I mean one of those feature piece on the neckline, just beautiful. But again, lots of them here. You've got 15 centimeter strand, but nice to have that variety from that big sort of centre uh, presence of the sunstone to the smaller ones at the end. If I can bring one of the smaller ones in, I mean look at that for size difference. That picking up so you've got the smaller one just there, 
gosh, that looks gorgeous. So there's your smaller pear shape there. And then you've got your bigger one. Sorry, a bit difficult to show those two together. But you can see you probably get four of those into that, that main one. And, of course, we don't lose the tassels. Tassel jewellery is so popular right now. So keep your little tassels uh, because they look quite fantastic. Uh, so it should be there at 39.99. We are going so much lower. So much lower on these for you today. 240 caps. I'm actually now down to 10. Um, very highly player create gemstone. Lots of different colours coming out of those. But that sunstone, that's his trademark, if you like. That glittering appearance, that what we call adventure essence within the gem is seriously, seriously sparkalicious. Glorious against the skin uh, for summertime. And again, whether you're sort of lighter or, or darker of skin tone, sunstone's going to look fabulous. Daytime, evening time, dress it up, dress it down. Could do it. Actually, I quite like that as a big chunky necklace. I quite like the fact that they could fall whichever way, actually, that they'd have that kind of freedom of, of movement on that. Really love it. Have the little tassels on there, maybe at the top of the necklace, just thread that on. They'd look so glamorous, wouldn't they? 31.95, that's a massive, massive carat weight on your sunstone gem. If you've never seen it before, grab it. If you love Labradorite, if you love Lapis, I just think you'll adore sunstone. It's a pretty remarkable gemstone. This actually comes from India. You've got various different uh, locations the world over, but it's a very beautiful gem. Set, well, used thousands of years ago, actually. Uh, highly appreciated gem. At some stage, this probably would have been seen as more valuable than diamonds because people appreciated gemstones for colour and obviously diamonds were clear. Diamonds would have been a bit like, a bit like pebbles. Uh, they'd have gone for the sunstones and the lapis lazuli. Mm. And the carnelians, it's all those kind of deep, rich colours. And even the sort of the, uh, well, many, many uses for this gemstone the world over. But what a phenomenal example of, if I was trying to, um, if I was trying to describe adventure essence, how the, the shimmer, the sparkle works, I would literally pick up this strand of sun, a sunstone and say, that's adventure essence. That's what it means. Labradorite, Labradorescence, we've seen a great example of that tonight. But if I wanted to explain this, I would just pick up that strand because it's showing it off. Textbook, textbook perfection. Very, very well done indeed on that one. Congratulations. Loving that. Not too many auctions before the end of the hour. Got a fantastic kit coming up for you as well. I'm just, I'm literally, I'm itching to get my hands on one of those tiaras. <laughs> uh, right, let's grab hold of... Uh, oh, now, I need these. Yep. Yep, I need the beads. I need the sil... I have a need for beads. Um, because I... I well, I, I, I go a little bit all out on these because I just... This is what I want with the jadeite as well. They're great, so I'm going to bring the jadeite back out. I know I'm a bit obsessed with jadeite. I'm not going to apologise for it because I just love them. But... If I just pop one of those silver balls in between, you can kind of see what i mean they just work they really really look fantastic against the jade any gemstone to be fair uh, but you have an entire tube of silver plated brass rondelle seed beads now they come to you in a tube but we've just obviously opened up the tube to get hold of those because look at all of these look at the 240 of them i mean this is a jewelry maker's yeah dream isn't it right it is. now yeah look at those silver balls silver balls 240 they are glorious look at those you see what you see what i love about this is i would just i would have no problem using those i wouldn't sort of be sitting with my gemstone strand going oh shall i put one in shall i go for three of those well you love so you could put one in every gemstone silver ball gemstone silver bead, all the way across if you wanted to on your stretches they are lovely you get the entire tube i just have to get my hands on these uh, but they are amazing to have those in your stash i mean look at that and again then don't think of that you're going to be putting those into your designs and that's that silver is going to be coming off in one it won't they are wrapped around covering 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 the brass on there but they are delicious they're rolling away because they want to come home but aren't they glorious i mean you get a massive <laughs> amount come here um, they're look, having a race they are having a race it is sports day absolutely i'm just going to pop those back in there that's clearly why they're going but look at those like raining silver balls oh they remind me a little bit do you remember the little silver balls you used to get to put on your cakes yes the little the little spring i didn't they did hurt your teeth didn't they i never yes. got on with those yeah they, they look good, but then you crunch mm, them, they're always a bit... They did, yes. I wasn't quite sure. No. Prefer the little di jelly diamonds that you had. And just the sprinkles, they were nice. They were nice. Uh, but all about the silver balls now, absolutely. Um, very, yeah, you can't go wrong with hundreds and thousands. Good sprinkle of those on your cakes. I've not, had a, I've not had a fairy cake for a long time. 
classic fairy mm. cake. You know, when you scoop out the middle, you put the buttercream and you make the little round bit, the wings. Butterfly cake, yeah. Yeah, just a little mm. bit. Are you going to make some, Mike? Where am I in next? What day is it today? Um, Friday. It's Thursday. I'm back with you next week on Friday again, I think. But I don't. I don't know if it. I don't know if it, I'm on the mid. I think I'm on the mid. I th no, I think I'm on the mid. But I, I'm back in August. Back in August. Quite. A, I've got a couple of late shifts in August. Oh, don't worry, Mike. I'll, I'll, I'll message you on Facebook. Yes, please. Mike's going to make some butterfly cakes. Lovely. Sandra, well done. Ria, collector in Outer Hebrides, welcome back. And Jennifer, congratulations. They are so lovely. Honestly, I mean, they are, they, they fill that tube. And actually, 240 of those, let's put a few of those in so we can see. It's actually really nice that you get them in the tube. These are running away big time, aren't they? Um, but don't be, you can be as, as sort of as heavy as you want to with those. Look at all of those. They're a nice size as well. Six by five is really, really nice to work with. They're so cute. Keep adding those on. Keep adding those to your order because they are so fabulous. Rondelles are also lovely to work with because they're slightly different. Yeah. And they give a slightly different angle and perspective to the jewellery with yeah, the beads that you use them with. I love rondelles. Yeah, I, they're so very they are. I like those. I like those a lot. Uh, right. Five seconds. <laughs> Five minutes. Uh, right, in which case, let's grab hold. Oh, if, if you can do a cheeky 2.95 deal on this. Okay, cheeky deal. A cheeky cheeky. 10 carat rad, rad, red agate. <laughs> red agate faceted drop a cabochon. It's a lovely colour. That's like an orangey red. Very, very beautiful. 40 by 14 millimetre for 2.95. Now, it's not drilled, so you'll have to wrap that. You'll have to encase that uh, into your wire. Uh, but actually, you could even do that with... Um, what's my word? Oh, do, I'm, um, oh, what's my word? I can't remember my word. Uh, £2.95. I can't remember what I'm trying to say. Uh, 10 carats. <laughs> International language of mine isn't working by me doing that, is it? <laughs> 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 you know that that no uh, 0800 well you could yeah a lot you could do that 0800 oh I, I know my brain suddenly left me it suddenly run off to the finish line on its own I know how you've been feeling all day now Mike do you know what I think it's the weather when it's thundery like this it sends your brain a bit la la it sends me you uh, my cats oh <gasps> Binks they Mr like Binks it. Binks made the great escape yesterday he went for it, bless him. He was all right. He was a bit shy. Well, he'd, he he was the window was open behind me, and he suddenly looked and ran and did a Superman, literally almost over my head, and I kind of caught him mid mid leap, and he was trying to get out of the. Uh, no, of course he's probably didn't catch his tail. <laughs> <laughs> um, I caught him, and he was a bit like, oh, I didn't make it. Anyway, I went trotting off around the house. Then I heard a noise. Thought, oh, they just stopped something. About five ten minutes later. Go and have a look downstairs. There's Bella trotting around. Look, couldn't find Binks. Looked outside. He's at the bottom of the garden on the recycling bin. Big as you like, because he's quite skinny. His tail's up. He's, he's like this. I'm out. I'm out. I'm having a look. And I was like, oh, my goodness me. Would, would he come in? No. Yeah. No. We had to go for the foodie num nums. Come on. We had to, that's what we say. Uh, so we had to bring him in with... Uh, and then I just took him in my hands. I was like, oh, Binks, man. What are you doing? What are you doing? Yeah, they do go outside. They do go. They've got a big, like, a big cage outside, a big run. Uh, it's like greenhouse size of the dig outside. Yeah, give them a good brush when they're out there. Get their old, yeah, lovely. Sorry about that, Phil. Went off talking about my cats again. You know what I'm like. When I start talking, when I start talking about my kittens, that's you've, you lose me, don't you? You lose me. I'm trying to find a box 12. Here we go, the white tag eight. Yeah, he did his proper... I mean, Binks looks like a tiger anyway, because he's a Bengal, so he does look like a tiger, but he did a proper proper leap for freedom. <laughs> right. These are glorious. 100 carats of white agate. Graduated, irregular plain drops. These are pretty, because they go with everything. They literally go with everything. 28 centimetre strand. So cute. Almost like little sort of teeth-like shapes, these. I love them. Um, but just they really accent any gem. When, if you're thinking about popping those uh, with your peridot, with the tourmaline. 
They work, literally work with anything. Uh, but they're a great kind of filler inner, uh, I always think, but still a lovely gemstone. I mean, our gate's brilliant anyway, isn't it? But it's got a great sort of calm, sort of serenity uh, to it. But they look absolutely fantastic. Um, uh, totally natural as well totally natural uh, but you could you could literally just add a little bit of sparkle in there if you wanted to or keep it very very calm and very plain and very simple but there is a there's a time and a place I think for every variety of gemstone every shape of gem and every uh, sort of different polish or every different feel but they are they're just really calm there's something just really really just simple and gentle. lovely about these yeah very gentle and they're, they're quite feminine and you can make them pop with it or put them with other things that will pop but just keep them very soft and feminine and gentle yeah really simple i guess with a little sort of uh, tiara sort of twist they'd look lovely mm. in tiaras as well wouldn't yes they? On, uh, sort of a vine mm. effect yeah they, that would be nice nice no, especially yeah. against we, I mean, we've got the champagne uh, um, wire coming up as well mm. it could look really lovely on that especially with um, peridot yeah, with the Parado, they look beautiful. Uh, we've got your next kit coming up, which you are going to adore. Um, I, I'm, I'm actually going to, uh, I'm going to have a change of outfit. Yeah, I'm going to have a, I'm going to be like one of those posh celebrities that has a change of outfit. Um, I, I may lose the headband in just a moment or two. I might just have to lose the headband purely because I need to wear one of these fabulous tiaras. <gasps> amazing amazing tiaras that our gorgeous Karen has created for you from the kit um, designed perhaps for, for ladies day for Ascot for an incredible event maybe you've got a wedding to go to these would be perfect so don't move a muscle while I let you just run off and grab a quick G&T come straight back because this kit is gonna rock There are four easy ways to stay in touch with Jewellery Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join a community of over 54,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions, send photos of your designs and enter our Wall of Fame competition. Or if you need any help or advice, you can email our friendly help team. Make sure to get involved and stay up to date with Jewellery Maker. The Jewellery Maker phone is free from a UK landline, so call us today to place your order. If for any reason you're not satisfied with your purchase, you have the benefit of our 30-day money-back guarantee. You can watch our Jewellery Maker show every day on our website by clicking the Watch and Buy Online link in the top right-hand corner of our homepage. Tune in on Tuesday, July the 25th for the launch of Alison Terry's Seed Bead Figurines. Alison will guide you from start to finish on how to create a seed bead witch, fairy and an angel. Take your seed bead work to the next level and get this DVD well in advance for Christmas so you can start to design your incredible decorations. So make sure you're watching on Tuesday at 10am. Did you know, no matter how many times you purchase with Jewellery Maker in the same day, you'll only be charged one fee of postage and packaging. Select our standard delivery for just £2.95, or if you'd like to receive your goods sooner, upgrade to our premium option for £4.95. Jewellery Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Our Jewellery Maker community is a fantastic platform to share, learn, chat and make new friends. So why not like our Facebook page and join over 64,000 like-minded people?
Did you know when you book on the Jewelry Maker Workshop, you are given exclusive access to our Jewelry Maker Shop? You can browse through special items and offers, be privy to selected discounts and deals that you can't get at any other time. Shop whilst you learn and grab yourself some amazing offers. For more information on workshops and available dates, contact our call centre. Hello and a very, very warm welcome back to the show. I've, uh, I've derobed. I've, I've derobed. I've, uh, I've removed my, uh, my sports day look and I've gone for a tiara, darling. Yeah. Uh, how can you not? When, you, when a girl gets a chance to wear a tiara, you've got to take it, right? <gasps> look at this. Isn't that beautiful? Isn't that... So it's so pretty. I feel like a princess. I feel like a princess. It's so pretty. Oh, love it. Love it. Love it. Uh, and there's a few more to wear, so I'm going to change. Uh, right. <laughs> Deal of the day. Uh, I wonder what a group of tiaras called. A tinsel of tiara. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, right. Have a little look at this. Deal of the day. Oh, my wonderfulness. Look at this Baltic multicolour amber nuggets i love that i've never seen these before these are fantastic now um this is this is the the, the strand but what we've done is literally restrand it and we've popped on the back um a little bit of chain link just onto the back there popping on the chain link and putting on a little bit of a clasp so very very simply done just to show you just to restrand that we you do get the little silver tubes on there as well but ever so gradually just so you can see look at the colors in here this is so lovely, so good. So that's all sterling silver, your spaces that are in there. So you've got your sterling silver spaces, which obviously you're going to use. I'll show it to you as the strand, because that's kind of been re sort of restrung uh, re and put onto uh, the, the sterling silver chain. But the colours in here are delicious, aren't they? The colours in here are absolutely beautiful. You've got the amber, you've got the golden tones, you've got the yellows in there, which is superb. And these really deep, deep, rich sort of uh, golden tones in there as well. And of course, all of the sterling silver space is going right the way around on that strand really popular deal of the day I've got to say massively massively popular and um, I think that's really easy to see why don't you because not only do you have the variety of colors you've got some really unusual tones in there as well that glorious sort of lemon tone is fabulous never seen that before never seen that before obviously we've had the amber tones you've got the rich cherry tones in here but i've never seen that before and it looks so so beautiful and it brings a different quality if you have a little look at what we we, we are more familiar with in terms of the amber when you've got the sort of the, the the baltic amber that you're seeing there you see all those little flash all those little flecks uh within it's very very transparent but you've got this wonderful opaque nature from the lemon which is quite a contrast actually but how delicious is that and you can see what we've done just very simply restrand it add a little bit of chain link on the back because it's 15 uh, um uh, sorry you the, the the length actually what is the length of that one it's not, it doesn't say on there does it no it doesn't say the length but i'll tell you what i'll do it's fine dead easy because what you can do if i just Use the ruler of Ruth. She never lies. The ruler of Ruth. She always tells the truth. You're looking at approximately 16 inches on the strand. So that's why all we've done is just restring that and just add the little bit of chain. If you bought that spool of chain link, the 10 meter uh, 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 chain from earlier on, a little piece of chain on the back there with a the clasp, and that will just extend that ever so slightly. Probably gone for about a 20 inch look then, but just so, so easy to do. And that is then your necklace ready to go, isn't it? Ready to wear and ready to enjoy. I'll hold it up to my neckline so you can have a little bit of a peek. Equally, could work as a bracelet. Equally, lovely drop of earrings. Probably need two. Probably need two, I would suggest, on that one. But the colours are so warming. Doesn't that look pretty? It's very pretty. Really, really pretty. Just as it is, that is lovely. Yeah, really, really. And again, I think just totally, totally workable, I think, for everybody. Those colours look amazing. Great for a bracelet. Absolutely. I mean, what would you pay for the sterling silver spaces alone? I mean, they're 15 mil. They're a really, really good length. How many of the spaces do you get? Let's have a two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, fifteen. So you do get 15 of the silver spaces alone. Um, and that, we're doing Whoa. 20 pounds for all of it. <laughs> uh -oh. 
That's a bit of a bargain, yeah. isn't it? That's a bit of a bargain. So you've got 15 of the 9 to 5 sterling silver spaces and you're getting approximately 2, 4, 6... Oh, I've not got those lined up. Let's make it easy for myself. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, approximately 16. I should have known that really if there's 15 spaces, shouldn't I? Hey, uh, approximately 16 of the amber nuggets as well. This is a big deal. I mean, goodness me. It, I, yeah, I can't even equate that. That is fantastic. But just lovely colours. Isn't that lemon lovely? It's a really pretty colour, yeah. It's Seriously? almost like um, lemon meringue. Lemon. Oh yes. Um, oh yes. That lemon. We, do, we go to food every time, don't we? Cappuccino, yeah. lemon meringue. Food or wine yeah. or gin every single time. <laughs> Not. A pro don't have a problem with that. Uh, <laughs> but they are, and it's quite dramatic, isn't it? When you've got that lovely lemon, almost like lemon curd as well. Mm. Oh, glorious, that citrus sort of lemon tone. Then you've got that darker sort of jet colour coming through as well. Very different. Very, very beautiful though on that one. That's lovely. Very well done if you get that. Right, I should put that and tell you what. Let's just pop that back on there for now. Um, right, we're getting ready to bring to you the second kit this evening so you can create some fantastic tiaras, some beautiful headpieces. But uh, before we do that, I think it's only fair to recap on the first kit because it was so wonderful. We love seed beads. I've got lots in baskets that need checking out on. Um, and you might have just only tuned in. You might have just got in from work a little bit later on. Um, it worked out at, what, sorry, was it? £3.33 per component. Ridiculous. Um, and as soon as we say the word seed beads, whoosh, everyone's in. Uh, and it's very, very easy to see why. I've got some of the most wonderful colours here as well. Really, really pretty. Gosh, there's loads in baskets. Yeah, no reason not to. No reason not to. Uh, it was our first place kit. Well, sports day. We've got to be in pole position, haven't we? Simply. Uh, but you've got some lovely, lovely... Oh, is that more, more motor racing pole position? I don't know. Uh, but look at those duos. I like a bit of motor racing. <laughs> a bit of Formula... I like a bit of F1, I do. Love it. Um, and the super bikes, they're great. Um, you've got these wonderful metallic colours in here. The bronze, the golds, the berry tones, the greens in there on the super duos are fantastic. They're looking pretty amazing. You've got these, look at those, against the, the, the whites of those as well. Uh, the Miyuki B Zayratos. And those two together look fantastic um, and then you've got the smaller tubes of the seed beads so you've got I mean this is just what we've kind of got left I've got a few that have been uh, sort of pulled out there so you can have a little bit of a look they're your six O's and you've got that lovely sort of peachy pink can't remember what we called those did we call them the pearl um, uh, blush pink there we go the blush pinks really pretty really like a blush pink pearl to be fair isn't it and then last but not least you've got these really really super cute 15 o's in there as well that just add that little bit of sort of a dynamic feel on those so the violet rainbow colors you got from the super duos are so so incredibly cute just to recap you've got the eight o's on the on the sort of the pearl white that you're seeing and then those lovely uh, peach tones and of course last but not least the 15 o's which look really really lovely in your designs and that's kind of the transparent top shade so all shades that work fabulously together as if that wasn't enough and you can just see them actually if I do that you get a little bit of a closer look on those because uh, obviously when they're in the tube sometimes you can't necessarily see those they look ace don't they and look at that top as well look at the great sizes to have from the, the variation of, of the different sizes I mean look at those the little uh, the, the the sort of the top or the taupe to pay a bit tomato tomato uh, 15 o's really work brilliantly but then <laughs> look at these You've got that amazing collection of the Swarovski crystal in there as well. It's like a moonlight glow. Literally like little moons of gems that you're seeing. They're obviously not gemstones. This is Swarovski. It's a crystal. Uh, but you've got that glorious, glorious glow that's coming through on those. Uh, approximately, um, did we say 12 pieces? Yeah, I think 12 of those mm. um, on those, on the white opal Swarovski beads. They're, they're approximately 8 mil. We get 12 of those. They are really, really glorious. And look at those together. Oh my goodness me. These look fab. Now, let's grab, last but not least, and I never say this correctly, so do bear with me on these. Let's pick up all of these. The colour of these is just electric. This really, really vibrant electric red. I mean, that would give any ruby a run for its money, to be perfectly honest, wouldn't it? Uh, the Chaton Montes, do we Montes, call them? The Montes. Yeah. Uh, and it's in the Siam, uh, which is that kind of rich, fabulous sort of velvety red that's absolutely fantastic but they're, they're around four mil you get 12 of those as well but what's, what's really exciting about these if i just tip that onto the back um i might grab that with my tweezers could be a bit easier you've actually got four drill holes on the back there we go 
four drill holes on there, which is really fab to have and really, really mega useful. Um, so we, we saw those sort of set into the center, almost like the stamen of the flower on the designer pieces. And all of this went to 1995 bargain bargain of the century i think that's absolutely beautiful so much seed beads go so far simple as that they go a heck of a long way um, i've got about 40 of these plus now in baskets uh, for you to check out on oh, we had guest designers buying these as well earlier on not surprisingly uh, so do enjoy those because they are i mean what a lush kit that was, was a fabulous, amazing fabulous kit yeah you did some brilliant work with that as well i, have I to did say. use all the seed beads m yeah. nearly all of the apart from the 15 o's yeah um but i made quite a few pieces oh, and Absolutely. they were, yeah, I didn't skimp. They no, were, no, it was a, a lovely, lot of, lovely a lot kit. Of pieces in there. And this is, um, this is exciting. a completely different yeah, kit. Yeah, totally different, mm. totally different. But this is our chance to feel like a princess, which is very exciting, very exciting <laughs> in, my, in my tiara, in my tiara. Right. How did I look at this? And we decided, obviously, sports day, not actually in terms of... If we say sports day, you might be thinking sports day in terms of, uh, obviously, a lot of the children are doing sports day. But in terms of sporting events, we've had several different sort of featured events today. And we've kind of focused on, on Ladies' Day or, or if you were going to Ascot or somewhere fabulous. Equally... These totally, totally bang on right now if you're going to weddings, if you're going to garden parties, if you've got proms to go to or your daughter's got a prom to go to. Uh, there's always place for a gorgeous, look at these, for a gorgeous tiara or a fabulous headband. They're absolutely beautiful. Now, Karen's done four different designs on the headbands for us today. I'm obviously five. wearing one of them. Uh, oh, five, yeah, because I'm wearing one of them. I can't count. <laughs> and, <laughs> and I think uh, just to, to give you a little bit of inspiration in terms of what you're seeing here, there are totally different using uh, a lot of the gemstones that we've provided i think four five as you'll uh, include the one i'm wearing uh, but five very very different looks that's lovely as well the little heart in the center um and that's just part one because not only do you get the headbands and we'll go through all of the different elements of the kits for you uh, in a second not only do you get the headbands you also get the hair combs now i love these as well they're so so pretty so you've got the four was it four hair combs in there? Three or four hair combs uh, that you're getting. Uh, we'll check, we'll go through all the details because mm -hmm. there's, there's quite a lot going on in here, to be perfectly honest. So this is your Ladies' Day hair kit, really, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. uh, if, you're going to, yes. if you're going to a posh event like this, you've got to do this, haven't you? You've got to do this. So actually, let's have a little look at the elements. So the hair combs, you're actually getting five of the hair combs. Five hair combs and five tiara and five bands. five of the tiara bands, yeah. Mm -hmm. So just to give you an example of, uh, of some of the, the, the creations that Karen's done. So five hair combs, about eight by four you're getting five of the tiara bands as well and they're a nice fit because you can get some tiara bands mm. and they really dig into mm. your head really grip and, yeah. and these don't these are lovely uh, i think it's just the way that they've been manipulated towards the end actually you've also then got some mesh which i, I i'm a little bit in love with this a little bit in love. Two fantastic colour tones. Uh, you've got the lilac mesh wire and you've also got the gold colour of the wesh uh, wesh Meyer. wesh Meyer. Oh. well there you go there we'll we go. I love we'll it. have Weshmire. You're not meant to change it round, are you? Because it's bad luck, I think. I think you have to keep it as it is. So right. that's so now going Weshmire. to be Weshmire from now on. Mm -hmm. Bear with. I don't know. It's one of those things. I'm very superstitious. Very superstitious. I can't walk under a ladder or anything like that. Uh, so this is part one of the kit. So you've got the five headbands, you've got the five combs, and then you've got the wire mesh. I've got, I've got, to, I've got to make it right. Oh, uh, so all of that together, and we'll, we'll, we'll show you what to do with the wire mesh as well. That's eleven ninety five. That's pretty. So that is literally, if we were to say that's a pound for a tiara headband, a pound for a comb, that takes you to ten pounds. Then you've got maybe a pound for one of the the wire mesh and a pound for the other one. That's pretty good going. That's pretty good going, I can tell you. Um, this is a lovely kit. When you consider everything you're going to be able to do, part, you need both, basically. You need to get both these together because when, when you're inspired and what you can create, you're going to love all of this together. Um, obviously, I'm wearing one of the tiaras as well. And I, I just, they're, they're just, they make, they're gorgeous. To have the chance to really um, be able to experiment with your own hair combs and your tiaras because very often you look at things and think well that's nice but I'd like it to be a bit like this or a bit like that you can be as creative as you as you like you can put your really 
put your own character against these to be perfectly honest um, and if you're looking to if you are going to a wedding or you're going to someone you, you're looking at perhaps the little fascinators or two they're really yeah. expensive very aren't they? Expen really really expensive and yeah. I get it because there's often a lot of time and, and work and effort that's gone into creating the pieces but a lot of them when you go into maybe you you, you, you can get them on the high streets can't you and the big big sort of uh, superstores um, um, the big um, not superstore what do you call it a big store a big um you know you've I mean. lost you know me what? now oh, oh. i can't say that i can't say the name of a big st a store you know your big stores um and it, it, you, you they, they can be mass produced of course can't they they might have 10 in one store 10 in another 10 in, these are going to be individual these are going to be like one-off commissions uh, so in that respect these should be even more expensive shouldn't they and um, so the wire is lovely that purple i mean this is kind of your colorway, colors isn't it? yeah yeah they thought this through they did and it's, it's really nice to work with. We'll show you how to work with the mesh because it's obviously sitting sort of nice and flat and flush there in the spool. Uh, but actually, if we take that, I mean, you, you, we can show us this in a moment, Karen. And we never throw those away anyway, do we, the little no. end bits. Uh, but it's sitting nice and flat and flush when you take it off. There we go. But it is actually tubular. So you can actually work with that. I won't with that one because that's a, we, we've got yours sort of already mm. and open. Uh, but you, you, there's lots that you can do. You can thread through that. You can open it up. Um, it, obviously, because it's, it's wire mesh, if you do open that up and you kind of make it into sort of waste, it will hold its form, won't it? Yes. It's really lovely to work with. Really lovely. And you get five yards of that as well, so you do get a heck of a lot. It goes quite a long way, yeah. Yeah. I did actually manage to make the flower on your tiara with that, even though it's very, very fine. Um, I put it round a, a petal shape and then just pulled it out into a flower shape. Sorry, I went the wrong and way. It then. Was, was so the flower that you've got yeah, there? That's actually, from the, wire the wire mesh onto the petal cute? shape. I managed to do that because it, it's very very fine. Yeah, it's not very wide. I mean, we we used to do the much much wider mesh mm. that you could do big bold flowers, but this yeah. lends itself so easily to a, a soft a softer smaller flower. Yeah, they're lovely. They're beautiful. Should we do part two as well? Yes. Because you need to see all of this together. Because part one, part I, I don't see this as part one and part two. This is just like the whole kit and caboodle. Because um, the gemstones are so adorable. <gasps> so lovely, mm. lovely, lovely colours in here. Uh, three fabulous strands. Look at that microfasting. Oh I my know. Gosh. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Look at those. These are glorious. Instantly, I mean, you've got there, that's 10 carats. I know I'm going right in through the centre, but 10 carats of your gold colour coated black micro faceted rondelles what a mouthful but my goodness me that golden hue is coming out so effortlessly uh you're talking one mil micro faceted gemstones that's a 30 centimeter stand but they all work but they are the, they're a lovely size to have really nice um you've also got 10 meters of in fact let me go to the wire let me do the gems first sorry you've got the bicones 60 carats of amethyst bicones Michael, there you go. Wonderful. Mm -hmm. Really, really wonderful. The bicones are a little bit different as well. They're nice they to are. see. Really lovely shape. Almost like little lanterns. Um, you've got your purple freshwater cultured potato pearls. Again, 38 centimetres stand. They're about seven by six, so pretty spherical actually. Uh, but I love, I, I mean, that's a combination and a half. They are glorious together. You've got that serious golden sparkle in the centre, popping pink, metallic pink. And that wonderful classic amethyst purple, actually, on those strands. They look glorious when they're all together. And obviously, they're going to be in this kit, to be fair. Um, as if that wasn't enough, we are also going to give you the wire. Because obviously, if you're working with the tiaras, you're going to need your wire to wrap mm -hmm. around on yep. these as well, aren't you? So, you will get three spools. Now, we have to... Let's look at those together. Um, you are getting... 10 meters of gold color silver plated copper wire 0.4 um, uh, you get two of those and you're also getting 10 meters of the champagne gold 0.8 so you've got both are they both I thought they were both champagne gold oh it doesn't say it on here sorry doll uh, so it just says gold so you've got they're both champagne both gold champagne, I was going to say yeah. they didn't look any different uh, so you get three spools of those so you get two is that right Yeah, two of the small. Sorry, it says one of each on my details. It is two. Uh, so you get two small, one big in, in essence. So two of the new, not, two of the 0.4 and one of the 0.8. Um, now, 
all of this together you can see works very well the champagne gold with that purple is pure pure beauty it's very i think it's very elaborate it's very sexy it's very seductive but it can be so so pretty as well when you're seeing those and of course the gold flash that's coming from uh the the, the um microfaceted spinel oh, that, wonderful that, is it nice to work with beautiful absolutely Silly i love question, really. microfaceted <laughs> spinel um and the coating on them is beautiful and I, was, I, I showed them to my husband on the strand and I said, look at those. Each one of those has been individually faceted and then drilled and then threaded. The workmanship in those is yeah. phenomenal. Because it's we've, just stunning. And you forget, because they are such small gemstones with the microfasting, that, that, that drill hole has to be right in the centre mm. of the gem. You can't be a millimetre out, a, a tiny, tiny uh, tenth or a thousandth, whatever. It's got to be right in the centre, because otherwise you're going to crack the gem, you're going to split the gem. Um, and I've seen it done where you hold the gem, so the drill bit goes right the way down into the gem. They take the gem up. It's, oh my goodness, it's amazing. Uh, but all of these together, I mean, what a fabulous triple strand oh. you've got there. I mean, they look absolutely absolutely glorious now let me show you in terms of price because we've got a little bit of a a little bit of a surprise up our sleeveys right now not that i've got any sleeveys on but we are going to do you another great deal on this kit today the copper wise gorgeous now we i, I, I kind of apologize because we you were a, a spool of wire short weren't you so we do in my apologize case, yes i didn't only um, had one you had, point four yeah so you had to so um, you used all of the wire i used the all kits. of the wire that i had so ordinarily yeah. you would probably have some left yes because yeah. you were one down uh but you will get two of the 0.4 you will get one of the 0.8 so that's more of your structural uh wire the 0.4 more of you what i always call the weaving wire that you you weave yes. and you sew yeah. and you do your bits and bobs with uh, so three spools of wire but you've still got you're going to get sort of 30 meters overall there three strands of gemstone lovely carrot weight right the way through 60 carats of amethyst you've got your pearls and you've got the the, the um, coated uh, microfasted gems and we're going low i love this Web price, I mean, look at your saving. Web price should be 37.20. We're at 23.95. Because we've been allowed to do some great deals for you today. Um, that's really exciting, it's a isn't it? Really, really good deal. Absolutely beautiful. I love uh, these. I, yeah. Just the gemstones the, on the own. I would thing. just that's say the super. combination, yeah. Gemstones. Yeah, it's a great saving, great saving on that. Um, and of course, the two together, they, they go together like birds of a feather. They work. You need the two. Uh, <laughs> if you want to be inspired like this and you want to feel gorgeous wearing your tiaras like I do right now, uh, from headband to tiara, it's not a bad day. Uh, and of course, that lovely copper wire. And what I really love about that, of course, is that this is the champagne gold. It's just a little bit softer, isn't it? I was it? A just going to say, it's just that little bit more muted and mm. not quite so in your face, a bit more elegant. I love it. I love it. I love it. The, the, the yellow gold that we bring, just the gold copper wire, is fabulous. It's very rich, though, isn't it? It's it very is, rich yes. and very opulent. Yeah. If you just want to kind of step back a little bit. And again, it's a bit like, for me, the champagne wire is a little bit like the rose gold. You get. I was just thinking exactly. Isn't it? In the gold yeah. world. Yeah. So you yeah. get yellow gold, which is fabulous and gorgeous and luxurious. And rose gold is a little bit more demure, if that's the word. Same with the champagne gold copper wire. Just that one step back, but my gosh, it looks beautiful. Really, really loving that. I need a bit of this in my life actually uh, but still works with the gold if you want to mix and match it still absolutely works with with the gold as you can see uh, from the uh, from the headbands and, and the tiaras don't forget part one if you want to get part one of the kit includes the tiaras and the combs then you've got part two with all of the gemstones and the copper wire in there so together they make the most tremendous combination so you're looking at 23.95 for the gemstones for the wire you're looking at what 11.95 for the combs the headband and the mesh wire so together great. well actually look at it this way the saving you're making look at it this way the saving you're making on this kit is 13 pounds 25 that saving basically gets you the combs the headbands the wire for free exactly that works out doesn't it so the saving you make pays for your headbands your combs and your wire that sounds like a pretty good deal to me that's like buy one get that free if you it, really if yeah. you're looking at it that way like that like that a lot um well and I did use most of the um, beads, apart from the... I had a few yeah. of the microfaceted spinels left. Yeah, well, you, you, I mean... Five, I would have made more tiaras. combs, but I don't have wire. <laughs> yeah, that's fair enough. Yeah. That's OK. Uh, but, yeah, some lovely designs, little floral designs. Almost like the little butterfly on the comb as well. Yes, that's really there pretty. was a butterfly on one of the um, tiaras as well, but it's lost in it a little bit with the pink pearls on it. 
the third one in. Yeah, but that's lovely. a little butterfly, but it's, it's got a little bit lost in... Um, it's flying about. Flying about, lost in, in trans, transmission or yeah, in, in transportation. Transportation, we'll that go with that be, one. Uh, that yeah. might be the word. Uh, yeah. So, what are we going to have a little bit of We're a We're going a to have at? a look at the one that's nearest to you that's yeah. using the wire mesh yeah. and making some little flowers. It's a little bit, when I've done it, it looks a little bit like a, a gothic arch or a window with the... Um, it does actually, the stained glass yeah, sort of inside. Stained, or very... That's not quite... It, there's a little bit derelict, a little bit mystical and mm. um, ethereal. So, Very yeah, that did slightly grow. But the wire mesh, you have to be very gentle with it. It's mm -hmm. very delicate. Yeah. But it, as um, Ruth said, it, it has got... Um, it is a tube. And what we need to do is thread it onto some of the 0.8 wire. Okay. Need a fair... I would say... Um, however long that is. But That's a metre, is About that? a metre. Should we use the rule of Ruth? Yeah, it's, it's just about a metre. Yeah. And what you need to do is put a tiny little loop, a very small loop, because the the wire is, the mesh is quite... The Maya Wesh. The wire be, mesh. I started something with the Maya Wesh, haven't I? The Maya I? Wesh <laughs> is, is very fine. So you need a tiny loop. The reason for this is that we're going to thread the mesh onto here. And if you just left that... With nothing on the end, all you would do is keep coming out through the... Oh, of course. ..through the metal. Poking it would just through. poke through. Yep. And you also need to find... Just make a little opening with the end of your round nose pliers. Just open that out a little touch. If you can. It does fray a little. It might be an idea just to cut it off again and start again. You've got so much, you don't have to be no, afraid of that necessarily. No, you don't, don't. And once it's started, it's started, isn't once it? Once it's... You have to, yeah. You have to just be a little bit gentle. So you just start that off and then just feed that into there, just very gently. Get it going, which of course it's not going to. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> it's testing us tonight. Oh. I have done one already. I just wanted to show you how to, to start well, it we off. We know the premise of... So we very gently put that into there. Some nice little colours coming through on the, the wire mesh as well, yes, actually. Yes, well, lovely... The violet, there's some nice little shots of pink in there. and blues mm. and greens. So then what we're going to do is very gently, leaving the wire mesh on the reel, is just... Basically is that... And you can see you can, of the little ripple that's sort yeah. of happening. Yeah. And keep doing that. Look at that, it looks great. And that's the effect that we're, we're aiming yeah. for. Um, keep doing that very gently. Keep an eye on that because sometimes it, it's done it there slightly. It, yeah, it, it so can just pop can... out. Mm -hmm. Just makes it... Just take it back just and it back just and... very gently coax it back along. Yeah. So basically all you're doing is filling the wire. Okay. You do use quite a lot of the mesh in this, mm. but it's a lovely way and a lovely effect until you have something that looks... And this isn't quite as... Well, I used the remainder of the reel that I had in the first kit. So you have that sort of effect. Oh. But use a little bit more so that you get a really, really bunched up yeah. effect and it's, it's quite um, flowery. And then all we're going to do is... I wasn't quite sure what I was going to do, to be honest. I found the centre of the wire that I'd... wire mesh... my wesh wrapped? Wire mesh wrapped. <laughs> and just did a little... A, found the centre and brought it round into a... a little fish shape, almost. Try and keep it fairly... Yep. Um, just move your board a little bit. That way, Mike, not. is that a bit better, Dom? There we go, just give it more room. And then all we're going to do is wrap it around the tiara frame. And the nice thing with the mesh on it is that it grips quite nicely as well. Right. So you just need to wrap it around once. This has gone quite a little bit bigger than that one. That's all right. Go big it's... or go home, that's what I say. <laughs> and then you do exactly <laughs> the same there. You just do a th another one oh. there. So we'll wrap that one around there. And you've got the opening at the back, which is great. 
and then bring that round there. Which looks fine, but it needed um, a little bit of detail, so mm -hmm. I did. So, so you've got two there, one there. Bring that around again. So you've got three little strands. You can manipulate them in a, mo in a moment to stand up as you want them. And then bring that round there. And we can fasten those off later. And mm -hmm. then they will then stand up, obviously, as you want them to. Yep. The flowers is um, the flowers I used. It's a basic. Here's some point four I cut off earlier. It's a tiara twist using the, those lovely, lovely amethyst bicones. They work really well with those. They don't work, they? yeah, Little so well. Twists. They work. <clears throat> so you need, I think I have five. I think I had five of those. And then they just use one of the shell pearls. It says, I think they said those. Shell pearls are purple, they're quite pink. They are, they're, they're more a lovely, of a pink, yeah, they are like a metallic they? pinky purple, yeah, aren't they? They're really nice. Really pretty. So take one of the bicones, and they've got quite generous sizes, hole size, drill holes. Take that down to the centre, because you can work away your way along either side of this then. Take a tight hold of the bicone and pull the, one of the wires down. What you need to do is leave about almost a centimetre at the bottom mm -hmm. of the two wires. Take hold of the amethyst and twist. And then separate out the two wires and thread on another one. You can go from either side of this one then. Again, take it down and bring... Whoops. You can manipulate these once they're all in place so that you've got all the wires. Because you're obviously going to have a wire going down the back of one of them. Yeah. Which you don't want to see, but you can then manipulate them. Because they are twisted in the wire, you can turn them around so that they're all facing the same way. So you've got two there, add the other one, do five, they sit together very nicely because they're bicones, they've got that lovely... It's a nice shape isn't yeah, it? Yeah, edge. The they, different they, angles mm, that you've got. They work really well. Sort of the tessellation as it goes around. Yes, they're a little bit like the um, uh, Swarovski bicones that you get. Yes, exactly, I know what you and mean. And they work, yeah. they sit together. So five of those on, I'll just do the one flower and what I did with the um, one on the tiara was I worked my way along I think I did some brought both wires together at the end I've got all five of them and then we had a shell pearl in the middle as the center of the flower yeah. just to give it a little bit of pop because it, I felt it needed something to lift it because the mm. um, the amethyst is so similar in color yeah. to the wire mesh that there would be a danger of losing them. Mm -hmm. so and I guess in reality, if you're making a floral design, you've got the stain of the flower, which generally is a yeah. different colour, isn't it? Yes. So you end up with five, and then you can manipulate them into place. Yeah. Take more time. And then bring the two wires that you've got at the back. Now we need a pearl. Bring a pearl, one of the pearls on to the centre, might need to put more than one on there. The pearls haven't got quite as generous a, si a drill hole size, but they do take the 0 0.4 wire. Yeah. So we'll bring that over there. Oh, well, we'll wrap that round there first. Then bring it down. You need to make sure that it's nice and tight. Bring it back down between two of the petals. And bring that around and down and once you've got the two back of the this looks a mess you can be able to pull it into a flower shape is to twist those two wires together if you keep your finger in between you get a much neater twist twist the flower and move your finger down and you get a neat twist and then you can add in another flower as and when you want yep. 
can bring in another flower there. Manipulate this round until you've got a nice flower shape. Bring that to Really, it never does work, does it? Mm. Ever. So you've got Lovely. more or less a flower shape. Twist it so you've got the wires at the back. I guess you can always tweak it when you've got that, that sort of form, when you've got the shape. Yeah. It's just tweaking it into its final. And then what I did, I, I just basically went around adding more flowers. And the lovely thing about the point 0.4 wire is that you can give it a nice wrap. But you can also almost give it a lacy effect yeah so that you've got almost like a tracery in the window or the mm. the leadedness or leaded is that all right yeah, word? The leaded windows, leaded yeah, windows. I mean, a leadedness maybe isn't right leadedness we know so basically that was how to build that up but it, it really is quite freeform as i said this is quite big compared to the one that i made there i think i did one to the top but add as many flowers as you want and it just sort of looked quite mystical when I did it. I thought that looks really quite yeah. nice. I like that. As, as you can see as they're growing, the, kind of, the stem mm, of the flower yeah. gradually sort of... Quite, it reminds me almost of a, a sort of... If you think of a, um, a secret garden, you walk down yes. and see the wrought iron, yeah. iron gates. Yes. And not only yeah. the shape of the gates, but actually the flowers that have kind of uh, gone around it. Yeah. And as I said, because of the point four against the mesh and using the flowers, you can bring that in. It's almost cobwebby mm. as well. It, which yeah. is quite nice. So. so I'm loving on that as well. You know, a lot of the, the, the trend, a lot of the younger children, younger children, I'm so not down the kids, uh, <laughs> but the, a lot of the, the, the youngsters are wearing the sort of the bands with the little ears. Have you yes. seen them? With the, you could make some really beautiful little ears oh, with that. Oh, that would and be nice. And I'm just thinking nice, with yeah. the, the, or little butterfly wings, because they almost look like the little, the little sort of the veins that run through the, that you see sometimes mm -hmm. sort of running through the butterfly's wings with the little flowers on that, there. That would work, yeah. a lovely combination. Yes, that would work. But yes, so but basically nice that is it's a very easy, you may need, you will need to bring, you may need to, you will need to bring some of the point four, four wire down to just anchor that slightly. Yeah. I have used, yeah, I've anchored some of the flower, because it is quite loose, but you can give it a really good pull and a twist and just nip it with, and I would use nylon jaw pliers, just nip it with the nylon jaw pliers and it, it becomes a little bit more solid yeah, hugs it a little it, bit, it easy, hugs it a little it? bit more but if you wrap some of the point four way around and give that a really good tug and a good squidge mm -hmm. it'll it should stay in place and it should hold its pl place a lot Fabulous. best you don't have to have it at the front of the head you can have it at yeah, the side like you've done with yours it's quite um lovely it's the, it, very partial to these very partial to, to a tr and squidge being a technical term obviously a, a very a very <laughs> a very um dueling technical term. the other thing i was thinking while i was doing that was that I've done that really large, but you could add smaller ones. Exactly totally. the same inside. Up, build it up. As you're doing things, you're thinking, oh, I could have done that that, that way. It's but afterwards that, when you look at things. But that's isn't the beauty it? of having it because yes. you make one design, you've still got your gems, you, still, you can build again, you can build again. It's, that's, that's the beauty mm -hmm. of it. Thank you, my darling. You're welcome. Thank you very much. If, well done to everybody who's already added this into your baskets. Uh, your chance to feel like a princess, I'm sure you'll be great. And a great <laughs> kit to obviously be doing as we're going into the summer holidays as well. I think this is fabulous. Thank be you very much. Be good to do with, with children. Totally. Mm. Really, really, really nice pretty. and obviously to be able to wear your creation at the end. Yes. Thank you very much, my lovely. You're more than welcome. Right, we're going to come straight back with a fantastic star by for you. We haven't got long to go, actually. We've got to get our skates on. Do I, I can't lunge. I've got, I know it's sports day. I can't lunge in a tiara, so I'm going to do a graceful, I'm going to float. If that's just not on, you don't lunge. I can't lunge in a tiara. No. Star by coming up. Lunge. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, these are just oh my word these are, I, I want to say barrel or aquaprase these have some of the most phenomenal color this is opal opal multicolor opal graduated rounds i have never seen and um, i want to say almost ice cream colors i've never seen opal looking like this these are divine these are absolutely divine <gasps> check these colors out beautiful oh my word baby pinks 
stunning st look at those blues that's like an aquapraise hue or a chalcedony blue very very pretty 75 carats this is going to stun you honestly this is going to shock six by nine millimeters on an 18 centimeter strand my gosh they're lovely so look at the beauty of every one is offering something different as well it's, it's almost like you've got marbling on one or two of those gems. It's almost like the rings of satin going around on some of those pinks. So delicious. Sorbet tones as well oh, in there. Them. Maybe that's the term. Are we in each other's head tonight? We are. I was just going <laughs> to say, they look like sorbets. <laughs> yeah. You said sorbets. There we go. Mm. Great minds. Great uh -huh. minds. That's all it is. That's all it is. Um, beautiful strand going on here. Um, I've no idea why we've been allowed to get away with this tonight. Uh, lower than low in terms of your price just a spectacular for opal spectacular six pounds 95 yeah 6.95 and you are getting i think one of the most wonderfully bright summery tones right the way through on the opals that i think i've ever seen quite frankly they are not worth missing out on definitely definitely one strand to have in your collection and in fact don't buy this one buy two buy three of these because you'll kick yourself if you don't quite frankly they are delicious look if i wrap those around my wrist that would make the most beautiful summer stretchy mm. really cute really little silver sort of jump rings i'd pop in between there as well just because i can so i will <laughs> uh but 75 carats you're not going to say no to that is really lovely they i've never seen these before great color lovely graduation probably won't see them again certainly don't expect to see them if i do at 6.95 that's for sure uh, but want to really pop into your basket tonight and just absolutely love if you've got any of the pieces from earlier on imagine that with just the silver filigree uh, sort of the, the ball in the center i think that would look absolutely terrific with that right or even dropping down from that as a stretchy i think that would look utterly utterly glorious six pounds 95 on that strand just amazing but add in a spacer add in a silver filigree ball like that one and that could i mean that would work wonderfully as a charm with that wouldn't it really nice really shocking uh, but absolutely glorious at a price like that definitely the day to get these treats and to get these treasures one of the lowest prices i could have ever dreamt of uh, to be quite frank uh, joan very well done to you martin congratulations uh, roseanne kelly every single one of you that are treating yourself today you deserve it why not you absolutely deserve it a strand of gems like that i've just never seen these colors they're so pretty so pretty obviously you're not we're not expecting the, the fire from those opals it's not about that the opalescence rather i should say uh, it, it's not about that it's about this color this lovely opaque tone but the brightest of blues and pinks in there are just so special 75 carats wonderful at a price like that i don't i i don't know who to even turn to to even think about sort of competition in terms of prices on that or even to find them those colours are absolutely wonderful. Definitely one to celebrate with. Thank you so much for staying with us tonight. Well done to you for grabbing a couple of those, as we said. I mean, on a necklace, they just, they're kind of the barrel colours, aren't they? But yet they're more, they're more shockingly glorious. They're, they're brighter. I would you say the more, um, there. more vibrant, aren't mm. they? Really lovely. Well done on those. They were always going to fly, to be fair. They're always going to go. So very, very well done. Right, we're going to be on and gone now literally we're going to get these strands these pieces on and they're just going to zoom uh starting with oh, jasper is that the one actually I'll tell you what hold on a second oh oh omg wow 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 100 carat jasper carved leaf oh i love it love it love it love it i mean that would no way big big price drop this is glorious look at that detail on the leaf as well great colors it's almost like the leaf in autumn isn't it mm. where it goes from the greens to starts to go through to those russet reds this is fabulous oh it's drilled it is drilled <gasps> did you see that at the top you've got a tiny little drill hole right at the top so if you choose to use that can you see it's it's, it's so tiny at the top if you want to use it you can if not then you're not actually even going to really notice that oh but it does make life easier doesn't it look at the contours if i turn it that way i love that shape the contouring that you're getting on the leaf isn't that just divine obviously it makes it look even more real if that was flat beautiful but by doing that having that sort of wave in there that's absolutely glorious can you imagine a couple of those and you can make the most fabulous brooch a couple of those big leaves with a big flower in the center that would look absolutely superb just glorious five pounds 95 100 carats of jasper 
65 by 40 millimeters i mean for a piece of jasper like that and don't forget obviously that's one piece this isn't sections of jasper but have they gone oh my word i, I well okay really? sorry if you've missed out on that <laughs> Oh, I need this. I need that. I haven't got, I haven't got it. I'd wire wrap around the lead. Oh, glorious. Right, this is going to be quick. This is going to be miss it, miss out. Um, you probably might want the tourmaline rounds to go with that leaf because I think these are going to look so pretty with it. So sorry if you've missed out on that. A lot of people were multi-buying. It has gone. The leaf has gone. That was epic. Gorgeous. Right, don't have any of these, but it's miss it, miss out. So there's a bit of a charge to the st or a sprint to the finish line now. Uh, 40 carats of multicolour tourmaline plain rounds, uh, four millimetre gems, 38 centimetre strand, super pretty, glorious, glorious colours that you're seeing here. Um, straight in, straight down, 5.95 on your multicolour tourmaline gemstones. And I, literally, you're going to be like the cat that's got the cream with those. Wonderful colours, the peaches, the pinks, the blues that you're seeing in here. Love a bit of tourmaline, love a bit of cream. Mm, strawberries and cream. <sighs> strawberries and clotted cream. Oh, 0800 655. Uh, I've, I've actually just made myself hungry thinking about that <laughs> 40 yes. carrots worst I've got the strawberries I've got strawberries at home as well Mike I've got creme fraiche but mm, it's not gonna that's not gonna cut the mustard yeah. is it that's like wimping out really Donna Tina Catherine uh, Michelle Roseanne Janet yeah definitely definitely get those checked out lovely tones in there well tourmaline dream isn't it really if you've got the tourmaline fasted rondelles earlier on they're gonna look superb as a bit of a contrast against those wonderful colors though aren't they really a celebration of different tones different hues the greens to the pinks to the blues absolutely really really pretty and um, just be checking out on those as quickly as you possibly can because uh, there's a lot to love there quite frankly they're stunning last four last four janet if you check out you'll be successful uh, hopefully as long as people don't keep multi-buying because a lot of you are uh catherine's got three strands of those i'm glad you're a tourmaline lover like me tourmaline queen i'll let you have the time I'll, I'll lend you my tiara you can be a tourmaline queen absolutely um right let's do number three now i've been talking about this color all night uh, we've been talking about this with the peridot in particular See, I feel now I've got my tiara on that I have won the race. I feel like I've won the sports day. Definitely. So definitely. I've been, I've, yeah, I can wear the tiara. I'll take that. Uh, 40 carats of citrine plain rounds. This is what I've been waiting for. We've had the Peridot with that glorious glow and then look at it with citrine. Perfect. Absolute perfection to see those together. They are so glorious, aren't they? Really pretty. It's a bit of sunshine, isn't it, citrine? The gem of happiness as we know it to be called, well it is, uh, it's a very very happy gemstone to wear lovely plain rounds, 4 mil on a 38 centimetre strand, gorgeous with gold, lovely with silver, great with amber as well, but a great 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 strand there to have in your collection, so pretty. I don't have to have my tiara back yet do I? Can I have my tiara back at the end of the show? <laughs> they're being taken away like that no you know i'm my tiara uh, <laughs> don't you dare come so like, no you can keep it you can keep it uh, are we 100? Six, come on fight me are we 100? Six, double four, six, double five. uh we're going to take that prize right down for you as well get yeah, off my tiara uh <laughs> lovely color on your citrine gems 6.95 yes please yes please citrine dream that's what it is isn't it that summertime special glow in there and can you see obviously we've threaded that onto a little bit of a uh, yellow um sort of thread if, if you want to obviously go against that you could imagine that with maybe a little bit of green thread through there it's worth trying because you're going to see the color of the thread coming mm. through it's got great clarity that's just no brainer for me citrine should be in everybody's jewelry stash because it works with so many different gems green's the obvious one but love that um well done to get straight in buying twos yeah why not absolutely lovely and a nice size to work with aren't they the four mil always lovely to have in your stash always gorgeous to sort of reach for the four millimeter gems down but such a, a, a spectacular example of how good citrine can look particularly the brazilian sauce when you're talking about the the the, the, the gem of beauty like this a brazilian beauty queen there for you uh, and it is a sprint to the finish line we haven't got long with you tonight it's the end of our sports day so we are literally the finish line is ahead we should have had a ribbon or something for the end of tonight shouldn't yeah. we that we could or have gone through flat. and a trophy yeah. and Checkered oh, well. flags. Checkered and... flags, the whole shit. Mm. Well, I've got a whistle. More... I don't know where I put my whistle, actually. Anyway, never mind. Uh, uh, £6.95. <laughs> <laughs> Chloe will be like, where's your whistle, Ruth? I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, right, let's keep going. Miss it, miss out. They're literally on and gone. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Garnet and sterling silver. These look amazing together. I'm going to put them on here. 
so you can see them a little bit better. These would, these would look fabulous with the tiaras. I know you've been mixing your silver and your gold, but it doesn't matter. There's no rule book, and if there was one, I'd rip it up. Uh, so, nine to five, sterling silver. <gasps> Actually, really nice on a ring as well. I know they're charms, but that would look lovely wire wrapped onto a ring. Really simple, but beautiful. And obviously, wire wrap those, pop those onto your necklaces. A little daisy chain on your neckline. You could drop them down onto your, uh, from your earrings as well. And of course, a suspend. So, a suspend? Suspend them from your bracelets. Um, Nine to five sterling silver, six ninety five, and that's crazy. When you consider what you can pay for a silver charm, I mean that is just mm. bonkers, isn't it? Mm -hmm. They look so beautiful. A couple of those on your neckline as well, on even just dropping down. If you were to just pop a little jump ring onto one of those and have that sort of dropping down from a chain, would look really, really pretty. But the garnets are gorgeous. You've got two uh, two carats of garnet per charm. That's a hectic amount, really, isn't it? When you consider it. They look lovely. A little beautiful flower drop there for six ninety five. They're really pretty, and of course natural. You gone. It's totally utterly natural. It won't take a treatment anyway. Uh, but very very good work on those. They are fabulous. Uh, that's my word of the evening. Uh, they actually look. I don't know if you can see it on there. They look really nice clustered together. I don't know if you'll see that. Look at those together. You can make a lovely design with linking those. They look fantastic. Can't really see that too well, but a little cluster, a little bouquet. They look gorgeous mm. actually together. Really nice work on those. Just don't have enough of those. They look really cute. Wonderful. Right, next up, let's do. Oh, I was just going to pick up number 10, Phil. There you go. Great minds. Summer jewellery. Silver jewellery. Silver jewellery, what am I talking about? Uh, silver wire wrapping on that one would look fantastic. I mean, that is a pendant and a half, isn't it? Your white chapel. This is so lovely. Look at the colours. Absolutely beautiful colours. So nice to work with. Really mm. tactile as well. And you can see that sort of dimension if I uh, sort of sort of turn it on its side. 50 by 40 millimetre on your white Charpel. Really nice size. <gasps> wow, that's a that's such a lovely price. Just, I mean, there's your pendant for your, for your holiday, isn't it? Straight away. That is just going to look fantastic against any skin tone, actually, whether it's sun-kissed or not, whether you're more sort of ivory of skin tone or darker of skin tone, that is just going to look fabulous. I mean, you could cradle that in, in your wire work, couldn't you? You could that literally or bed or set it. It's absolutely beautiful. Glorious colours. Really, really fab. Actually, even on a cuff, that would look amazing. Shibori. I mean, the, the, literally, literally the world's your oyster with your white shell pearl. Uh -huh. The world is your lobster, giving it all that. Uh, 3.95, very, very well done on those, gorgeous. Um, just such a, um, a phenomenon, really, because you get, you see all of the different waves and all the movement, actually, on the white shell pearl, but you just get so many amazing colours, obviously, uh, if you are familiar with it. it, can't, it the pinks and greens, just beautiful. It's like the, the gem that keeps on giving, quite frankly. It just doesn't stop giving you this dance of colour. They are lovely at 3.95. My giddy aunt. And um, I think we've got time for another star by, don't you? And then we had a fabulous day on our Sports Day Here event. Uh, sports Day Here event, Sports Day event here. I'll get it right. Uh, so let's bring you to you <laughs> one more, it's late, one more star by on our Sports Day. <laughs> These are so cute. Wow, great design on these. Right, have a little peek. I think you're going to love these. 9 to 5 sterling silver lattice earring post. But you've got some beautiful design. Aren't they cute? Very Aztec, actually, aren't they? Now, straight away, I want to drop down a little peridot from those. Um, I, instantly. I don't know what. I think it must be the design. I, I know I said quite Aztec, but I actually think quite... Um, Maybe quite Egyptian, very opulent. That's that's the, 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 the kind of the rule of thumb there. And when you think about your Peridot gemstone, obviously a very opulent gem as well, the two together, any gemstone, that's going to take really, really nicely. But you've got that fantastic design right at the top, that lovely lattice. It does bring with it, you've got your little loop at the bottom there. So you could, you could pop in a head pin and drop down gemstones. You could do, imagine those with the tassels. Now, I've got to do this. In fact, I want... Oh, right, OK, let's just put it with the white tassel. A lot of... Well, loads of the strands tonight have come with a little... Can you imagine those with the tassels? They'd look amazing. 
just dropping those down you could have a few gemstones actually in between couldn't you to just split those up <gasps> these are cute nice we like these jade. i was trying not to go there but yeah they would look amazing sorry. with the jade eye. sorry no yeah. it's, it's it's forgiven um you get three pairs obviously you've got your post and scroll there as well they are so cute but it's still with the lattice i'm just going to pop one of those out you could still so you can still weave through those you could still, if you wanted to add on a little bit of adornment to the gem, to the, to the lattice work, you could still do that as well if you wanted. Ultimately, I'm sure if you wanted to, you could clip off the post if you wanted to use those as a sort of almost like a little connector. There's lots you could do with those, but they are lovely. The lattice in there is fabulous. I've never seen these before. Gosh, these are popular. Wow. These I'm not are surprised at that. Brilliant price, isn't it? Mm. Nine pounds, basically. It's 8 95 We've got three pairs. That's genius. And they are silver, they're 95 sterling silver, but a lovely design, whether you choose to have that as kind of as a, as a teardrop, whether you cut off or snip off the, the post, uh, but great for, for the earrings to drop down, to have your tassels, long sort of chain link earrings. Uh, Winifred, Melanie, Catherine, Jennifer, Christine, and everybody that's checking out on those, well done you. Uh, right, I'm gonna take a quick sprint off. Over to, uh, to Karen, oh, you didn't see that, that's good. Um, have you had fun? I've had loads of fun. Thank you. It's been lovely. It's been really, nice, hasn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's been a lovely, lovely evening. It's Thank flown you. yet again. It has gone very say. quickly. Yeah. Four hours I've just really gone. enjoyed it. Thank you. Good. Well, you've done some wonderful pieces. And obviously, uh, the first kit with the seed beads, amazing, because it was the first time that Karen has ever done her seed I beading and did it, it very I so enjoy it. I love them. I it was love amazing. Let's have a quick beads. recap. Thank you, darling. Quick recap, we haven't got long, but we'll quickly bring in the details uh, on the Swarovski and the seed beads. With We can see all of it there. You've got so much on there. They were glorious in terms of the colours. Uh, you have the violet rainbow uh, super duos. You've got the Swarovski in there. Uh, you've got the, uh, well, there's loads of different colours. The top, which was amazing. That beautiful, beautiful collection. And... Um, do check out those. I've got quite a few of those in baskets still and at 19.95. Have a look at the yeah. details. They're, they're amazing. Absolutely. Can't miss those. They yeah. were just superb. And obviously then, of course, your kits for your tiaras, for your headbands uh, and your head combs. Hopefully you added those in as well. We are out of time this evening. It's gone super, super quickly. It has quickly. gone very, very quickly. Zoomed. We hope Thank to see you again very shortly. And yes. I hope to see you again very soon. Do you know yeah. your dates yet? 10th of August. My 10th next of August. A mid. There we go. 10th of August mid-shift. I'll be back with you on a mid next Friday, I think. Um, could be different. But thank you so <laughs> much for your company. Take care. Have a fabulous weekend. It's going to be amazing here at Jury Maker. Bye. Bye. Buying from Jury Maker couldn't be easier. When we bring an item to you, all the graphics come on screen. And this gives you all the information that you